Hello YouTube, welcome once again to another episode of the 2023 Retro Horror Streamathon featuring Resident Evil. Now today it's the turn of Resident Evil Co Veronica X on PlayStation 2, a game I have literally never played. It's a running trend in this channel that I've never played these games. However, I genuinely have never played this game. Um, I haven't even... Uh, like the others it's not like i've played them uh years and years ago and now i'm just playing them again with a fresh pair of eyes i've literally never even loaded this game up so i'm excited we've got i think claire redfield who from the intro sequence is made out to now be like a bit of a badass like joe valentine we've got character as yet unnamed i don't know and a spooky looking character in the back with shades on who probably going to end up being wesker almost guarantee it so yeah We've played through a lot of the other Resident Evils. It's time for Code Veronica X. You know how YouTube works by now. I'm not going to try and tell you what to do. So buckle up, stay spooky, and let's get down. That's a little, 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 little. I'm going to try that last bit again. <laughs> so you know how YouTube works right now. I don't need to explain that to you. So without further ado, let's dive straight in. Resident American Midwestern town, Raccoon City, has been completely decimated due to the T-virus outbreak that was instigated by the international corporation Umbrella. Claire Redfield, who arrived in Raccoon City to search for her lost brother Chris and a rookie police officer, Leon S. Kennedy, managed to escape from the city. But their ordeal was only a prelude of things to come. Three months later. So three months after Resident Evil 2. Your identification number is WKD4496. <sighs> Welcome to your new home. Oof. Her name is Claire Redfield. We caught her trespassing in her Paris lab facility 10 days ago. She apparently infiltrated the complex looking for her lost brother, Chris Redfield, one of the surviving members of RPD's famous STARS teams. <laughs> Big red barrel. <sighs> you seem to have dropped your gun. So we, we did actually get caught then. That's unfortunate. And now we're in the bunker? Prison cell?
It's so spooky. It's so... Oh, hello. If I were equipped with a lighter, I could see outside. Right. Who wants to place a bet that this is a zombie? Who wants to place a bet that this is a zombie? <laughs> Since I can't press any buttons. I, was, I wasn't pressing others. Look at our fancy inventory screen. I've got... Oh, look, we've got a, a playing manual. And we've got a lighter. You, equip. Equip. That's an odd sentence. That's it, it, it true. <laughs> Hi, aren't you the guy that pointed the gun at me? <laughs> How smooth everyone's face is. Everyone's face is well smooth. A generational leap between PS1 and PS2. This prison's been taken over. Well, it's better to be wiped out. What are you saying? You're free to leave the complex. But you may as well know you have no chance of getting off this island. And what about you? What are you going to do? Don't worry about me. Ooh, that voice acting. Oh, that's good. Okay, I'll, I'll mean, I'll try not to worry about you. I'm, I'm going to worry a little bit, but I'll try not to worry about you. Um, Claire, you appear to be making footstep noises, but you're not actually doing anything. <laughs> she was done off. She wouldn't be a red field if she didn't do that move. Uh, that's true. That's very true. I'd laugh if those canisters were empty and she just looks silly shooting some empty canisters while everyone just looks around. I was like, this is this is canister disposal. Like <laughs> you came here to the junkyard. <laughs> bullets. Handgun bullets. There's no easy mode on this one, is there? Uh, a hemostatic capsule is on the floor. It's empty. Oh, okay. I mean, it looks very interactable. I'm not going to lie. Is there anything in my prison cell? Have we, have we tried to go more horror than survival horror with Code Veronica? Oh, herbs. It's just random herbs growing in the, in the corner of the cell. Will you take the green herb? Yes. Is there another one? There's only one. There can only be one. Uh, eh? Oh, a knife. A knife. Will you take the combat knife? Yes. Oh, hang on. That did nothing. That did nothing. There's a there's a button on my retro tank that does like filters. It's like a more a sharper filter or not because that menu. I don't know if it's coming through or not. The dithering on that menu is quite is quite bad because of the equipment I'm using. So this is one of the reasons why I don't delve at the minute too far in. Excuse me, into um, uh, PS2 titles, but it is what it is. Okay, so like on here it looks fine. How do you know I'm not just going to, like, stab you for kidnapping me? Uh, it's a list of prisoners. My name is at the end. WKD. It's a horrible drink. 4496, Claire Redfield. The escort's name is at the end of the document. Umbrella Medical, Paris. Third security unit leader, Rodrigo Juan Raval. <laughs> I don't know why that name's funny. <laughs> Lot, many people have three names. I have three names. Many people have the, a middle name. N mine is not Juan, though. Is this run? No, is this... Oh, you've changed the run button. 
What's the menu oh. button? Oh, that's the. Oh well, I've got a. I have a map button at least now, which is nice. That's not a knife. This is a knife. What do you have there? A knife. No. Oh look, an ink ribbon with a cockroach on it. Lovely. Will you take the ink ribbon? Yes. I certainly shall. I am not going to save it right now. You can say your progress here with this. We're we using it. No. Uh, why is there no very somber save music? I I don't like that. There's no save room music. Anything here? No. Okay. Okay. Now I I am aware because we checked on the last stream how long this game is. Heartbeat. That's ominous. Why is there a heartbeat? Why do I need to know? Why do I need to know if there's a heartbeat? Like, I, that, that's a little worrying now. This is his cardio for Clark. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Did you saw this fucking action packed move she was doing earlier. What's happened here? A truck used to transport. Oil is leaking from the crashed wreck. A dead body and a briefcase can be seen inside. Can I take the briefcase? I don't get too much about the dead body. I'm, if it's leaking oil, I'm not going to stand there holding a light in it, right? I'm also very impressed that this light is still working in the wind and the rain. I've... Oh, dear. Oh, I know well, that solved that problem, didn't it? Oh, no. You appear to be on fire, sir. Sir, do you need medical assistance? <laughs> do you need medical attention, sir? It's very dark. Oh, God. It's a cinema zombie. It's Gollum. Come back for his precious. Oh, rise and shine. <laughs> Why are you all naked? Who's burying naked people in this cemetery? Come on, Claire, you were full of you were full of sexy moves earlier. Come on. Please don't give me control now. Oh, go on then, give us a hug. I'm just gonna run. I do what normal people do in this situation, just like it. I don't even know if I should have been given a gun at this point. I've got a knife. I didn't speak to to Captain Moody Pants, did I? That's what I didn't do. Wow. Oh. All right, mate. Ooh, gun. Wah. Don't you? Who are you? Huh? You're not a zombie. Well, great. Wait right there. I'm coming over. I'm, I'm sorry. Are we are we recruiting a a twelve year old boy? This. Did you jump out of that tower? I'm sorry about that little misunderstanding. But I thought Psycho. you were one of those monsters. All right, Shut mate. Up. Make one wrong move and I'll shoot. Yeah. That's beautiful. I said I was sorry. Oh, good. It's a sleaze. I was a prisoner on this island. I wonder why. And I'm guessing you're not from Umbrella either. No, I'm Claire. Claire Redfield. Claire? Hmm. Nice. Hmm. Nice. I remember that. Once I find it, I can finally escape from this crazy island. Well, I'll see ya. Hey, wait up! I don't want you following me, lady. You'll only slow me down. Down. 
Really slow me down. Wow. He sounds like the worst person. But I don't, I've got a handgun now, at least. So that's good. Everything's live. Everything's good. We're all good. All is right with the world. Excellent stuff. Apart from that, I have my preview on, so all I keep doing is looking at my stupid face. Anyway, um, so if you are watching this on other platforms, just a quick FYI, if you are watching this on other platforms, the main platform is Twitch. Twitch.tv forward slash peripheral mic, right? If you're watching this on Twitter, YouTube, Facebook, Kick, that sort of thing. It's a mirror, so you won't see your chat messages on there. I'll still see your chat messages. I'll still interact with them as and when I can, but you won't see your chat messages on there. What you want to do if you want to chat and see your name up here is you want to go over to twitch.tv forward slash peripheral mic. Um, so, yeah, that's just a quick FYI. I'm multi-streaming now because Twitch has lifted that, that uh, limitation. It's probably one of the last streams I'll actually mention that on because everyone seems to know about it now. So. Apparently, a dust box. Cool. Oh, I, oh no, I keep pressing the wrong button. I gotta change. I gotta see if I can change my controls. <laughs> Don't shoot, despite having fired dozens, if not hundreds, of rounds at you. Yeah. Uh, controller setup. Can I? Yes, that's probably what I want. Is there a C? No, not that. As a tab. There's, 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 there's three button control. That one. That one just changes. OK and run, doesn't it? Yeah, that's that's what I want. I want control type B. Screen setup, monitor adjust, vibration. Yeah, that's fine. Exit. Uh. What are we? What are we doing? Did I say exit? Is this like say this? You're just saving my preferences, right? Securing space. I mean, this might take a second. This might take longer than I thought. Oh, so, my God. Oh, so now it's secured the space. Now it's saving it. Right. God. Yes, PS2 memory cards were weird. This is actually my original PS2 memory card. Uh, it's completely nailed down. It is impossible to open it. See, I automatically went for the right button then. That's that's what I want. Uh, nope. That's where I came from. Don't want that. Absolutely don't want that. Oh, I was going to say something. I can't remember what it was. Uh, what was I going to try to say? Yep, yeah, no, can't remember. Can't remember. Obviously, I mean, it was obviously very important, but I definitely can't remember what it was. Actually, we do want to go back. I want to know what's in this thing. So we're going to go and uh, shoot some zombies. Is the answer 42? The answer is always 42, Camus. Oh, Camus, I made you a VIP recently. I don't know if you saw your little symbol change, um, but you I remember you did a thing that was really nice for people and so I made you a VIP. I, do, I can't remember what that does, but I, I wanted to let you know. Just in case you wonder why. I had a note in my phone for a while saying make Catmus VIP, um, but I couldn't remember. No, you definitely did. You definitely did a thing. You did something I'm like, uh, that's really nice. I need to, I need to make sure Catmus knows that was really nice. It may have just been like signposting new visitors, do you know what I mean, or signposting raiders or something like that. But it was, you weren't you weren't prompted or expected to do it, so I, I appreciate that. Well, I fire quicker, but I mean, I must remember I'm not. I definitely haven't got unlimited ammo. Naps are rewarded. Naps are yeah. Naps are rewarded. Naps are rewarded with naps. <laughs> that's what that's what we reward naps with. Why are you looking over here, Claire? Uh, he is not breathing. <laughs> Doesn't mean he's not going to come back to life. Okay, so what's over? Oh, I don't like the sudden change in camera angle like that. That's not very nice at all. 
It's a central gate to the prison. It's locked. There, a hawk's picture is carved into the center. Okay. Maybe. Maybe he is alive and just practicing his stream up here. Who knows? Ooh, there's a herb there. Can I pick it up through here, please? Is that a thing I can do instead? No. Fine. There you go. Right, go pick up this herb. We'll mix the herbs as well for when we get super duper injured. And also it saves on inventory space because I only have eight inventory spaces. Like some sort of peasant in this. Great. Oh no, that's no, that's the wrong button, isn't it? I kept doing this with the other one. Well, it makes the herbs. Yes, thank you. So I just wasted the herbs. That was cool, right? That was very cool. Awesome. Now I'm now I'm super duper healthy. I probably had a little bit of health missing from being bitten by a few zombies, but. Yeah, now I'm now I'm super. Oh, hello. Uh, Claire, 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 Claire. Fuck sake, Claire. Jesus Christ, get off me! Get off me, you scoundrel! Get off! How many bullets do you take? Nope, I'm out. What's this? Is this bullets? Good. You've taken the hang of bullets. Excellent. Do you want to mix the herbs in your stomach by immediately consuming both of them? Yes. <laughs> I'm using circle as cancel. That's the reason. Half eating food, half eating food, half eating food. Is there anything in here? There's a bog. Toilet has some rather disgusting stains and a horrible smell lingers. Excellent. I'm not sure why that was necessary. She's going here. This might not be. Wait, was this where I went in? No, this isn't where I went in. Absolutely not. Hello. Hello, mate. What? I do. Let me just. Oh, I need to use this, don't I? This is the men this is the manual. Playing manual. Yeah, got it. Thanks. Put that away. Lovely. Playing manual. Uh yeah. No. <laughs> where is my where is my cursor? It's on map. Understood. Uh equip this. Nope. Okay, sweet. You are you are dead, dead. Her ponytail is surprisingly light, almost floating when you do when you move as much as an inch. Yeah. Prisoner's diary. May thirteenth. This room stinks of death. Based upon the information I found, I believe that I'm far south of the equator. Lucky for me, the Bob in the bunk below me is one of those interesting type of guys. Today, Bob told me some crazy story of where he was put in this place with me. Bob said that he used to be an attendant at the head of this place. This boss, named Alfred, uh, supposedly placed him in here because of his tiny little mistake. What does that mean? What's going to happen to me? Without warning, a group of military men took Bob to the building behind the guillotine stand. At midnight, I snuck out there to see him. I've been hearing that uh, that anyone taken to that building ne never comes back. On top of that, there are these really large plastic bags constantly being removed from that place. I better pray for Bob. Really large body-shaped black bags. <laughs> I was wrong. I shouldn't have gone there. What is going on there? All I could hear was some insanely creepy laughter and the sound of Bob screaming. I don't know what to do. I can't stop thinking about it. What's going to happen to me? I can't get, I can't let in. I just can't. I can't let in. Let it. I just can't. Sorry. Since my last injury, all of my fellow inmates have been taken to that building. I know that I'm next. 
It's obvious that we're all here to be used as Alfred guinea pigs. There's no way out. What am I going to do? I don't know. What are you going to do? Uh, can I just change that? There we go. Cool. I have the viewer number on OBS because I've got... Uh, what is it even called? Restream on OBS. And I'm just like, I don't like that. I don't like seeing how many people I'm playing for. What are you... Claire, what are you looking at here? You're clearly looking at a thing. You're just looking at what you think is interesting. Does the ponytail move quite a lot? Oh, yeah, the ponytail does move quite a lot, doesn't it? Pick up these bullets. Oh, Lord. Wow, the hitbox on that shelf is amazing. Oh, you're so going to come through the window. Ah, yeah. You're all right. Okay. You appear to have also just dropped a gun. So I'm just going to equip that. I'm just going to quickly reload it. Then I'm going to just nip back here, turn back around, and... Oh, God, there's more than one of them. Get fucked. Oh, you're all alive now. Come on. Right. What's the shiny on the floor? Because it looked like a gun. It's M's 100P. I've taken M100. Is that machined pistols? I bet that one's alive too. If only I had an herb. Uh, it appears to be toiletries. They've all been used up and are worn out. Ugh. At least we can take a disgusting shower. That echo, I, not echo echo, not you echo in chat, but the echo I can hear in the game there sounds a little bit like fireworks outside my house. Yep, sure thing. I keep hearing echo, you hear me. You sound like Batman. I think that's that room sorted. Good. Uh, good, good to see you. Oh, you, would you give it a rest, Dave? God damn it, Dave. What's this? Uh, prison map? Was that? You've taken the prison map. Lovely. Uh, it seems that someone didn't finish their soup. It's still a bit warm. And the award for pointless dialogue line goes to... Nope. Go away. Go away. Go away. Thank you. Right, what's up here? Is that shiny? Nope. Is there... I, I feel I'm backing myself metaphorically and literally into a... Oh, there's a herb. Cool. I can heal myself slightly when I get bitten to death. Right. Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you friendly? Are you... How did you die? Harping foods. Right, let's leave here a second. Because now I can't think of another room we haven't been in. I mean, there's obviously going to be one. But I can't think of one off the top of my head in this game what I've never played. Oh, we've not been that way. That's exactly... Oh, God. Don't introduce things that crawl right now. This could be my first game. Oh, is that a thing? Uh, abandoned materials are piled up here. Nothing useful. I guess so. Oh. Uh -oh. Bye, Larry. I'ma just keep away from those openings. Keep away from ominous openings. There, it's been locked from the other side with a padlock. It can't be open from this side. Okie dokie. I'm not going to try them.
Oh, man. Oh, I'm excited for next Friday. I've got loads and loads of indie horror games to play. Might have a bit of a... Oh, hello. Might have a bit of a horror game showcase next Friday. Get off. I'm thinking going back to um, Pokemon Blue is going to be a... I don't know if that's going to be a scheduled thing or an as and when thing. Would you get off, David? And you. Don't you start, you fucking inappropriate Andy. Uh, oh no, I keep pressing the wrong button for Healy's. Uh, I'm at caution. Let's just use that. It's easier. Yeah. Oh, dear. Ooh, you're watching Operation Napoleon. Oh, no! I just got fucking vexed. I wasn't paying attention. Sure, door. Perhaps I can open with the switch on the left. Sure. Why not? Yeah. It appears to be locked. I must release the lock first. Okay. Shoot me in the nuts. Shoot me in the nuts. Chip, get off me. I was shooting you in the nuts. Ooh, they slump. Lovely. That's cool. I won't be too shocked if we get some crashes in this. Because, oh, the release switch for the metal detector deactivation lamp is on. Okay, does that mean it's going to work? Please deposit any metallic item you have in the security box. Are you having a laugh? No. Oh, my God. Right, fine. I don't even know if this is going to work now. Metal, 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 metal. Metal? There. Oh. Yeah, push. There's literally nothing. I can chuck an ink ribbon at them, that's Please it. Deposit I have done. Items you have in the security Shut box. up, I have done. I don't have anything metallic on me. An ink ribbon is not metallic. Oh, maybe it is. Maybe the bit in the center is. Finish my tea. It's always really strong. Wow, that's some strong tea. Alrighty, so. I don't know why this one... Actually, no, I do know why this one. Uh, I never played this one. I never played this one because during the PS2 era, I was at um, high school. I was at college. And I didn't... Do I get to take my items out now? No, I don't. Um, I was at uh, college, and I had no money. <laughs> so I didn't get to play... One, I didn't get much time to play games. And two, um, I definitely didn't get time to play more, uh, buy more than one at a uh, time. And I'd say a time would probably be... Like... Six months, a year, maybe two games a year, that sort of thing. Uh, 3D Duplicator Users Manual. Our new product, the 3D Duplicator, consists of two parts. The 3D Scanner scans an object. Simply place the material that you want to have scanned into the tray into the scanner. The scanned object will be processed into 3D data, which will be transferred to the duplicated proportion. Uh, portion, even. If you place the material you wish to have converted on the machine, you can begin conversion based on the 3D data that was created by the 3D scanner. So it's 3D printing. Scan it and print it. The result will be an object precisely true to the original. Got it. So what? This is the activation switch where you push it. Yes. So it's an item duplicator? Like, is that what's happening? Please place material you wish to have scanned on the scanner portion of this machine. I mean, you all know I'm going to try a first aid spray, right? That's 
because one, it's the only item I've got in my pocket. Two, uh, it didn't work. I mean, I'm healed now, but it didn't work. An auto duplicator. The machine materials are set if you restore the object. Okay. So I don't think I have what is necessary for that. Ooh, grenade rounds. Oh, flame rounds. I mean, still grenade rounds. It's unfortunate that we didn't get to use all of the hundreds and hundreds of grenade rounds we made. B.O.W. gas rounds. Wow, harsh. Um, it's unfortunate that we didn't get to use all of the hundreds and hundreds of grenade rounds we made last night in uh, Resident Evil 3. We used a fair few of them, though, to be honest. Okay, so what's through here, then? I don't really understand what I have to duplicate there. And now I'm weaponless as well. Is that everyone's grandma typing an email? Sounds like it. Fax on the facility access application. Be sure to verify the content of the following facility access application form and add the applicant's name to the expected visitor list. Chief Prison Guard Room, Paul Steiner. I hereby apply for access permission to prison area D. Details follow. Visitor's name, Carl Grisham. Purpose of entry, carrying in the following materials. New product sample from Metal Industries Co. TG01 and various daily commodities ordered by the pr ordered by the prison. N uh, note one: I will use a transportation truck. Two: TG01 sample will be stored in a designated briefcase. That'll be the briefcase. Oh, hi again. Chris Red here. Yep. Oops. What are you doing here? Homework, by the look of it. Red here. Is he a relative of yours or something? Yes. You mean my brother? Ah. Your sibling. Well, it seems your brother is under surveillance by Umbrella. What? I mean, that's not a surprise, right? <laughs> At this point. I've got to contact Leon and tell him to let my brother know he's being monitored. It's a good thing I have access to an outside connection from here. Well, that file shows the latitude and longitude of this place. Handy. <laughs> Why don't you send your brother the coordinates and ask him to come help? Thanks. I'll do that. Hey. I was just kidding. <laughs> There's no way he could get here, even if he is your brother. Yes, he can. I'm sure of it. I'm not sure who's a bigger child no here. Way. He won't come. You'll just end up disappointed if you rely on others. Believe me, I know. Oh, oh, bit of bit of story exposition there. Who's this weirdo? Uh, I actually can't remember. Uh, Steve? Is his name Steve? God damn it, Steve. <laughs> hmm. uh, oh. The Hawk emblem. But I won't be able to take that out of here, will I? The email to Leon has already been sent. Lovely. Cavalry's on the way. What is this? Are you genuinely telling me this bright yellow fucking clipboard isn't interactable? This ink ribbon will be there. Is it please just be one ink ribbon? Oh no, it's three. This is uh, emo Steve. <laughs> Ooh, I get to select a memory card. Or do not save. I'll select memory card one. Because it's the only one I've got. <laughs> Excellent. No underscore data. I like that we've gone back to the aggressive hammering of the keys. <laughs> right, what were you fucking around with here, kid? The lock release device. Pull the lever up. I'm sure. I don't know what that did, but I'm sure it's done. The door is being held by something. I can't open it from the side. Okay. Oh, I wanted to do a quick turn then. That didn't work. 
Yeah, that's emo Steve. We don't talk to emo Steve too much. Right, so if I use this here, start. Let me check this first. Can I rotate stuff? Oh, I can rotate stuff in this one. Nice. An emblem card with a hawk symbol. It appears to be made out of pure gold. Pure gold. If you use this. Yeah, there we go. We're going to make a plastic version. Right. Well, I assume it's to be a plastic version anyway. A non-metallic version. Honestly thought that was going to be the old dial-up tone. <laughs> 3D data transmission complete. Right. Do the do your thing. And I'll do if the materials are set, I can restore the. Oh, I need materials. Got it. Three days been printed. Oh, bums. I need some sort of material. Where is, where is 3D material? I need, I need some. Is it resin that I need? Please deposit I'm any going ID to. You have in the security box. Don't worry, I'm gonna. Uh, if I remember the buttons. So you're gonna want this. Oh god, no, I need to interact with the box. There we go. You're gonna want this. And this. And this. There you go. And now I'm gonna wonder. Take the metal items you place in the security box with you. Okay, thank you very much. Now I'm going to wonder where I get... Resin. No, I don't want to put that back in there. Uh, 3D printing material from... And a lighter, lovely. Thank you. Right, I'm, I'm just going to go. So that's the thing we need to remember. We need to remember we can 3D print the Hawk medallion when we go there. I should probably oh, equip a gun. Why does that say use? Hang on. There's no use using that now. I got a little worried there for a second. Right, undoubtedly you're going to bust through. Oh, you didn't. Wow, I'm impressed. Well done. Uh, uh, which way have we not been? Oh, no, that's the option screen. I want the map screen. We have not been... This way? Oh, it's completely nailed down. It's impossible to open it. Okay. Which way have we not been? Where have we not been? Okay. Oh, God. I'm not, I'm not a big fan of this. I'd quite like them to be... Oh, cool. It tells me where there's items, save points, and item boxes. That's nice. Um, so that, I'm assuming that red shiny means locked. Uh, I've been in there. I've been in there. I've not been that way. Uh, I've not been down there. But I think down there takes me... Oh, Lord. Down there takes me down there. And that was where I started originally. I wonder if I need to go in here. Ah, I affected the switch to me. Surprise, surprise. You've got zombies in your eyes. Kablamo. Wasting, wasting gun, gun rocks now. And you, mate. Anyway, where were we? <laughs> Ooh. A fire a fire extinguisher. Oh, for the thing. For the fire, obviously. You take the fire extinguisher. Lovely. Lovely, lovely. Right, so let's go back to the fire. Oh, what was in here now? Got any goodies for me? Or is it just... Ugh. Oh, a padlock key. Why do all padlock keys in this game look like this? In these games, I should say. There's an indentation of a bl indigo blue plate. That's the two words that mean the same thing. Sorry to spoil it for you. Guillotine with uh, with blood. There seems to be some fresh blood on it. Something seems to have been tied up here. Fresh blood is stuck on the wall. A person might have been tied to the pillar. Gross. I hate it here. 
I thought Umbrella was bad before. I don't really see evidence of their war crimes, thanks. Why ominous music? Oh, there was a there was a crawly crawly something. That. Oh, it was a dog. It's okay, it's just dogs. It's fine. We're fine. We're fine, how are you? You are slightly faster than me, but I can I can serpentine, so. So fuck you, pups. <laughs> Right, I need someone on fire. Oh, good, you're here. <laughs> Serpentine. Serpentine. Uh, yes, this way. Do you all come back to life, or is this just a special occasion? Did I miss you earlier? Oh, piss. Oh, yeah, no, I think it was just a, a one-off. Well, no, maybe it wasn't. Oh god, I didn't realize that gravestone was so big. I'm out of ammo. I'm out of all my ammo. This is not good. I'm going to have to use whatever this is. Cool. Can I change that? Can I just use one? Nope, I can't. Thank you. I'm literally handguns akimbo. Right, I don't really need to attack you. Ow! Oh, don't burn to death. That's really embarrassing. Do this. Oh, there was a padlock for the other side of that thing, wasn't there? Good, then get this. Get quickly. Quicker than that. Suitcase. Yes, take the briefcase. Lovely. Now get out of here. Get off me, you fucking weirdo. Uh, yeah, this way. Good, this way. Uh, where was the... Lo well, actually, now I've got a second. Let me just check this briefcase. Uh, check briefcase. Go on, unlock it. There's a button where you push it. Yes. What's this? We've got TG01 was inside the briefcase. Uh, there was also an explanation document for the special alloy TG01. TG01 product description. Here at TG01. <laughs> Thank you for your continued support and for using our products. Uh, this time we have gathered our most advanced technologies and succeeded in creation, creating a unique anti-metal detection alloy TG01. It cannot be detected by any metal detectors. It cannot be pictured by retinography. Uh, re re special cameras at the immigration check. It's lightweight yet durable. We plan to develop various weapons utilizing this innovative new alloy. We have enclosed a sample for you to review. We look forward to hearing from you regarding possible business opportunities. Metal Industries Co. Chief Development Planning, Carl Redhill. Carl Redhill. Carl Redhill. I thought that was the name of someone in one of the other games. I don't think it is, though. I'm just going to go this way. Now, wanna, I think the door near the dogs had a padlock. A padlock lock in it, didn't it? I don't want to have to gun you boys down. Because it's a fucking waste of ammunition, I'll be honest with you. Audio glitch noise then. Player, you could definitely run a little bit faster. Okay, so we're on the other side of the padlock. Cool. There's no need to use this right now. Okay, so I can't use that. And now I'm going to get fucking munched on. There we go. We only got one bite. That's fine. Oh, no. We're in Uh, This way. It in here. Please deposit 
any metallic items I forgot found about this bit. In the security box. No, I will do, thank you. Uh, yep, yeah, use security box. Deposit, 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 deposit. Oh, no, I need that, don't I? Oh, no, I need to get rid of my lighter. Otherwise, it'll have a fit. Hey, that is actually undetectable by my metal detectors. That's fun. So go over here. Was that herb on the table? No, it wasn't. It was uh, a trick of the eye. Uh, uh, start. This task can take me a few seconds to, a few times to remember that. Uh, use this. Yeah. Yeah. Excellent. Don't think I, I don't think I should be looking at that directly. I think she's definitely wearing some sort of eyewear. Cool. Duplication complete. I don't think we needed that screen. We could take the special alloy emblem. Yes. Thanks. Right. Oh, goody. You've all arrived. Oh, get knotted, mate. And and you. Go on. Piss off. I don't want a free hug. Take the metal items with you. Oh, okay. I would love to, if you let me. Uh, no need to pause it since it's not metal. Oh, lovely. I'm on the wrong bit of the screen. Thanks. Lighter. That gun, that, that. Don't swap them, just take them out. There we go. And we were in love with the fruits. Okay, so where was the hawk room? Uh, was it that du big double door there? So if I go left a bit through that door and then do a do a Yui. Uh, oh, oh no, it's oh that's uh, that's a shortcut past those dogs. That's what that is. I see. It's nice that it told me that. It's not what well, I say told me. It didn't tell me that. It's nice that it's highlighted that. I actually think I might need to... I'm on caution at the minute. I'll just equip this. Yeah, I'll just, I'll just get rid of him. Oh, you're there. <laughs> you can actually just use that as quick travel. So this would go, this padlock key would go back here. I didn't realize there was a back here, I'll be honest. Yeah, so there is. Uh, it's locked with a padlock. We use a padlock key. Yes. Oh, are these going to be like the little keys? The small keys from Resident Evil 2. Like, you can use them anywhere, but where you use them, like, that's, that's where you use them. But you can only use them in certain places. It's like, you get, like, five keys, but there's ten locks to undo. So you got to pick which one. Uh, I'm lost. I'm turning right. I'm turning right. Why do you ask me if I want to use certain items sometimes and not others? That's really quite annoying. Hooray! We're free. Game over. <laughs> That's it. We're out of here. Uh, well, I go back up. There might be something in that car. I cannot proceed from this side. Oh, okay, maybe there's not. Push the car over. <laughs> Ooh, bullets. Plant, plant. Oh, herbs. Lovely. I'll take some of those. Is that something on the left of that that weird box? Hello, my arms on my chair. Oh, he's better. Mm. 
No, it's not. It's just a. It's just weird graphics. Is this a job for? Oh dear. Oh god. Is this a job for fire extinguisher? No, apparently not. Did I say used fire extinguisher then? Empty extinguisher. What on earth am I carrying this for? <laughs> this better have a purpose. You can't take any more items right now. Fuck it out. Uh, okay. Use that. Be fine. <laughs> now grab that. Yes. Excellent. Now reload that. And then we'll be even better. We'll be better, better. Better, better. Uh, okay, so I'm going to push that one forwards. I'm going to guess. I don't think this is as complicated as it looks. Yeah. And then uh, I guess I'm going to push it right. Push it this way. On this. I don't know where I'm going after this. Oh, I'm going this way. I see, I see. Stare animations. No loading screens for me. Oh. I had to say it, didn't I? Um, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just avoid you two. Uh, it is securely closed. I cannot open it. Right. This one's not then. Oh, good, more dogs. Seems to have stopped on the lower floor. I can't use the lift. Okay. Does the button not work? Oh god, there's a dog right behind me. Okay, hey, what is this way? <laughs> My cat's watching the stream. More importantly, my cat sat there weirdly watching chat <laughs> for some reason. No, try not to rub your face against the memory card, matey. <laughs> we take the red hook. Yes. Yes, so it makes the hooks. Lovely. Yeah, <laughs> talking to him by a cat in it. What are you coming up me for? I'm I'm streaming, mate. I know. I know. This is my cat's tooth hitting the microphone. Oh, get off. What is this? This is bowgun arrows. Sure, why not? That's a zombie tooth hitting Claire's foot. That's true. The map of this building is shown on the monitor. It seems I can print it out. Print it. Yeah, sure. I assumed I was still in the prison. I didn't need to try and reconnect the printer once. Technically eight bullets I just took. Hey, the training center map. Yeah. Uh, all right. What does it look like? Uh, it's got some pretty chunky rooms. Military training facility. All right. So there's another one in here somewhere. Wait, is there anything in these drawers? Oh, Lord. 
these tank controls. The turning oh, is it's secured with a simple lock. If only we had the master of a locking with us, Claire. If only we had Jill Valentine with us. Security related documents are found here. There's nothing useful. Okay, let's well, pass this. This doofus. Hey, green herb. But I cannot take anything else right now. Use it now. Oh, interesting. Uh, no. But that's an excellent inclusion. Thanks. Uh, I can't take it. Will I use it? No. All right. Are you now blocking the door? You're pretty much blocking the door. Anything here? I'm going to be really annoying ceiling fan. Uh, what's this? Uh, it's a storage warehouse. It's locked. And it seems it needs a special key to release the lock. Any more stuff? No, so I can't. I, there was no reason to come in here. Oh, other than the map. I mean, the map is pretty decent reason. And we need to remember the uh, uh, What's it called? Herb, isn't it? So, what does it say on my map in regards to that now? It doesn't tell me there's any items in there, which is weird. Because the other, the other map did. Oh, wait. Exchange. Exchange what? Aha. Yeah, no, it doesn't tell me there's an item in there. Lying to me. You're a big fat phony. Card reader, silver in colour. It's electronically locked. Call over a cab. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. I mean, in fairness, that was the worst time to move away from my desk. Oh, vending machine's broken. Can we not get a cold glass of veterinarian Rosso? <laughs> I'm not thirsty right now. Oh, I could go for a veterinarian Rosso. Nothing of interest here. Nothing of interest here. Nothing of interest here. Nothing of interest here. Okay. Nothing of interest. Oh, get off. Nothing. Nothing of interest. Nothing of interest. Presumably nothing of interest. It didn't actually say anything. Uh, you appear to not be a zombie, but you are a dead body, so you normally have something on you. Take the bowgun dart. Bow, bowgun arrows. I can't, why is there a bowgun in this game? That's that's a wild prospect. <laughs> Let's go through this door. I'll just rearrange my feet a bit. Sauna. Ow, no! You spent too long in there, friend. Far too long in this sauna. Uh, There's it's a lot of hot air inside. Cool. That was pointless. Wait, can I, could I have shut this? No. It doesn't look like there's anything over there. And I... Oh, I can, I can just jump into the pool randomly. That's cool. Look at the water physics. Hello? What are you, what are you doing? A device controls the water current. Uh, stop the water current. Yeah. There's no response. It seems to be broken. Somewhere there should be a circulation pipe. Is it this? Nope. Is it over here? Nope. I'm looking for a pipe. I'm looking for... Oh, hello. The... Uh, yeah. This is just going to be me wandering around, faffing with a lot of infrastructure I don't understand, to be honest. Part of me thinks that jacket is Chris Redfield that she's then chopped the arms off of. Uh, it's, it's broken, right, sweet. What's this? It's a key, but I can't take it right now. I'm going to have to use my bloody healing item, aren't I? I mean, I do need it, so I don't mind too much, but still. Take the key with tag. Awesome. What does the tag say? Uh, check. Key with tag. Small key made of steel with the word storage. Lovely. Wait, if I go back to items and I check this. The empty fire extinguisher. I must fill it with ex 
extinguishant before I can use it. Is that a word? Extinguishant? I thought that was a word. Is that a herb under there? Or just a weird blob? It's just a weird blob, isn't it? I'm not venturing too far. far more. I'm not venturing too much further into there. I would talk. Ow. Sod off, mate. No, oh, I got past him. <laughs> There's an open locker there. Is there anything in it? <gasps> there is. It's Bogondars. Don't understand what. I don't understand this. So does that mean this locker could be open as well? Yes, we've got Bogondars. I cannot imagine a worse weapon to have in a zombie apocalypse than a fucking bow gun. <laughs> Just, I can't, I can't picture it. Anything worse. Where was the, um, oh, where was the storage room that we wanted? Where was it? Where was it? Oh, it was over here, wasn't it? Uh, ah. In, in here? Extinguishing is a word. According to uh, Merriam-Webster, an agent such as water that extinguishes fire. Well, uh, today I have learned a thing. I have learned that extinguishant is a thing. Daryl did fine. Hey, Greeny Green, how you doing? Uh, Daryl did fine. I'm assuming that's a Walking Dead reference. I have not watched The Walking Dead. That's a lie. I've watched one episode of The Walking Dead and I found it insanely tedious. So I just... I have very short attention span for television anyway, and that just did not scratch an itch. Uh, there. Maybe it's going to be great. I hope it is. I really hope it is. You don't need this key anymore. Discard the storage key. Sure. It didn't even have a... What do you... It didn't even have a bowgun in it. Bowgun powder? That's not how you make darts. Like, it's not... That's not how weapons are made. Just because it worked in the last game doesn't mean it's going to work in this one with arrows. Uh, start. Check it. What does it do? Yep, got that. Thanks. This is gunpowder for the bow gun arrow. That doesn't. That doesn't tell me what it is. What does it do? Do I combine it? Ah! Gunpowder arrows. Okay, check this. Okay. An iron bow gun arrow combined with gun. So explosive arrows is what. That's probably the term you're looking for there. Is exploded boomsticks. Boom matches. Boom twigs. Yes! I knew we'd get her in the end. Boom twigs. Uh, where the fuck am I going? I've been through there. I can't go through there because it's locked. And we need a silver key card. A card that's silver in nature. Uh, I can get I can get there. I think. At the bottom. You got the fire arrows. Da 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 da. <laughs> Johnny, I'm, I'm realizing now I need to move my GoXLR because it's got all of my soundboard on it. But I never I never use it. So I just, I need it within arm's reach. I'll probably need to have a bit of a rearrange of my desk. Uh, is this a way we could have gone? Did we not go this way? We did not go this way. Let's go this way. Just having a sneaky drink. Definitely an opportune moment for me to get fucking jumped. Uh, it's missing a doorknob. You can't open it. That's not... Just, Claire, that's not how doorknobs work. I'm so, I hate to break this to you. Uh, stationery and related supplies. There's nothing useful here. Although, in fairness, if you... I mean, if you really, really wanted to get in and there was no doorknob, you'd just turn the little bit of metal that's sticking out. And if there is no little bit of metal, then... Yeah, you fucked. But <laughs> you could use one of those arrows. One of those 100 arrows you just picked up. Jammy, give it a jimmy. Ingby. 
Well, this is prime for something. It's too dark to see outside. It's too dark to see inside. This is going to be something jumping through, isn't it? Is that flashing? That's flashing. <laughs> you can't take any more items. Is that the bow gun? That looks like the bow gun. I can't. This, there is a file. Oh, fantastic. Uh, memo on the pass number. The emergency door lock system in the biology experiment room can be released with a four-digit pass number. I hope you haven't forgotten about that already. I have just received an order from the systems administrator requesting us to change the pass number periodically. What bothers me is that you often lose important memos, pass numbers, or even chemicals. It sounds like every job I've ever worked in. Uh, so, in an attempt to solve this problem, I came up with an idea. You know the red human skeleton picture at the back of the biology experiment room? No, but carry on. I have decided to use the number signed on the picture as the pass number. If you happen to lose the memo, just look at the picture. Well, I, think, I don't think you would ever need to use the emergency pass number anyway. But just in case, now you know. Take it easy, Mr. Careless. So I can't pick up that bow gun at the moment because I don't have, I haven't got the space. There's a blood stain. Were they conducting animal experiments here? The animal experiments are what you're worried about. You literally passed a blood stain guillotine and a pole where they executed humans and you're worried about, I mean, that's what I would do. Uh, emergency, door lock system activated. Door says bio experiment room, abnormal air. It can't, I can't enter the pass number. Right, cool, well, I'm just gonna leave. Or something breaks through and tries to eat me. So, yeah, we can't go anywhere else right now. So, let's try and go where we said we were going to go out here and then to um, Claire's left. Keep wanting to call a Jill. Really going to have to stop making that mistake. What? What? Do I not get a magic savoring box anymore? Is this not a thing? Are there savoring boxes in this game, or are there not? It's locked from the other side. Of course it is. Is this a? Is there? Was there something shiny here? No, there was not. It's a window. <laughs> Someone fact check that real quick. Can can I actually? Is there a box room in this in this game, or am I just am I just gonna have to use the metal detector box for a bit? Like, is that what's gonna have to happen? Uh, so I can't go through there. I can go pick up the the bow gun, I, which I think is the bow gun, but I think that's gonna set off something. I'm not sure what. Uh, and I can't. So that's the, the, those are the two rooms that I went in. Another training facility. Let's go back this way. Oh, I was going to try and fact check it myself, but apparently I'm being ambushed by zombies. Fuck off! I haven't even been this way. Haven't even been this way. Oh, I hate that camera angle change. That's awful. Nope. No, thank you. Not today. Today, buddy. Not today. I am not that human, and you are not that. What did he drop there? It was his hat. His hat flew off. So, what the fuck is that noise? I can't take any more. I, do, I can't take anything. What the fuck is that noise? 
is it supposed to be bugs hitting the light? I mean, that would that makes a sort of sense, but it sounded like some sort of fucking anomaly sat in the corner, just sort of rocking away to itself. No, no secrets there. There's an herb there, which is good. Oh, there was an herb somewhere else as well, wasn't there? I can't remember where it was. Ooh, fancy. Another fucking Spencer mansion. Who keeps building these places? There's an herb I can't pick up. Is this a save room? Normally there's save rooms near new areas that you go into. It's a fancy door. Oh, music. No, it's a bog. Okay. Oh, it's bats. Excellent. I'm going to leave you guys alone. No, I'm out. <laughs> I'm going to leave you guys to it. I quite, I quite like a magic box. I'm not going to lie. Oh, have I got... Oh, I don't have a map of this place, do I? Palace? Palace? What kind of weird island is this? Am I in Far Cry all of a sudden? I have gone from the prison to the training facility to the palace. Security law system is active. Oh, I, I completely skipped that. Sorry. Unless that was it. Security law I will learn to speak one day. Security lock system is active. Enter an employee ID to activate the unlocking device. Activate the unlocking device. What a weird sentence. Please enter your ID number. I, I don't have. I don't think I have an ID number. I mean, it might work. Oh, it didn't work. One, two, three, four is not an umbrella ID number. Uh, no, I'm good. Let's exit that. I don't have an ID number then. Uh, I can't take any bullets, which is unfortunate because I quite like them. Uh, I guess upstairs. Why do I feel like I'm accidentally spelunking into a later part of the game and I shouldn't be? A huge portrait is displayed here with a bullet in its head. I mean, quite, oh, a silver crest is carved on it, right? Quite did kind of gloss over that a little bit. Oh, turn around. Turn around, shy tides. Oh, it's a save room. Right, is there a magic box in here? There is a magic box. Fucking finally. Jesus. It's the first one of the game. Right, get rid of this. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. Get rid of those as well. And put those up here. Oh, no, wait. I'm doing a stupid. I'm doing a stupid. Uh, put those up there. I am going to take the bow gun arrows with me, but only because I'm going to go and get the bow gun and if I run out of handgun ammo, then I can use the bow gun. So, also, oh, there, there's an egg ribbon on the table. And there's handgun bullets. Hooray. Do the red field shimmy. Uh, professional bullets. That's not what I'm clicking on. Wow, you have to be really precise with the items. That worries me slightly. That I'll have missed, like, tons of stuff. Uh, yes, I will absolutely take the ink ribbon. I wonder if you can't... If you can't uh, take an ink ribbon right then and there if it offers you to use the ink ribbon <laughs> like it did with the herb. Uh, yes. Checking, 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 checking. Excellent. Nice bit of aggressive typewriter action there. That's what we love on our Resident Evil games. It's been a while since we've had aggressive typewriter interaction.
Sorry about that. Uh, right, put this back in here. Catmus, do you want to be my social media manager? Do you want to manage... Actually, do you want to just manage my YouTube channel? Because <laughs> that is the sort of call to action I need. And it's the sort of call to action I just cannot bring myself to do. <laughs> Every time I try and do it, it brings up a little bit of sick from the back of my throat. Uh, what's this? <laughs> Secretary's note. I quit. <laughs> Uh, four years, four years have passed since I began serving Sir Alfred. He doesn't trust anyone. Uh, even though I am his I am his attendant, I am still strictly prohibited from entering his private house. What is his problem anyway? Right, this voice does not match this this tone. They say he lives with his twin sister Alexia. In his private house on the hill. Occasionally, I've seen someone standing by the window of the house. It might have been Alexia. I'm, I'm very aware that my smart device might chime in in a minute. Uh, whose extreme beauty is often talked about. She definitely, if Alexia is real, 100% going to turn into a monster. Probably some sort of mannequin monster. Uh, I once asked Sir Alfred about this, but it only enraged him. Even though I am his attendant... He will not show me any lenience. If I ask about her again, I would risk putting my life at risk. This is some toxic ass work culture, if ever I've seen it. After all, uh, it is a mystery why he so desperately tries to keep his private life with Alexia a secret. Is this going to get weird? Is this going to get super duper weird? Because I'm not, I'm not here for that. Uh, there is evidence that the shelf has been moved. And is this the guns I have? It's locked. There's an indication of ship of two guns. That might be the guns I have. Uh, I don't really know what to do about that. I'm gonna nick this herb. That's what I'm doing. Can't help but associate Bat Alfred with Batman. <laughs> Push it real good. Dun, 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 dun. What this? Please be a key card. It's a key card. Uh, ID card. Do you have an ID number on you by any chance? If we check that. Wee. What the fuck? What does that even say? An ID card of an embroy em em embroyer. <laughs> Employee. Uh, the word NTC, so they're American, <laughs> 0394 is written on it. Uh, otherwise, it'd say PAL, right? Retro gaming humor, ladies and gentlemen. Come for the game, stay for the obscure retro gaming humor. Zero na 0394, that was it, wasn't it? Let's just check. I might keep that on me just in case. I really probably should equip that. <laughs> I was about to uh, wait. Uh, Alfred and, Alfred, uh, and it was the sentence Alfred is Batman's Batman, and then I learned that Batman is an actual, albeit old, noun. Oh, really? Nice. <laughs> Let me guess, there's going to be tons of zombies down here now. Now I've finally gone to a save room. A Batman is a, in the British Armed Forces is an officer's personal servant. Wow. I did not know that. That is pretty fascinating stuff. I assumed it was something sport related. Useful. Okay. Yeah, no, I get it. Huh? Uh, right, zero three, what was it? Zero three nine four? Zero three nine four? Can someone remember?
Yeah, try zero three nine four. What's the worst that can happen? Absolutely. Uh, yes, zero. In progress, please wait. I doubt the detonator nuke. Error, verification has been rejected. Damn it. Please insure it. 0349. Oh, hang on. I have letters. NTC. NTC. 039. That on. Yay! It's been confirmed. Hooray! The security lock system is deactivated. I know. I don't. I don't know if that was the right thing to do. The ID card is no longer useful. Discard it. Yep. Thanks. Was it this door? It was this door. <gasps> New rooms. New rooms, new tombs, new booms. That's, that's the saying that's not really a saying. Oh, fucking hell. I really should go back and get that dart gun. It's locked. A silver crest is carved on it. See that, suckers? Oh, no, they're thinking in multiples. No, how dare you? All this opulence and not one can of WD-40. <gasps> There's lots of guns in this room. I like this. Immediately leaves the room. To be fair, they say number, which usually does not indicate letters. Yes, it's very true. I think yes, they don't work in decimal, but in base, base 36 or something. What fucking hell, base 36. So there's literally a room full of guns and all I can take is a packet of bullets. Fantastic. Is any help to be found? Yeah. A jewel model after an ant is displayed here. There's a button below. Will you push it? Sure, why not? What is the worst that could happen? <gasps> it's movie night! Psychopath! Whoever's pulling the wings off that bug has the makings of a sociopath. Yep, it's you, you fucking weirdo. You gonna, what are you going to do now now you've ripped its wings off? Are you going to put a magnifying glass to it? I'm going to enjoy putting a bullet in you. Oh, God, no, you're going you're to feed it to your ants. Excellent. This game's gonna get fucking weird. Real fucking weird. Brother and sister. That's what they are. Can I get back over there now? Oh, there was other stuff! Oh, you go this way. It's fine. <laughs> I can go this way. What's this? Uh, two magnums are displayed here. Break it open! <laughs> At this point, I take a model of the ship to beat zombies to death. That visual references are placed here. War seems to be the primary theme. Fucking hell. It's like people who are obsessed with armed, armed conflict. Like like major conflict. Two handguns. I just don't get it. I don't get it. I, don't, I just don't understand it. Everyone's got their, their things that they're interested in. I, I understand that. Ooh, a wheel? I just don't understand why war, you would fetishize war like that. I just don't. Guns, from other countries. guns from many countries are displayed. Like guns. I don't get why people are so obsessed with guns. Like Ameri I know some Americans are specifically uh, obsessed with guns. Oh, oh, there's the, the, the guns I need. Uh, gold Lugers. Yeah. This is a trap. This feels like a trap. Yep, this is a trap. What? Just turn around and put them back in. Oh, I'm sorry. You, I've I've triggered the cook the intruder to death trap. 
Uh, you just put those there. Just, just equip. Uh, no, not equip them. Use them. I just don't. I think being. I think being British helps. Like I've I've not been uh, exposed to guns, so it's not really something that has been part of my upbringing. But some people have, even if they've never been exposed to guns, they like they collect them and they they almost worship them. And I'm like, I don't, I just do not understand at all. They freak me out. The idea of them freaks me out. Right, so I need, I think I need my machine pistols. Uh, 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 derp, derp. It's locked. Good. Fantastic. Turn around. Get the fuck off me. As someone who knows nothing about guns, I always wonder if the guns in most games are real guns. I think, right, I get that, because I'm, I'm the same knowing nothing about guns like serial numbers and types and whatever it impresses and worries me when someone can just go oh that's a i mean i know the i think the only gun i actually know is a walter ppk because it was in james bond right that's it uh, which i know i know that is a real gun oh god what have i done i've i've screwed myself over here there we go but that's that's it you know um yeah i i think that a lot of research, a shocking amount of research goes into the guns in games. Unless they're trying maybe to circumvent some sort of licensing law and then it'll just be, you got the assault rifle gun, <laughs> you know? To be fair, if it were legally easily obtainable, I might enjoy having some even without ammo just to study the mechanics behind them, which I find fascinating in engineering terms. That's fair. So from that perspective then, Catmus, and this is interesting because from an engineering background, would you then collect different pistols, rifles, rocket launchers, whatever, right? Because this is, this is what people do, right? But from, is that something you would want to study? Would you get like one of each? Would you just get a pistol? And study that and take it apart and see how the firing pin works and the spring and all this sort of stuff. I wanna there's part of me that's like I kinda wanna understand why why that's so interesting to people. I'm gonna use these to go back and get the bow gun and then come back here and then swap them out for the gold lugas. Because actually can I? Can I? You would enjoy taking one apart though. Yeah, yeah, fair enough. Not many know, like, of one type, like, one revolver, one semi-automatic, one automatic. Okay, that I sort of understand. That's, that, as a, from a collector point of view, that would be an interesting thing. And I say this because I saw, um, this is an aside. Sorry, YouTube. Sorry, everyone who's watching else live. This is, this is what you get. This is the bits I cut out. Uh, I get uh, that sort of collection, collectionary aspect of it. Because I wanted to buy... So I've got original hardware consoles, right? I wanted to buy a console because it's something I'm, I'm passionate about. And I wanted to have one of those art pieces where it's like all in bits and everything's sort of like on display. So you can see the circuit boards, you can see the buttons, you can see the inside of everything. I'm like, that would be very cool to see the ins and see it from an inside out point of view. So I kind of understand it from that perspective. But yeah, having one of each, like you'd want to know how does a... So as someone who doesn't know anything about guns, I'd want to know how, how does a machine gun fire that fast, right? If I was interested in that. But yeah, I can I can understand that. Um, far simpler ones like flintlocks or cannons aren't really engineeringly that interesting. No, that's assuming like, yeah, cannons is just an explosion happens and a big bit of metal flies out, right? I mean, from a layman, that, that's how I see it. That's, that's just a trebuchet with fireworks. Like, so that's how I would describe that. And a flintlock is kind of, you just, it's kind of the same thing, but on a smaller scale, really. That's, I think, anyway. Um, <laughs> God, I just described it as a trebuchet with fireworks. <laughs> uh, what the fuck am I doing? I, I'm not going to save it. I'm... Wait, if that, wait, hang on. Can I not just use those guns? I don't think those guns will fit, you know. Oh, I'm injured. <laughs> I forgot I was injured. Uh, I, uh, well, then I'm, I'm just fucked on her. I'm 
just going to take this with me. Can I pick... Uh, yeah, can I not just use these here? Is this not a thing? No need to use it right now. Okay, fine. Equip these. Oh, no, go back into items. Uh, combine these. Yes. Now, we're going to go back and get the bow gun. I don't quite remember where it is. Ah, I should save it. Ah. I've only got one healing item, and I'm on caution. I should save it. Uh, I sort of know, but I find it flabbergasting. Flabbergasting is a word that we don't use enough. Flabbergasting that how something so precise that uses uh, the explosion of the cartridge to reset it back to a firing state multiple times per second for tens of thousands of rifles we produce copied one after another. Yeah, there's a certain there's a certain art in that level of precision, isn't there? Wazix, Wazix. Oh wow, I had to. I I have never seen that word written down echo ever in my life. And I literally had to say it to remember that that used to be an insult. <laughs> My fucking God, that's a... Th this is Throwback Sunday. <laughs> uh, I don't know what I'm doing now. Anyway, I'm saving it. I hear it often on another channel. Is that other channel, Dark Saber 2K, by any chance? <laughs> that sounds like the sort of... Uh, uh, common British insult that he would he would chuck into the ether. Actually, no. Wow. Okay. Cool. <laughs> I'm impressed. Pillock is another one that I like. I like calling. I like. I don't like calling people pillocks, but that's a that's a good. It's a good insult that nowadays no one really knows what it means. I'm not sure what it actually means, but it's definitely it's one of those soft insults that you can call people. So another British channel, though. You have a running theme for British channels, don't you? I like it. I like it a lot. Um, I probably shouldn't copy the first result I got from Googling that from Urban Dictionary. Pillock is just something really stupid. God, yeah. <laughs> I can't remember some of the... Some of... I was going to say, where did all the music just suddenly go? I can't remember... Yeah! Oh Help God! Me. Oh Steve! God Steve? damn it, Steve! I mean, you've put rush music on. I'm not rushing. I'm just. You looked up here. I'm gonna go up here and see what's, see what's what. It's locked. It's over here. Okay. Good. <laughs> Is that what it means? Oh, okay. Well, he's not going to be this way, is he? I never knew that's what a Wazik was. So fair enough. Uh, are you this way? It'd be super helpful if it like pointed to a door where where Steve was. Also, do I, do I really need to... Where are you? Get off. Is he in here? Because the other door's locked. Thump, 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 thump. Oh, you did it stupid, didn't you? Steve is suffering. Good. <laughs> there is a message on the control panel. When two pairs complete, my anger will subside. What? Operate it. Yeah, sure. There are switches. P push which switch? A. A and F? No. Let's just go over handguns. E and C. Side. Huh. That was too close. But I found something. Thanks to you. <laughs> Thanks to me. Looks cool, huh? Oh, I need those. Give Do. them to me. You've got to be kidding. I found it, and I'm keeping it. Fine. Let's make a deal. I'll trade you for something fully automatic. What about these guns? 
Also, stop pointing guns at me, you fucking idiot. See you around, Claire. Adios. Hey, wait, Steve! Really hate Steve. Really, really hate Steve. If we'd have just waited, I'm just saying, right? It's getting real close now. All I'm saying is, if we'd have just waited around for like 30 more seconds, that entire situation would have resolved itself. We are abandoned on some sort of island prison run by a secret organization. No one would have known. No one would have known. When they found him after the fact, it would have just been a tale of misfortune. That's all it would have been. Right, cool. So he's just gone and pilfered our bloody puzzle thing. God fucking damn it, Steve. Do, 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 do. It's you and me and your mate, Steve. Uh, I'd like you to go away, please. <laughs> I can already tell what that clip is, Echo. The music went all quiet, then I thought I'd been killed. I need to, I need to get some more clips out, actually. This week's, uh, duck. What? There's no way. There's Please. no way you could dodge a bullet. How dare you interfere with my operation? What are you talking about? You let yourself be captured so you could lead your people to this base. I have no idea what you're babbling about. You don't fool me. I am Alfred Ashford, commander of this base. Oh? You must be one of Umbrella's lower level officers if you're in command of a backwater base like this one. Fuck it out, man. Savage. Savage. The Ashford family is among the world's first and finest. My grandfather is one of the original founders of Umbrella Inn. Uh, not really something to brag about. Gotta be honest. Now tell me, why have you attacked this installation? Attacked? Shortly after you arrived, my base was attacked. You must have informed your people of its location. I still don't follow you. I really don't know anything about that. Unacceptable. How can you deny it? My base has been destroyed. And thanks to you, the experimental T-Virus was released, creating countless zombies and monsters. Tell me, who do you work for? Who sent you? The Moping Man. <laughs> Have it your way, then. You're just a rat in a cage anyway. I'll be sure to keep you entertained before I dispose of you. <laughs> Top-notch villaining. I'm all, that's all I'm saying. That is some good villaining right there. You know, you know that they're a baddie. There's no doubt in your mind. There's no immorality there. There's nothing. There's no question. They're just like. This guy's a fucking nutcase. I like it. I'm bored. Uh, right, let's go get this bow gun. Now that we're clearly safe. Steve is fuck off with our guns. Really, really hate that guy. I think, yeah, I, so that's the creepy twin grown up. Yeah. Uh, how much of a do I space have I given myself? Three slots. Good. What's this? What's the shiny green thing on the floor? It is the navy proof. It's normally something on rum, isn't it? Wait, what the fuck is the navy proof? <laughs> Check it. What's on the back? Nothing. A hex-shaped stone object. A picture of a submarine is carved on it. Good. Excellent stuff. 
Oh, a herb! I got I just another herb. I forgot about that one. That's the herb I forgot about earlier. I really should make a note of this sort of stuff when I say it. Now, if I use that one instead of the mixed one I've got, I won't waste as much stuff. Who's <laughs> that? A navy blank. <laughs> there we go. Now I'm fine. Right, I'll be back in a second. I'll just put it on pause. I'll be back in a sec. He's back, he's back. So it was this way. My neighbor's kids are just screaming at each other, chucking each other around the room <laughs> next door. Get off, you tart. Oh, I knocked him off the, I knocked him off the bridge. That was good. No, get off. He's his hat full of now. Whee! Ow. What's this way? Nothing. And I'm injured again. Fantastic. Uh, I can't open it. Wait, what? Hang on. What? Could I not go through this earlier? I oh, know, it's the door next to the door that I can go through. Not the door. I can go through the door next to the door. Good. Just so we're all aware. Um, I want to say it was... Wait, what is that? I completely missed that. Oh, good. <laughs> more more bowgun arrows. <laughs> They're really pushing this bowgun, aren't they? Oh, it's locked from this side. Oh, it's in this building, isn't it? Is it in the back of here? Oh, wait. Oh, no, I can't use the ID card, can I? I thought the ID card might be useful for that uh, keycard scanner. Not the case. Because I got the number off it, and then I flicked it into the abyss. Uh, uh. Oh, yeah, there's a door. Good. <laughs> I'm like, I'm not certain I'm going the right way. I'm not going the right way. This is the swimming pool. I don't want the swimming pool. I want the... Oh, it's upstairs. I forgot. There we go. Get you out of my way first. 
for a bit at least. All I can smell is the rem the remnants of my tea bag. <laughs> All I can smell is tea from this. Something about Earl Grey tea. I'm not no. I was never a big fan of Earl Grey tea. Um, and then a friend from work uh, showed me how to drink it, quote, properly. Um, and I've been a big fan ever since. Because I used to, when I first tried it, I accidentally put milk in it, which is a big no-no because it ruined the flavor of it. And it did, it properly tasted horrible. But then I just had it black, which is the, I think the only tea I can drink black. Um, I just made sure there was loads of sugar in it first time, so I knew I'd like it. Uh, right, bow gun. Bow gun. Please only be one slot. Smash? No. Pass? No. Emergency door system. Bio experiment room. Abnormal air. Okay. Cool. Bye bye then. Oh, if, oh, if only I knew what was going to happen here. If only I hadn't predicted this. Don't come near it. Hey, it's not even like you knew it this. You've done this before. Oh. No. 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 Oh, oh. That's, that's a lot of mess. There appears to be no one around. A red picture is hanging on the back. I can't see the number from here. Well, that's unfortunate. Is the abnormal air now gone? The door says barrier experiment room. I've normally I can't press a number. Okay, cool. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna leave then. Biohazard contamination detected. Level three. Emergency shutters will close. All personnel evacuate There's no way you're making that. You are not running down a flight of set. Not a chance. She would trip, she'd trip, sprain her ankle, fall over forwards, and break her neck. <laughs> Utterly ridiculous. I love it. I love all of it. Right, so that's closed, that's closed. Sorry, so we've got our bow gun now, and there's no negative repercussions, other than the fact there's now one less room to look at. What was in here? Oh, this was this room, I see. Oh, hang on. Did we not have... Oh, yeah, we <laughs> we had to keep this. I remember. Okay, so let's have a quick look at our map. Nothing else in there, which is fine. I can't get through that bit. <laughs> I love that I get uh, little notifications from Discord when someone posts. And all I've got from uh, Echo Alpha is uh, type, ink, ribbon, smash. I appreciate that. Okay, thank you. <laughs> My phone is just there, so it just popped off really quick. <laughs> no, nope, not today. Uh, I think I'm going back this way. I'm actually not 100% certain anymore. Please leave me alone. Wait, what is this? Is this a... Go away. Is this a thing? It's nailed down from the inside. I can't open it. Okay, no, it's not a thing. Definitely not a thing. Jim, 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 jim. Tiny insect noises. What was this door? Oh, we never went this through this door. Wait, this is new. Ooh. Ooh. Treat. There's bound to be something down here. Like herbs. Or zombies. Or both. 
or bullets. Yeah, sure, why not? Yeah, we'll go with that. Cool. Uh, take the map. Take the palace map. Lovely. Not sure why you'd have a palace map out in the open like that. Uh, what this? Is this more? Rusted construction equipment. It's more bowgun arrows. Wow, he's really, really pushing this bow gun. This must be some hell of a weak ass gun if you give me all of this ammunition. Oh, wait, do I need the thing as well? They look like there was a hole for this. No, I don't need that right now. Okay, but I do need the the wheel. Let's go back to the wheel. Uh, where is the nearest save room? I think it might be in the palace, although I'm not 100% certain. There's the... Yes, the nearest save room is upstairs. Good. That does just exit the... Exit the map and doesn't do anything stupid like use all of my restorative items. Oh, I'm going to use the... Use my first herb. What do we want to have with it? This way, this way. So I need the wheel. I don't. I'm. I'm gonna keep the seal on me. The wheel and the seal. Because I don't know what else I'm gonna need. So and that that other hole below the wheel looks like that seal. So I'm gonna. I'm gonna keep that on me. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put that there. I'm gonna put that there. I'm gonna. I don't know why I did that. All that. In fact. I did it because I want to make a better arrangement of items, I'll be honest with you. Oh, my days. I wish I had a bigger inventory. Seal. Keep the seal. Keep the wheel. Keep the seal on the wheel. Seal on the wheel. Seal on the wheel. No, not the fire extinguisher, you fucking pillock. There we go. You wazzock. Uh, yes, save. This is one of our last saves, though, isn't it? So, um, yeah, sure. Is it a fire extinguisher if it's empty? No, it's an extinguishant container. There you go. <laughs> let's be let's be proper about this. It is a it is a, a extinguishant container. Brackets empty. That's our second to last ink we've been used up. I can see this getting super duper like Resident Evil 1. It is an extinguished extinguisher. Yes, that's very true. That was that felt really hard to say. I don't know why. Okay, so we're going to go down the new staircase. And we're gonna, I assume, um, extend a bridge with this wheel because it's a, it's a plaque in front of a river. So I assume I'm going over the river. I assume anyway. I've seen, seeing how insanely action-packed this game is right now, it could do anything. Who knows? It could beam me into space for all I know. Steering wheel. Clonk. Oh, it oh that goes in there. Got it. I thought it was like a decorative one. I thought it went in the little black hole. It's a submarine. <laughs> of course it is. Why would it not be a sub? Yeah, sure. Oh yeah. <laughs> sure, why not? Let's just let's fucking leave. Climb down the ladder. I mean this Please don't tell me this was made by the same person who made the fucking Spencer Mansion. <laughs> You're going to lose it. There's a lever. Move the lever. Not right this second. Thanks. Small submarine. Yes. Don't you keep on your secret underwater dock. No. No, I'm not a Bond villain. Unfortunately, there's a side pack. Oh, I got mines. Yes. <laughs> Brilliant. 
Oh, ask for something and it'll come true. I manifested that. I swear to God, I manifested that. Yeah, sure. Move the lever. What is this? What is this doing? I'm... Wait, what? I'm sorry. Is this... Is this his own personal underwater Uber? Yeah, it is! Holy shit! This game is wild! This is insane! I just took a sub to an underground facility. <laughs> you just trying to get headshots in oh i was actually aiming at two separate zombies then that was pretty cool and they aren't that wealthy imagine how much more wacky things musk and bezos have a ladder into space that's what i'm expecting from fucking musk um Baggage and similar items have been placed here. Because my aqua uh, aqua excursions. Oh, it's open. Oh. I gotta be honest, I assume that was closed. I'll go back and explore the rest of that room. Or not, as the case may be. That was a very ominous view of that bridge. I'm not happy about going down that bridge at all. Well, the right-hand zombie wasn't being aimed at very well. No, that's true. It looked like I was really going for that book, though. <laughs> that book will learn. That book learn a lesson. <laughs> to shreds, you say? Oh, it's a fish tank. More bullets. Hello, fishies. Oh, I can't interact with the fish. Zero out of ten. This game is a ride. I'm telling you. Uh, do I need to get rid of you lot? That's such a waste of ammo. I think that's most of them, to be honest with you. What's here? Uh, possibly a control system for the airport. What fucking airport? The device powers the boarding lift. Push the switch. Sure, why not? I... I... Oh, I think I'm having a stroke. I legitimately just got off a sub. Possibly a control system. I just... I don't understand what is going on anymore i don't get what how do these logically connect i get like mansion zombie mansion then secret facility i get city then apparently uh control for a push switch yeah sure it won't work something seems to be missing oh uh is it this there's a hexagonal hole there or octagonal hole i can't remember the numbers of sides press the button Oh, it won't work. Okay. Fine. <laughs> well, I, at least I have a spare inventory slot. Yeah, I, I don't understand the... <laughs> Spoiler, same tech as the magic item boxes. It's portals. Yeah, it fucking must be. I, I get, like, Resident Evil 2. Resident Evil 3, 2 and 3, you know, city... Uh, what do we do? Like, city, hospital, park... Um, factory train i got to, totally on board with that right that's a logical you can see that in your mind you can see that unraveling this is this has gone prison island yeah fair enough palace sorry 
prison, graveyard, island, palace, submarine, airport? Like... Did someone just r accidentally remove some of the story of this game? <laughs> Alright, what's going to happen here? Oh, apparently not. It's the evil base starter kit. It doesn't even feel like that. It feels like the evil base add-on kit without the starter kit. Like, it feels like someone bought two or three separate add-on kits, but then threw away the base pack. <laughs> I don't want the boring city bit and the story building bollocks. I just want, just give me the mansion, just give me the facility and the evil robots and the moon base. <laughs> this is, this is what happens when you leave evil people unchecked for too long. <laughs> if this gets much wilder, uh, then I'm, I'm out completely. I don't understand. This can't get any weirder than this. It's completely, what? I don't know what I'm doing, Claire. What is this? Just waiting to see the secret volcano lab. Volcano not included. That's that's in six. I'm sure that's in six. Six was the same. Resident Evil Six was exactly the same. <laughs> You're betting Elon has this exact island somewhere in the Caribbean. Yeah, it is. <laughs> second for second recreation of this exact island. Weird fucking royal henchmen and all. What is, where, where is this going? Oh, good, under the lift. She looks like she's trying to pick her teeth with a gun. Honestly, I was turning that way a little bit. She honestly looks like she's like, I just got, I got a teeth. I just, oh, it's, it's a, it's a, it's a, a pistachio skin. I was just, oh, I got it, it's fine. Uh, there's a lever. Move the lever. Yes. I grew up on the seaside. I'm a, I'm a, a, a aware of crane games. <laughs> I, sorry, I grew up on the British seaside. I must clarify, it wasn't a nice one. I grew up on the British seaside. That's the, that's the stuff. That's what I like. Now drop it, and then you could bring the claw back, and then the claw goes the other way, and then drop it again, and then make me waste all my pound coins. I say pound coins. They were 20p back when I was a kid, but inflation's a bitch. Uh... What's in here? Ooh, another room. Yes, uh, I'm sure it was six. Whatever one, because five is in the, with Mr. Chainsaw, Braghead Chainsaw, right? Six, control panel for the bridge, the control lever is missing. Right, okay, cool. So that's that's not a, that's not a yet to them. Um, six, you were playing as Redfield, right? As Chris. And uh, that was when you went from one location to another location, and it felt like a, at least uh, from what I remember, I just remember kind of mentally waking up at some point and being like, why am I in a volcano having a fist fight with Wesker? Like, when did this become Mortal Kombat all of a sudden? <laughs> Where is this? Oh, uh, it's a control panel for the shutter. The markings above the keyhole read K402. Shutter not found. What is down there? Why can I not... What is this? Why can I not pick this up? Well, because it's fucking miles away, that's why. Please don't drop it, please don't drop it, please don't drop it. It's a control panel for the loading lift. The warning sign is visible. The lift may not operate if the power levels are low. Move the lever. Yes. Well, that's a weird noise for a lever, I'll be honest. Claire, you had lots of times in here. Uh, can I not just drop that box on them? Is that not a thing? I mean, I'm going to try. They could have gone with 404, which the HTTP status code for, for uh, not found. That is the HTTP status code for not found. It's not my favorite HTTP status code, because obviously I fucking got one. That's 419. I'm a teapot. It's a real code, people. You can look it up on the internet. <laughs> All right, lads, let's get this over, shall we? How much, how much more ammunition have I got? Don't, no, don't do that. Just aim at this one. Oh, I'm, <laughs> how much more ammunition have I got? Click, 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 click. Well, that answers that question. Uh, I, 
didn't bring Bogun with me. Oh, what a shame. Bye bye. Are you still alive? No. This is a triumph. I'm shooting zombies in the head. It's hard to overstate my need for herbs. Umbrella science. They do what they can because of greed. Oh good, it's more bolts. This this gun better be fucking amazing. The amount it's giving me. Also some joke codes in RFCs like proposals that sometimes lead into further developments. <laughs> A biohazard card. I'm should I touch it? I d it doesn't feel like I should touch it. That feels that feels dangerous. It feels like it would be sticky. I don't want to. I don't want to feel sticky cards. User enable first against her. Device is not working. No, that's fine. Oh, so I couldn't just raise it and then lower it. Oh, okay. Uh, do, do this. Check this. Check the card. Check the card. The card shining is silver. Oh, oh, right. Okay. I can use this at the military training facility. Helpful. That's helpful. I like that. I hate April first now for for working in tech, only because like loads of people just release shit updates on social media on April first, and it's normally stuff that. So like sometimes it's really stupid stuff, like have you tried I don't know bottled air or something, which unfortunately now I think is a thing, but fucking. It's because the world's in a decline and it's going to head into the sun soon. Um, but it's sometimes stuff like, uh, oh, have you heard of this brand new feature in this program or this brand new feature in this service? And I'm like, oh, that actually sounds really useful. And like, haha, April Fool. And like, but that sounds really useful. Like, <laughs> it didn't sound ridiculous. It sounded really good. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's how things like, and sorry to get too techy and codey and boring. I'm pretty sure that's thing, that's how things like Code Whisperer and um, GitHub Copilot came about. Because I think one of the, uh, I have this, this feeling that one of the April Fool's jokes, was this all I needed here? I don't know if this was all I needed here. Did I, I've got, a, I've got a thing on there. That basically one of the April Fool jokes was, uh, ha, now you don't need to have developers anymore. This will just write your code for you. There you go. But then someone was like, hold my beer. Uh, that red that red door we can't get through yet. So that's a no. There is a ladder. Climb down the ladder. Sure thing. I'm going to go to this. Firstly, pre-programmed submarine. <laughs> this is... This is the epitome of this could have been an email. This meeting could have been an email. With this, this elevator ride, this submarine ride could have been a lift. Like in 19, they had RFC 1149, which IP over avian carriers <laughs> using homing pigeons to have credit to take data. I like that. Then in 98, they had a proposal for HTC PCP, Hypertext Coffee Pot Control Protocol. And in 99, they had one which updated the avian carrier proposal from 90 to add quality of service. I'm surprised no one's put in one to say that uh, 2020 was when we replaced all the batteries and the pigeons. Um, that's why everyone had to stay inside. Uh, okay, let's go this way because this is the way we need to go. That that's how this that's how games work. Just in case no one knew, that's how this works. I 
I get to go and after this, I get to go and unwind uh, and play some Stardew Valley because I've, <laughs> I've for some reason I've restarted Stardew Valley and I'm obsessed with it again. <laughs> uh, what is where? What am I doing? Where am I going? Uh, I've got a biohazard card key, which is silver, which is the training facility, and I'm gonna go. I'm just gonna go there now. That's all I'm gonna do. I was gonna go save it, but literally all we've all I've done is walk around and go, why is this? Why? Why is this? I don't understand. <laughs> this game is insane. This game feels like an April first joke. It really does. Uh, it's just can I uh, can I can I drag you over here? Is that a thing? And then just go peekaboo. Uh, and I need. Do you fuck off, mate? Is a thing I would like to know. Thanks. Bye. <laughs> Wait, is this? Hang on. Is this the way I needed to go? This is not the way I needed to go. What? Oh no. Oh no. I am not in a position for the boss. Oh, it's Grave Digger. Uh, we're fucked because we've got no we've got nothing I'm just going to leave oh no leave I got nothing I get in the get in the facility <laughs> it can stay there it's fine I don't care it's the nemesis all over again it's ne nemesis noodle oh I forgot about that oh no wait is this the card reader this is the card reader. It's an astral. Yeah, use Bauhaus card. Sticky card. If there's a zombie behind here, I'm going to lose it. There is not. Good. An unwielding spirit. Uh, excuse me. Uh, I just. I just. Oh, good. It's fucking Soldier McDuff. Mate, you're the worst shot. Oh, I, I actually have to run. There's no... Get, get fucked. There's no way you got me there. Absolutely ridiculous. Utterly, utterly ridiculous. I mean, I love it, but it's utterly ridiculous. Can I just wait until he gets bored? He does his evil man monologue again and just fucks off? Or am I actually going to have to, like... Run, 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 run. Go upstairs, kick him in the nuts. He won't like that. He's a, he's a, a, a British prick. There's an invitation in your reflect. Okay, cool. He's, I bet he voted Tory. I bet he was a Tory. Uh, the relief is carved. It looks very old. Good. Good eyes. What? Why did you do that to me, game? I'm going to give away the windows. Uh, is this a thing? Card reader, silver in color. Have I still got the biohazard key? I do have the biohazard key. Can I use the biohazard key? Just walk through here. Let's no. Oh, I missed handgun bullets there. There was bullets there. Ooh, save room. Yay. And look, a line of helmets. Uh they must have spent their off hours at what what? Work clothes are hung here. They must have spent their off hours here. Just typing away on their typewriters. Put enough miners in a room. Uh, ooh, stuff. More stuff. That's not the ink ribbon glimmering. Grab that. What's this? Is this a fade spray? It's jammed between the sofa cushions. No, it's a hemostatic. I've taken the hemostatic. 
fuck is a hemostatic? I mean, I'm aware it's something medical, probably to do with like um, uh, making blood clots. My guess is that anyway. I know. I think I know that through work. Don't don't ask me why. Don't ask me why a techie knows that sort of stuff. Teddy Green Herb. Yes. This week's worst schedule is written here. What does it say? Who's doing what? What what rotor am I on? What shift am I doing? Am I on splits? I hate splits. I used to hate split shifts. Oh, they were awful. Oh, 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 the thought of them makes me want to be sick. I'd rather do doubles than splits. Do that, then do that. 200. This has got to be the weakest fucking gun. I've ever known. This, this is no Magnum. I'm telling you that. Uh, oh, I've, I've still got the auto duffers that I can't use. Wait, can I reload this with these? M M100P? No, I'm not reloading that with those. I don't even want to check. I don't want to waste the handgun bullets. I like having a normal pistol. Um, start? Start? <laughs> check the hemostatic. It's not secretly got like a big umbrella sticker on it somewhere being like, oh, secret, secret W virus. Medicine that is used to stop bleeding. It should be used on someone who is wounded. Cool. I can't help but feel that that's going to be a story point that's going to be very important if I don't have that on me at exactly the right moment. Cool. <laughs> stop my elbow for some reason. So, I now need to remember how to exit. There we go. Good. Uh, let's save. Because we have four, so we can treat ourselves. So, what may happen now? So, we've got about half an hour left. What may happen is if we either die or, you know, we can be a bit more uh, brave and risky. Um, if we die then we won't resave. Um, but if we get if we do a specific thing in the next like 25 30 minutes, then we'll we'll save again. Uh, I'm uh, no I want to go put that back in the box. Thank you. Right, I'll take the card and the hemostatic with me just in case. In case Steve Oh no, I I I smashed the hemostatic. Sorry, Steve. You, you're going to have to bleed to death. Oh. Gun, gun bullets. I think that might be two boxes there, actually. There is. And I've still not taken the bow gun with me. <laughs> uh, hello. Oh, dear. Welcome, Claire. <laughs> Consider the area you are in a special playground. Best I villain laugh. Just for you. Please try and keep me amused. And do not disappoint me by dying too soon. I so want to enjoy this. Cool. <laughs> That's an amazing laugh. That's absolutely outstanding. This game is insane. This game is proper mental. Like, this. <laughs> I'm going to try and practice that laugh. <laughs> That's going to be my new laugh, my new on stream laugh. You heard it here first. I could have it as a sound effect. Holy shit, that's genius. <gasps> Why are we... Just open the door, Claire. <laughs> there, see? Nothing to worry about. I'm not sure... Oh, hello. Uh, there's a submachine gun. It's not loaded. Take the submachine gun. There's only one. I think you'll find there's two. You've taken the submachine gun. Cool. Is that ammo? There's ammo for the submachine gun. Nice. Oh, God. 
Oh, even better. Even better. Oh, you look very sticky. Are you a tyrant? You got a little nubby arm. Look at your little nubby arm. I didn't uh, unequip that. Right no, good. Uh, see ya. See you later, you tyrant knockoff. You're a Poundland nemesis. That's what you are, mate. Nothing but a wish.com nemesis. Ow. I mean, you got a pretty decent punch, but... Um, is this an explodey barrel? I don't know if this is an explodey barrel. The door is locked. I can't open it. Ow. It doesn't look like an explodey barrel. I mean, it does look a bit like it. Oh my god, get off the back of my head. Get off, you absolute cretin. Oh, I have no Heelys, do I? No, I don't think that's an explodey barrel. Give me a chance, mister. Is there any other doors in here? Or am I just... Ow, get off. Start. Do I have any healies? I don't have any healies and I'm in danger. <laughs> I'm in danger. I'm dead. Yeah, I'm dead. Yeah, I accidentally pulled my head off. Well, not really, but... Right, okay, cool. So, uh, you, sure, are we try. As long as you don't desync the audio, that would be fantastic. Oh, cool. It just plops you straight back to the save room. That's nice. So, let's take the bow gun this time. Uh, oh, put that away. And uh, let's take the bow gun. Bow gun? Bow gun. And let's take those kaboom arrows. And fuck it. Let's take the other arrows as well. Why not? We'll treat ourselves. Oh, and also the Heelys. We'll take these herbs. Wah. There we go. Okay. Now we can't move for the amount of equipment we're carrying. Let's go see if we can kill that thing. Yes, this way. The amazing laugh. I'm going to skip that, though. It doesn't need to be half as tense as it is. You are... Uh, wait, do I need... I don't need to take that, do I? Oh, so if I if I don't take that, the monster's not there. Interesting. So if I were to go and... I can't go and grab the thing, can I? The door is locked. I can't open it. Okay, so let's equip this. Can I just swap these out? I can! That's something useful. That's a useful inclusion there. I like that. There doesn't appear to be a dodge mechanic, though, which I'm a bit disappointed at. Not that I normally dodge in games anyway. Uh, it isn't loaded. Yes, take the submachine guns. I can't fit these in my bloody inventory. Uh, I'm going to need to mix those herbs. Oh, no, I can mix the things, can't I? Yes, there we go. Lovely stuff. Take the submachine guns. Yes. Yes. Awesome. Sexy times. Right. Got my double bang bang. Excellent. Yeah, do that. Hi, buddy. <laughs> wow, that was anticlimactic. Oh, good. Excellent. You have passed this trial. You may continue. 
like, well, these are these are definitely the way forward, aren't they? These exploding bows, uh, uh, bow bow bullets, no arrows. That's how you, that's how bow bullets work. Oh, hello again. Are you just a regular enemy now? Steve. He's so cool. He doesn't even look. What an obnoxious hero. Is this Dante from oh, Devil yeah, May Cry? Don't worry, Claire. Your knight in shiny armor is here. Get fucked, mate. <laughs> You wish. Also, are those Lugas unlimited ammo? This is why you need me. I got your back. Whatever. <laughs> Here, take these. God fucking damn it, Steve. Machine guns? For me? You know the deal in exchange for your Lugas. <laughs> okay, okay. Nice. You've taken the gold Lugas. <laughs> This thing is too cool. Yes. Now this is my kind of weapon. All right. Huh? <laughs> hey. This thing Sucker. Me. You cheated me. Up there, plenty of ammo just for you. Way up there? Give me a boost and I'll get it for you. All right, all right. Have you ever given anyone a boost before, Steve? That's not how that works. You've clearly never given anyone given anyone a boost. Oh, awesome! You have done well. Now that your knight has made his appearance. He can join you in your descent into death. <laughs> the fucking Edwardian play is this. <laughs> I've been thrown into a Mac Machiavellian nightmare. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Wait here, Claire. Time to test out my new toy. <laughs> oh, I get to play Steve. Brilliant. Eat him. Just eat him immediately. What does that say? What did it say? What, what does that say? Something fought... Prisoner, criminal, two, six, seven. Oh, what's the, oh, there's a, oh, no. Family picture. Uh, check the family picture. Family picture. Oh, there's nothing on the back. It's a picture of Steve and his parents. Who is parents? Who is parents? Who is parents? Steve, his parents, and the nemesis on the wall behind them. How wonderful. The whole family all together. Daka daka. As much as I, I don't want him to actually run out of ammo. Can you just, just aim at the one? I've never wanted to sacrifice a character so much in my life. Uh, these can't be used with my submachine gun. <laughs> okay. What's this? A card reader. Indigo blue in colour. It's electronically locked. Claire's just like, I'm just going to leave him to it. He's got this. One of two things is going to happen. It's going to make my life easier, as in he's not going to die. Or it's going to make my life well easier, because he is going to die. It's 
It's secured with a simple lock. Unfortunately, Steve, you are not the master of unlocking. You're still alive. Oh, no, you're not. Oh, you nearly wasted ammunition on you then. Disastrous. Disastrous. Uh, there's a hang on part placed on the work desk. Ooh, there was a there was a, a something we could have picked up in that locker room, wasn't there? There was something we could have picked up in that locker room. We need to make a note for next time. We need to make a note for tomorrow. Um, chemicals used for gun maintenance. Hang on bullets. This can't be used with a machine gun. Cool. What are you even doing then, Steve? Let's be let's be real about this for a second. Why are you just going in there all guns blazing? I mean, you are playing cleanup duty, so I'm okay with that. But still. Oh, there's another door. <laughs> I didn't see the other door. Like, what are you actually doing? These are pressing against my ears. Which is not great. Oh, lovely. Kapow! Kapow! I'm uncertain how much more ammunition he's got. Oh, fucking loads. Just go for it, mate. Whoa, is, this a, is it a map? Uh, caution, breaker may fail due to overload. In case of failure, raise the lever as instructed. The ventilation device will resume operation. Okay. <laughs> it's a lot of words. I'm not listening to them. Uh, ooh, big big stone face. A relief of a weird looking face. Hang on bullets are in the mouth. Cool. Thanks, Steve. It was dirty work, but this area is now clean. Fuck it out. Yeah, good job, Dave. See? You, you can depend on me. You see? This thing is a lot more reliable than any person. <laughs> than people? That's a hundred percent Dante. I'm telling you. Who hurt you, Steve? Steve. What were you doing? Why do you like look like you have a bomb Who collar on? You here and where is your family? Shut up! I don't want to talk about it. It's a, a liberal waste of ammo in our current situation, Steve. mate. Never mind. Let's get going. I, I would honestly really like to go back to other parts of the game, please, if that's entirely possible. Or preferably find a save point. That would also be quite nice. Where the fuck am I? Seems like I can't descend from here. I'm sorry, are we in the prison of hope? Oh dear. Oh dear. Well, no going back now. Claire, are you okay? Steve, behind you. Zombies. No. Uh, Steve, could you just pull the trigger, mate? Is that a? Could you? Could you, Steve? I, uh, there's a time pressure here. What's you are wrong, gonna. Steve, shoot him! Wait! I, I can't! No! Steve!
player is 100% dead. There is no Steve. way Claire is not full of holes right now. Well, that answers that mystery. Father. 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 to work for Umbrella. I tried to steal information, intending to sell it off to the highest bidder. I was caught. I was killed. And you were sent here. Weird audio glitch. Oh, Steve. He was a fool to do something so reckless. So stupid. It's okay now. Just rest. Okay, I have control now. Good. Where am I? <laughs> I am here, so I want a save point pretty quickly, which is going to be that way. That looks like a save point. Ooh, lock the door, lovely. Oh my god, it's dark. I don't think that's the way I wanted to go. <laughs> Pretty certain that's not the way I wanted to go. <laughs> Can I? You're on the first floor. Uh, I will stay on the first floor. Thanks. <laughs> I now want to go this way. This is... Oh, God. It's so dark. Good. This way. Lovely stuff. Right. Well, that got a bit weird with Steve and his dad, didn't it? Um, I hate interrupting and stuff like that. What is this? It's into a picture of this room. What the fuck? What the fuck? Weird. Okay, right. Uh, how much inventory space have I got? Have I got enough to actually pick something up? I do not, no. It's unfortunate. Uh, combine those. Good. For all the purposes of the tape, just in case anyone's wondering how I automatically knew um, uh, where the save point was when I looked at the map there, is because I wanted to know where the save point was so I could save it at the end of the stream. Um, so I just googled maps for the training facility and it showed me a bunch of maps for it. Um, but it, uh, I then had to just get control of it. I saw I was in the garage, which is the room that we were in with Steve, which is, I actually can't, can I not move this anymore? Which was this one. Yep, the garage. So then I knew that this one was a, a safe one. Just in case there's any weirdness and any confusion. So that's why I knew. Because normally I would have nothing on the screens other than chat uh, OBS to let me know if it's breaking and then the game itself. Um, but I wanted to know. I didn't want to end it on a bit of a cliffhanger. And I didn't want it to. I didn't want to leave it running until tomorrow. So. Now you know. The more you know, right? The more you know. There's a little peek behind the curtain. Oh, dearie me. You know, thinking these graphics were so realistic. These ones are pretty realistic in comparison to the uh, the fucking fridge fridge with a face of uh, Leon Kennedy that we were playing a few days ago. Can't take any more items. No, I need a box. Someone give me a box. Uh, a man's portrait is displayed here. Right, so for the benefit of YouTube, different day for us, same video for yourself. Uh, we're going to continue on with uh, Code Veronica. Now, when we last left things, fucking Steve just uh, shot his dad to death. So we need to go and deal with that. Uh, it's very dark. Oh, oh, I'm using explodey arrows. I'm using boom arrows. 
Right, hopefully that's... That might actually still be too loud. Why is my microphone so low? So low, so low. My microphone is so low. Let's try there. Right? Let's that I mean that looks alright. I don't know. That that could be good. Who knows? Uh what's this? That's ah, fine. It's YouTube telling me that there's something live on your channel. I know there's something live on my channel. It's me. It's me. Uh, so also for anyone who is watching and um, wonders why I keep, I may talk to people who aren't in Twitch chat or you may hear me respond to messages that aren't on the screen. The chat you're seeing on the screen is the Twitch chat, but I'm also streaming to several other places like, including, but not limited to, uh, Twitter, Twitch, YouTube, Facebook, and Kick. All of those are all... Uh, being streamed to at the moment, I think. Anyway, <laughs> Let me just double, double check that. Yes, Twitch chat is not on screen. Oh, of course, because I was doing something dumb earlier, wasn't I? Oops. Uh, now there's my notifications. Where is my notifications? Good lord! I oh, know. Good. My notifications are there. Uh, what is this? Where do I need? Oh my god! Oh my lord! Chat, 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 chat. Where is chat? Where is chat? There is chat. Pow. There we go. Lovely. Sorry about that. I am a professional. And I want to get paid for this. What am I what am I thinking? Uh right. I would I wanna swap that out, don't I? Let's just use the the manual gun. The manual bullet chucker. Where am I even going? Good. That's, that's probably taken care of as much as I can. Oh, I can't see. Oh, I cannot see. Oh, there's a... I'm picking something up. I... Uh, sure, why not? Why not? Uh, no, I just want the map. I don't know where I'm heading now. Oh, I'm in a corner. Of course I am. No one puts Claire in a corner. And apparently Claire can't find the door. <laughs> Hola, how's Mike and chat? Are you are you winning? Are you winning, son? Yes, Dad, I'm winning. Little do they know my son is winning in the other room. Right. What's going on here? Steve's father. He is obviously dead. Obviously. In fairness, Claire, the amount of bullets he just stuck into him, you should also be dead because you were using him as a shield. I should leave him alone for now. Fair enough. I will I will leave Steve alone. For as long as he needs, because to be honest, he's my least favourite Resident Evil character, including all the zombies. <laughs> uh, Iron Scrap is blocking the, the battery outlet. Oh, okay, cheers. No, I got that. How are you doing, questionable results? Uh, and also, Winnipeg Bruce, how are you doing today? It's beautiful to see you both. A large size relief. The imagery appears to tell a legend. Okay. Is it the legend of two mysterious twins that turn evil and start a global pharmaceutical empire? By any chance. That's, that's, that's the story I'm feeling is going to happen. <laughs> Action dodge. Get off me. Get off. Don't you just sit there and wait. Mate. Mate, come on. Not a fan. Not a fan. Not a fan. Not a fan. Don't like this bit. There we go. Right, you guys just go to sleep. I am so injured right now. Oh, cute doggos. Yeah, of what's left of them. Uh, I was told I was at risk, uh, risk of redundancy today. 50-50 chance, but I've eaten two tubs of ice cream, so it's fine. Oh, mate. Oh, fuck. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. That Moog and Mudrin turn into zombies. I'll just let them eat me. That's I'd, I'd let your dogs eat me, too. I did that. Wait, did I take those? I think I took those. Yeah, day jobs are fucking shite, aren't they? 
like, why can't we just all live in a, like a streamer house and just play games for a living and just earn infinity million pounds? I don't even want to earn infinity million pounds, right? I don't even want to earn lots and lots of money. I would just like to scrape by. Like, I'd be super comfy with that. I'm not running anywhere. Is this open? No. Can I just take the tank? I'd like the tank. An old tank is being displayed here. 30k, yeah, thank you. <laughs> this could be suited to Alfred's tastes. Could it? Could it really? You've unlocked the door. Congratulations. You've learned how doors work. <sighs> oh God, no. I'm not I'm not in the mood for Wormy McGee. I'm really not. That's why the bastards always do it at Christmas. It's fucking awful. It really is. Genuinely, I could genuinely go on an absolute rant about today, but one, I don't know who's watching, and two, I I don't have it quite as bad as other people, although that's not, that is minimizing what I'm going through, but I just, do you, do you ever get that feeling where you're just so not fucked anymore, and you're just like, I don't, I don't even care. Like I don't, I really don't think I give any shits. I have less. I'm in a, sh I'm in a shit deficit. That's what I'm in. Deploys pillow fort for Bruce. Oh, question results. We all need a pillow fort. Um, let's go to basement floor one. There's never anything dangerous in a basement. That's fine. So yeah, I had some I had some bad vibes here in this seat, in fact. So I had just like five minutes before I was due to finish at four. So I just get up and sort of walk around and go in the go out in the rain and just in it is fucking hammering it down, let me tell you. But I was like, I'm okay with this. I just I just need to go for a walk for a bit. So cleanse the seat with salt. I just set on fire. Man, I just <laughs> It's how I normally cleanse stuff. <laughs> Hey, positive. Vibe. I forgot about that email actually. I think I'm. I think we're due for a. It's been what has it been? Four months. Well, well overdue for a rebrand. Uh, caution: breaker may fail due to overload. In case of failure, raise the lever as instructed. Ventilation device will operate. Will resume operation. Okay, let's go down here. I don't really know what the goal is here, other than try to find the next ridiculously bombastic area in order to uh, explore. But I have a hemostatic for some reason, and I don't know why, and a biohazard card, which I think, I think probably I should hold with tongs. And there's lots of naked zombies coming after me, and I really don't understand why. Hey. <laughs> uh... So the machine's used kind of a, it seems to have been it seems to have been used it seems to have been in use for a long time wow language is really hard isn't it Whew. lordy over the grid there's an indigo blue card reader so i don't i don't have wait hang on is the thingy how do inventory how inventory do uh check this is this indigo in color khaki shining in silver Okay, no, this is just for the training facility. Cool, got that. Thanks. What's the exit button? I don't want to accidentally use a use something. Stop it! Stop it, you fuck! There we go. Uh, well, that that still looks bad, doesn't it? Anything here? No. Should we go and pillage what Steve left us? Do 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 do. Yeah, I need to I need to faff around a little bit with where this microphone sits because like it it that's the sweet spot, right? That right there. Um, and I need to uh, I need to have a bit of a play around with where it sits and where it is and whether or not I need this thing on it anymore. I can't carry more items. I need a box. I require a box. I will go back and wait. Where's the nearest box? I've completely forgotten the layout of this place. 
Uh, but oh, is this lift broken now? I'm gonna guess this lift is well broke. Why can I hear a thump thump? Either something's got a very wooden heart, or there is something trying to jump up there. I don't know which it is. Uh, yes. Yeah, well overdue. Now I'm focusing more on horror. I think I'm well overdue for a rebrand. <laughs> that little happy food dance gif of me is fucking brilliant. <laughs> oh, when I'm doing this. <laughs> uh, there's nothing useful. Well, is there not though? Ooh, gun parts. Handgun part placed on the work desk. It cannot be used with the M93R. Oh, fine. I'll take this gun food then. Um, yes, handgun bullets. So I just, I just really needed... Because obviously it's Monday, so it's stream day. I'm like, I needed a break. So I just went for a walk in the rain. And it just started absolutely hammering it down. Like, there is a flood on the horizon. I can feel it. Another one. So, God knows what that's going to bring. Fortunately, touch wood, or whatever composite material this is made of, um, we've not been in a position where we need to... Uh, what, we've been in a position where we need to move stuff upstairs. We've not been in a position where we anything has happened downstairs for us to move stuff upstairs. But there, there has been at least one time where we're like, maybe we should move the electronics upstairs. Like, just the stuff that's near the floor, you know? Right, so this is clearly not the way I want to go. So that was, that was basement floor one, right? And floor one is just the... Yeah, let's go to floor two. Floor one is uh, your dad's dead floor. Uh, basement floor is Steve Steve Akimbo wreckage area. This is floor two. I need to turn Discord off. One of the only problems with having uh, a Discord is people then try and have me as friends on Discord, and I'm like, I don't, I don't think you understand how antisocial I actually am. Um, indigo blue in color. It's electronically locked. Okay, turn. Right. What's this way? I'd say I'd sip my tea, but every time I sip my tea, I get jumped by a zombie. Either on two legs or four. Oh, this is where we were earlier. It seems I can't descend from here. Nods in introvert. I'm one of those weird people that I can I mask introvert very well, but I can also so I can I can be the life and soul of the party. Do not get me wrong, right? Especially if I've had a drink. But uh, you give me half a chance, I will sit in a like a darkened room with a game or a book or something like that for days that happened once actually my wife went away for like a weekend uh for like a work thing and i ended up uh playing stardew valley for like two and a half days straight <laughs> i just on, on the switch i only i only took breaks to eat food and sleep and occasionally wash and i'm like well there's no one you know there's no one to worry about <laughs> grins an extrovert who is already performing his discord friend <laughs> It's normally like people. Uh, what's a what's a good way of putting this? If if a rando just randomly adds me to Discord, I'm like, nope, absolutely not. And I, the good thing about publishing so much content recently is that it's getting good numbers, right? People are seeing it, people are enjoying it, especially the YouTube stuff. Weirdly, the long form YouTube stuff, even the five minute stuff, is not getting many views like at all the shorts and the tiktoks are getting thousands and thousands of views <laughs> you know they're getting r absolutely mental numbers hey dot sisu how you doing introvert hermit reporting in all right i need i need a, a box uh i need something i don't know i don't even know how i can get back i can get back through the worm bit can't i 
I can definitely get back through the worm bit. I just don't want to go through the worm bit. Let me grab that thing I was looking at, that map I was looking at. Uh, that's not what I was looking at. <laughs> Do you remember an entry in your Google search history that you just like, when on earth do I look for that? Like what? It's a real it's a real gamble typing anything, any single letter into my search history. Um I can hear my keyboard, that's horrible. Don't like that. Don't like that at all. Um uh, right, where are we? We're at the military training ground now. Oh yeah, we've just been to the airport, haven't we? Okay. I think I know where we're going. I think I know where we're going. There was part of me earlier that was like, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to enable ads. I'm just going to put, you know, a minute ad every, or a three minute ad every hour and a half or something like that. And that'll, that'll help boost my income with regards to Twitch. And I'm like, just doing that out of nowhere feels like the shittiest thing I could possibly do. I'm like, I don't, I don't want to do it just because I've had a bad day. I'm like, I don't want to, I don't want to absolutely fuck people over just because I've had a bad day. Um, check, 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 check. Oh, it's just blue. Ashford family's crest, an eagle grasping a gold halbard. The indigo, in, indigo, indigo, the indigo blue plate portion appears to be made of special alloy. Special alloy, not just alloy, special. We all know what that means, right? We all know what that means. Right, what is what is this? So there's a blue painting, there's a thingy painting, there's a big desk. I don't even know what this means. What What is even, what's going on here? There's evidence that a picture was hung here. Good. Uh, a man's portrait is displayed here. Can I, can I burn it? Like, I hate to say that, but... Use? No? Okay, cool. <laughs> I've equipped the lighter, though. Yay. So now I can maybe see where the fuck I'm going. Oh, dear. Report anomaly. Absolutely. Oh, what's this? The card reader. Indigo blue in color. I don't, like... I need an actual card for that. It's not this, is it? No, of course not. That was just me. That scratchy noise is me clutching at straws. That's what that is. What is this? Nothing. Right. I think... What was back here? This was Steve is dead dad. Um, God damn it, Steve. Do -do 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 -do. Steve. Do -do 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 -do. Steve. Right. I vaguely remember there being a need for a plate of this type somewhere in the military training facility. I think... But I do not recall fully. So let's go. There's clearly nothing here. So we're going to go back. I was hoping sort of um, what might happen is we might get... Uh, basement one? Yeah. We might get closer to the ending now in this stream. And on Friday, we might finish this. So then the next week, we can start rolling back into um, normal shitty pants indie horror games. Um, and and big in and big indie horror games as well. Big indie horror games, no, and big games as well, but not retro horror games is what I'm trying to say. Right. Wait, that's not. No, I'm going the wrong way. I'm legitimately going the wrong way. I'm certain I am. Yeah, I'm sure of it. Absolutely sure of it. I never realised just how absolutely fucking batshit bonkers this game is. I was explaining to my wife last night about the progression of this game, and she was like, did I just have, like, a stroke? 
Like, no, you didn't. That's, that's how it goes. Like, it goes fucking prison, graveyard, military base, uh, palace, submarine, airport. It's like someone just picked all the best bits out of a, like, secret base starter kit. Uh, I need Steve. Where's Steve? I don't need Steve. Let's pull that, pull that out there. Go the Steve. I hate to trip over your dad, but yes. So this is yes. Okay, this is where I thought I was going a second ago, but I'm like, I don't think that's where I was going because I remember drinking tea and being bitten by dogs after I'd seen Steve. Right, sweet. Let's get fucking rid of this. No, get lost, mate. Absolutely not. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, it's... Oh, oh, it's a... Yeah, okay, cool. Log me release from the ventilation is complete. Right, sweet, whatever. Don't care, scan the card. <laughs> God damn it. It's that, it's that one. Are there any others? Oh, I can use it on this one. God. <laughs> can you just grab the UK naval facility? What did I say? I can't remember. <laughs> there we go. Zombies? No zombies. Uh, this is this is the problem when people say, oh, no, you just described this, or you just grabbed that to a T. I'm like... I don't pay attention to what the mouth words. I don't. That's your job. I don't. I don't have a on and off switch. This just. This shit just comes out. It's like a hole in a bucket. <laughs> that's all it is. <laughs> right. What's this way? Other than certain death. Absolutely certain death. Wait. Have I? Oh, hello. Oh, fuck off. I've been here before. This is where Bucky McNutcase tried to shoot me. Go upstairs, Claire. Go upstairs. Are they going to follow me? I just tried to move the stick to see the camera angle then. I don't know if they're going to try and follow me. No, they're clearly very well-trained doggos. Aha! I knew it was here. Oh, I didn't know. I knew there was something here. Prison, graveyard, palace, submarine, penitentiary. Yeah, pen. Yeah, I think that's in Southampton. <laughs> yeah, that's fair enough. There's a, there's a definite British vibe to that. I won't lie. <laughs> really, if we're going to do it, we're going to do it bloody right. Do you know what I mean? And everything has to be gilded and fucking ostentatious to fuck. Uh, yeah, I'll take the emblem key. Um, um, start. I gotta remember that number, that fucking thing, that button. I've just realized I don't have my Twitch events up, so if anyone redeems another weird games media anecdote for infinity million points, then I won't see it. There we go. Um, ah, so I'm doing check this emblem card. Is it indigo blue in color? It's indigo blue in color. I can use this. Is it training, training, military training facility? Military training, military, military training. Training, military, military training. Oh, God, I've hit a loop. <laughs> yeah, when you use the same place for 500 years, you just kind of get all the add ons. Yeah. This used to be a prison, before that it was a museum, before that it was a palace, before that it was a prison, before that it was another prison. <laughs> and before that it was an insane asylum. Right. I, so I could go back and use the card on the other doors. Mm. What? Wait, let me just see what's over here. Is this a silver door? Silver door. Sure, why not? 
thanks. That's the first time you've actually said that. Ha ha, dickhead. Um, is this the save room? I can't remember if this is a save room. It sure as shit looks like a save room. Sure as you like it. Oh, thank God. Give me that box. Give me that fucking box. Uh, right. Hemostatic. Get get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Oh, no. Actually, keep keep that in case I see any... Uh, uh, Duffers, any any biggins. Uh, right, save. Oh, do I want to save? Of course, I want to save. It's me. Of course, I want to save. Otherwise, I'll die. Yes. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Lovely, 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 lovely. Right, stick this in the box. Stick this in your box. Um, oh, I've got three there. Lovely, and I got four. Fantastic. Uh, okay, so fuck, I'm just gonna go back to where I know there's a blue, there's a blue card key door. That's what I'm gonna do. That's exactly what I'm doing. Oh, oh, there's there's, there's bullets there. Wait, there's two lots of bullets here. Did I not pick these up earlier? Did these <gasps> do the bullets respawn? Probably not. I probably just fa failed to pick these up earlier after I skipped the cutscene after I died to that big green prick. <laughs> Greeny green. Firstly, fucking brilliant to see you. How you doing? Secondly, you are absolutely correct. I will need the hemostatic thing in about five minutes. No, don't get up. You don't need to get up. You don't need to get up. I just... I'm out. <laughs> I don't want to have to kill dogs if I don't need to. Especially if I can run away from them. Oh, shite. Uh, did it come from this way? <gasps> no, we're fine. Grave Digger Gary. Good old Grave Digger Gary. It's the Grave Digger. He'll eat your face. Doing the cooking thing. Oh, God. I need to. I'm going to have to ask you what you're cooking after you come back. Wait, where did. Wait, stop. That, hang on, Steve. Where did Steve and his dead dad go? I need. Oh fuck! I've lost a child. I've lost. A, someone put on an announcement. I've lost a child in the facility. Ooh. Anyways, I could do that. I do need to set up a lurk command. Actually, I keep forgetting to do it. Um. Yeah, now let's. Uh, yeah, it's fine. this is not a door. That's not a door. That's not a door. This is a door. Yeah, that's a door. I'm on the first floor. I will go to the second floor. Because I'm pretty sure that's where the thing was. I think, anyway. I think that's where the thing was. Uh, ooh. Yes, that's what this is what I'm looking for. A very important question for question results when he gets back. Firstly, what are you cooking? Secondly, what are you selling? It's a dead man. Hello. Can I just shut it again and you just like... Pfft. Do you have something on you or are you... You're... I don't think you're really dead. Oh, you know you are. 
It's very dark in here. Flickery, flickery. The albinoid description. A creature which is created by injecting the T-virus into the genes of a salamander. Characteristics. Fucking deadly. <laughs> Similar to the normal amphibian, an albinoid's body will change as it grows with age. Don't we all? When young, an albinoid is small in size, but it can grow to over seven feet in a very short time frame. Ten plus hours. My God. They possess high mobility and are able to discharge electricity. Aren't we all? Uh, these characteristics are most notable when they are underwater and in adult form. Okay, cool. So that's me never going in the water again. Sweet. So sweet. Uh, this is grenades, isn't it? I don't want to take those when I don't have a grenade launcher. So I'm going to need to make a note at some point as to where all this crap is. Because there's some back where uh, we ran through Steve's chaos corridor. Oh, army proof. Lovely. It's 100% army proof. We've got navy proof. We've got army proof. What's the what's the next one? Zombie proof. <laughs> that's the that's the third uh, uh, <laughs> emergency service. Why is that why is that where my brain went? That's the that's the third armed service, right? Army, navy, and zombie. All right, what's the is this a door? I mean, it sure looks like a door. The log has been released. Uh, oh no, I don't feel like I want to go in here. Oh, I'm here! Hooray! What's this? Oh, this is literally the room I've just been in. Literally the room I've just been in. I've just done a big loop. Sleep, doggo, sleep. You're fine. I'm just going to sneak past. I wish you could sneak. I really do wish you could sneak in this. I would make things a lot easier. Mwap, 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 mwap. Right, where do we need the thing? The Where was the... Where was the these reliefs? Where was it? <laughs> um... Do not know. Not going here yet. Not complete. Right, cool. You've not you've not done venting your gas yet. Got it. So that goes in there. That goes in there. I can't get through there. I wonder if I can get through there. Oh no, that's where I'm going. That's that's the thing, isn't it? Um Oh hang on, what's through that bit? Uh nope. Uh nope, that's not the button. That's still not the button. Bap, bap, bap. Uh, I no, I am going the right way. I think. Well, I say I, I'm say I'm going the right way. I'm going the way I want to investigate, which to me is the right way. Whether it's traditionally the right way, I don't know. But I am what they call a trend setter, so. I don't know if I like setting some trends. Right, is this lock locked? The door is locked. I can't open it. Oh, okay. I thought I could open it. Curses. Do I have anything I want to drop? Oh, yeah. The Grenadios. That's what I want to get rid of. El Granadas. Oh, I keep hitting my thumb on the microphone, sorry. 
I now can't remember. No, I don't want to pick that back up. Stop pressing the wrong button, you fool. Uh, I can't remember where to use the army proof. I can't remember where to use the navy proof. Yeah, I can't remember where I used it. Curses. Curses. So now I could probably go back to where Steve had his little episode. His little Dante with guns episode. Oh, I say Dante with guns. Dante episode. Um, and pick up all the bits and pieces. There was also a blue card key there, wasn't there? I remember that. I remember. Now, how do I get back there? I think I go left here because I think this is the worm space. It is. This is indeed the worm space. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. We're fine. We're fine. We're totally fine. To totally got it. Totally got it. Absolutely fine. Right, go this way. Hmm. Yeah, it's weird this, this weekend. Obviously, because I've been streaming a lot, I haven't really had a lot of chance to um, uh, experiment with my audio settings. For some reason, when I go over a certain decibel limit, I hear this weird humming and buzzing in my headphones when I'm using my microphone. And I, I know I can I can figure out what's causing it, but I need just a bit of time just to you know play with it basically and figure out like is it the microphone in the wrong position? Have I accidentally crossed a cable and it's causing interference? All that sort of good stuff. Um the sort of stuff I really enjoy doing. But it means I just need a bit of time to actually look at it. So I'm hoping this week, because I've got some free time this week during the week, um, that I'm during the evenings, I'm going to be able to just sit here and have a bit of a, a faff with it. So I'll get it sold before Friday. But who knows? Uh, you look. Oh no, you're you're dead, dead, aren't you? Where the fuck am I going? I've completely once again forgotten what I'm doing. Going this way. I shouldn't talk. I. Why do I stream? I can't think and talk at the same time. Why do people watch this? This is like watching someone who's never played games before. I literally just got out of the elevator. Fucking hell. Jesus fucking Christ. You're on the second floor. Go to which floor? B1F. I think he's a robot in Star Wars. That's far too strong for me now. That Earl Grey tea is far too strong for me is the most middle class thing I've ever said in my life. That and past the pate or something like that, which was a Christmas once. I'm just like, wow, I'm really, I feel really horribly posh. <laughs> uh, was it this way? I don't know. If what what even is this? Why is this a thing? Does this hurt me? Gas from the freezing device is leaking out. The ventilation device is working. Right. Why does this feel like it's it, it's into, okay? Cool. Why does it feel like I need it? No, I can't. No, there's nothing. I don't think I can ex explode yet. I am uh, in the same boat as uh, Bruce Foodwise at the moment because I have a pint of uh, a pint tub of um, Ben and Jerry's fish food in the freezer downstairs. Also, horribly lactose intolerant, so I'm going to, need to definitely take my tablets before I <laughs> dive into that bad boy. Normally, I get like the dairy-free stuff, which is really nice. Don't get me wrong, the grenade launcher, hooray! Um, but yeah, I was just like. The other day, I'm like, I really fancy this, and I don't know why. And then today happened, I'm like, now I get it. I get it. Take care with it. The ice cream is rebelling. Ice cream does try and kill me. 
not as much as milkshakes. Oh, Jesus. A, sh a good thick milkshake will be the end of me. Oh, not since the end, not since the bad times have I had a good thick milkshake. I had like a, a Yorkshire double cream milkshake once. It was delicious, don't get me wrong. Simple lock. Fucking smash it. Absolute. No, right, cool. Who protects their grenade? Oh, I, see. I guess they would protect their ammo with bulletproof glass, wouldn't they? That would be a thing that they would do. Uh, right, we saw something gun party earlier, didn't we? Come on. It's there. There's a green chemical there. What are you What are you waiting for? Okay. I'll, yeah. Uh, and I woke up in the middle of the night, um, uh, thinking I was gonna die. I, I legit thought I was dead. I thought I, this is it. I'm I'm gonna have to ring nine nine nine, and then I just went and lay on the yoga room floor for a bit. The room in what we do yoga. So it sounds so posh saying yoga room. It's the room. That's the spare the spare bedroom basically. <laughs> Many a time I've confused people because they're like, how many rooms does your fucking house have? Because I've got the craft room, I've got the spare room, and I've got the yoga room. <laughs> no, they're all separate as well. Because <laughs> we have a three-bed house and only one bed. <laughs> oh, no, it's not that way. For real, though, this is this house is far too big for us. Um, this way, I guess. Right, so I've got a grenade launcher, which is fan dabby dozy. Um, so now, now where? Like, I need, I need to find. I think it's back the way. I need to go back and explore a little bit further because I explore a little bit more. Because I'm certain we were going to pick up some gun parts earlier and we couldn't. And I need to find where this pissing army relief goes. <laughs> but other than that, I'm really enjoying Code Veronica. Got to admit, it's bonkers as fuck, but I'm really enjoying it. Uh, is it first floor? Go first floor. I'm just going to first floor. It does make me want to play more of the Resident Evil games. Like, the ones I never even considered. Like, there was an Umbrella Chronicles, which I think was just, like, loads of mini-games. Not mini-games, but, like, mini-stories. Mini uh, that's not where I want to go. There's loads of, like, mini-stories from, like, different characters, I think. Um, and Outbreak. Oh, Survivor as well. The light gun game. Oh, I can actually use... Have I still got... Where is that? Please don't lie. That's right, people. We've reached that point of the stream. <laughs> Time to get the artillery out. <laughs> this is the, um, what was it called? The Sindon light gun that I got ages ago. It works with PC and um, uh, anything with a USB plug, basically. But it's for modern TVs, so you can play light gun games on a modern TV. So that's going to be something I do in the future. I can't think of any any horror light gun games. There's not one horror-based light gun game I can think of. Not a single solitary one. Can't think of any any light gun game with anything like zombies in it or anything. Can't just for the life of me. Cannot think of anything. A series of games maybe with dead things in a house that I could play through. Nothing. There's just nothing. Time crisis. Time crisis is definitely what I was thinking. 
That's a hundred percent what I was thinking. Right, let's go back this way. There's part of me that's like, how can I make that work without emulating shit? And I'm not sure I can, I'll be honest. Oh lord. Oh lord. Gravedigger Gary's back. What is this? It seems to have stopped on the lower floor. I can't use the elevator. Fine. Go fuck yourself. It's securely locked. I can't open it. Over the door next to it then! Now. Calm down. Duck Hunt. Yes! It's the cursed version of Duck Hunt though. Coming next on Smith Smiths. Uh, let's go back this way. I don't remember what's this way actually. Duck hunk die. Duck, duck hunt dot exe. Wow, I've got to be careful how I say that. Oh boy. <laughs> uh, so this is on fire, which is fine. Duck hunt dot exe. I can't be, can't be super careful with my enunciation here. <laughs> right, go down here. I'm certain there was something we missed. Yeah. Is that a door? Uh, the door's been completely destroyed. Then surely I can go through it, right? The door's been completely destroyed. Again, surely I can go through it. I think what you mean is the passage is blocked. The way is blocked. It's not the line, but you get what you get what I mean. Then. Go away, you naked freaks. And the zombies. <laughs> that might be the only time I would I would actually uh, emulate a retro game. I'd want to own the retro games that I emulate, though. Um, is if I uh, if I emulated them to use them with this light gun, and then. Uh, used a better light gun for it so like house of the dead or time crisis or dog Hunt and stuff like that i'd want to i could emulate that because i'm i am not buying a crt in this day and age oh boy with retro what is going on here with with retro stuff that as pricey as it is right now i am not buying a crt tv also no one has space for a crt tv these days like no one um, what's in here? What's in here? What's this? Nothing. Let's go. All the grands I know are dead, though. That's the thing. <laughs> right, hang on a minute. What happened? Oh, I I get it. You you all crawled through the fucking windows, didn't you? You done crawled through the bloody windows. All right, fucking Mitchell brothers over here. I'm not standing near. Oh, you're, you're there. That's fine. Please deposit any, Please deposit any dead games you may have. Giving you my fucking items. Fine. No need to deposit since it's not metal. Go, go, fuck yourself. De deposit the other thing then. Don't let me deposit it then. No need to deposit because it's not metal. Fine. Right. Yeah. Cool. 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 So that's it, right? Yeah. Uh, oh, I've got no weapons. <laughs> I just tried to shoot it. Uh, construction stuff. Construction stuff. Boring. Boring. Right. This has got stuff in it, hasn't it? Yes. Why, yes, it has. Not that I can fucking use it. Um, nothing here. manufacturing shite 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 that's all that is that's all we've got there oh cold drink please stand by your, your viewership is important to me but also so is my wife so
Uh, what would I do? Right. Um, okay. Right, what's in here? God, there's bound to be somewhere in here. Uh, secure my line. Something, something, prisoners, something, something, not my problem. What's this? A Mazzolina's already been sent. Fantastic. Shuttle lock has been released. Door has been held by something. I can't open it. Right, fine. Well, that's just fucking useless, isn't it? God damn it, Claire. God fucking damn it. Swear to God. You are not making this easy. Wait, what is this button? Is this button a thing? The release switch of the motor, the deactivation lamp is on. Right. So that doesn't help me in the slightest, does it? Because if I pick any of this up, surely it's going to... Wait, wait. Yeah, that's exactly what I thought was going to happen. Wait, so what else closes around here? What else happens? <gasps> nothing! Big old fat nothing. Right, all right. Push the switch. Yeah, thank you. Please deposit any metallic items you have in the security box. You go fuck yourself. Uh, right, do that, do that. It's been a long day, game. Oh, God, that was a fucking close one. What is this? Something hanging off the wall. No, that's not something I need. Take the metal items you have placed in the security box. I'm not leaving without my guns, don't worry. Uh, that one, and that one, and that one, and that one, and that. Lovely. Thanks very much. Bye. Right, so this place is a bust. That's what this place is. We need to go somewhere else. <sighs> All right. Not that way. Not that way. Not that way. Got it. I cannot for the life of me remember where that bloody relief was. Oh, wait. Shut up. Wait. It. I need to go to the submarine. That's where I need to go. I need to go to the palace. I'm going the wrong way. I'm mega dumb. Du -du 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 Do you like this little, uh, this little jaunt? Uh, no, thank you. I will be going this way. Do -do -do. Right, go back across this bridge. Okay. This is the tourism edition of uh, Resident Evil Code Veronica. X. Code Veronica X. Which I'm sure has some sort of relevance. Even though whenever I look up the games, it's the X is not mentioned. It's just Code Veronica. Go up the stairs. Claire, go up the stairs. This is not the way I meant to go. What the living shit? I don't think so, buddy. Nope. No, thank you. Nope. No, 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 no. Oh, but this is the palace, so there's that. Uh, right. Load that. I know. Oh my god, I know I'm a can't be used by itself. You're gonna make me have a fucking embolism gr brain. Grain? Grain? You're gonna make me have an embolism grain? It's this way. Losing my actual fucking mind. <laughs> oh my god. How was everyone's weekend anyway? I know I've not really spoken to people a lot uh, during streams. Uh, some people have been here, some people haven't. Um, so, did anybody do anything exciting over the weekend? I streamed a lot. Oh no, I went to a spooky market. I went to a, a pagan market, which was nice. I got a Stay Spooky sticker, which is lovely. Um, and I got a new mug, which you've all seen already. Uh, and that was pretty much it, to be honest with you. Uh, we bought some art. 
um, and had a, a great discussion about uh, at what point do you consider being a grown-up? Is it when you stop putting things up with blue tack and start putting them in frames? <laughs> and I'm like, I never thought of it like that. That's a very good point. <laughs> You went to see your grandparents with your parents. Fantastic. That's awesome. Proper family trip. I like that. Uh, I would I would enjoy that, but being Batman adjacent, I have neither parents nor grandparents, so it's not something I can partake in. Oh, I appreciate it when people do it. I think it's lovely. Uh, it's this way. I don't even know if this is going to do a thing. I'm just getting rid of an item at this point. Whee! In this obvious doom lab. Or whatever we're calling this. Oh, man. Wait, hang on. Was that Wait, hang on. Was there not a way we didn't go last time? Wait, is this where the thing is? Is this where the, the item... Oh, there's another item here. It's an ink ribbon. I will leave that right now, which I'm pretty sure is what I said last time and then completely forgot it. Why does my run button not want to stay pressed down? She keeps doing this weird sort of shuddery run. Like that. Like I'm pressing it multiple times, but I'm not. Oh, fantastic. Bye-bye. Oh, there's more. There's more of you. Bye-bye. Wait, is these... No, these aren't the, the uh, am amphibian boys, are they? Oh, good. Oh, yes. I remember this bit. I remember this bit very well. Um, But there was nothing special in here, was there? No. Where the hell was that fucking gun piece? Was it down here? What was down here? Up here, sorry, up here. What was up here? I have no idea. Oh, this is the crane bit. I don't need the crane anymore. All this duff computer. What's in here? <gasps> it's a door. Excellent. A thousand doors, one door, door creaking noise. Um, elevator, iron bridge, the control lever is missing. Cool. Forgot about that. Yeah, you keep doing this weird juddery run. I don't I don't know what it is. Maybe the button's day. Maybe it's just my rage at, uh, at work that has uh, fueled the juddery run. Who knows? But you, can I just take the control lever off the crane? Like I was like, oh. Is that not how it works? <laughs> POV, you've never been an engineer in your life. Uh, control panel for the shutter. Uh, marking above the keyhole reads K402. Lovely. So this is pointless. Awesome. Oh, I have a feeling you guys are going to get right in my way. You are going to get right up my nose. Nope. Nope. All right, maybe not. Okay, cool. That, that that resolved itself. So I'm thinking, which is always a danger for me, let's be honest, um, of doing an offline game and then just posting them to YouTube. I'm thinking of doing a new cozy game. I'm thinking of doing Cozy Grove, which is a game about death, but it's a cozy game about death. Why are these paintings? I need a painting, there are. Um, but it's made to be played in two to three hour intervals. So I'm thinking that is fucking brilliant. Now offline, completely offline in my own spare time, um, I have played it for about 400 days. <laughs> so I, I like to think this is where I need the thing. Um, I like to think I could probably deliver decent, decent playthroughs of that. Um, but... Well, there is no but. I say I just I just making conversation. Use the army relief. Click, click. Excellent. That did fuck all. Lovely. Right. Let's go back. Let's see. Let's go back to the training facility because we haven't gone through anywhere else with a fine tooth comb.
one of the major things this has made me want to do is seriously play Signalis on stream. Which is a fantastic game. Weird as shit, but a fantastic game. And it really feels... Like, I always see these games that say, oh, PS1 inspired, PS2 inspired. And I'm like, yeah, but you just... All you've done is you've just made it look low poly. And I'm like, actually, no. Some of the mechanics are now, because I'm playing PS1 slash PS2 survival horror games, some of these mechanics are spot on. You know, I keep twatting this microphone. I'm so sorry. I just, I'm not, I'm not with it today. Christ almighty. I'm just not, I'm just not, I'm just not. It's not, a, it's not a day. I it, Today is not the day and I am not that guy. I'm sorry. Climb the ladder. But I'm here. Do you know what I mean? I'm here. I'm doing, I'm doing, I'm giving it, I'm giving it mouth words. So, right. Don't need that anymore. Uh, I need to spin this, spin this wheel right round. Take the steering wheel. I don't want to take the steering wheel. I just want off here. I don't. Uh, sure. I take the steering wheel. I don't want the steering wheel. I just want to be back here. Don't give me the steering wheel. Thank you. <laughs> don't don't do that to me. I'm certain I had some sort of gun part that I've missed. I've clearly made this up in my own head. Maybe I just wanted a gun part. Who knows? Um, right. Let's go up here and make our way back to the train facility. These earphones. What are these? These earphones have no protection in the ear. So these metal bits sit right on my ear. You think, given my affliction with gas, I would, uh, that's gear acquisition syndrome, I would buy myself a new pair of headphones that I could use solely for this purpose. But I haven't. Oh, I've got the Lugers. Oh, fuck me. I've got the Lugers. Oh, where the fuck did you guys come from? Well, it's not my problem. I just want off this bloody island. That's all. That's all I'm here for. I just. Oh. Oh. Do you know? I'm very silly. We never investigated this because I didn't have a gun at the time. What is in here? The water pipe is broken. Right. Gotcha. Right. What's this? This is a. De, de aluminum case? What? I, I, can I not read? De alumin. De alumin. De, I don't even know what that is. Is that real? I don't... I do not get what that is at all. You can't just say attache case or something, or flight case, or briefcase even. No. It has to be some fancy word. Durable aluminum... Uh, <laughs> I can't even talk. I can't even say words I know. <laughs> toilet is made out of marble. <laughs> I read that. The toilet is made out of marbles. Ooh, that would be a horrible toilet. Kick it open. Kick it open. Kick it open. Okay, so nothing in there. Is that a shiny handle? No. I think it was more... Um, it's all dried up. Just like me. Uh, I think that's all there was in here. Um, yeah, I, I, I wanted to just sort of make people aware that cozy games aren't actually going anywhere. And weirdly, I have a plan and for uh, post-Christmas. And obviously, no one's going to like it. Everyone, brackets, everyone disliked that. Um, <laughs> I'm now thinking that should be a, a thingy above the channel. Uh, silver crest carved on it. No, fuck off. Fuck off. That should be a notification on the channel. Uh, so and so followed. Everyone liked that. I don't, I don't know if it's this way. I think it's up. I, you know, I think it's upstairs. I think I'm just fucking running around for the sake of it. Just so I can talk to you lot. Um, yeah, I don't. This, there is nothing in here for me, I don't think. I've gone the wrong fucking way. Back. 
But yeah, I got a plan for post Christmas. I've got loads of stuff planned up until Christmas. I've got fucking shitloads planned up until Christmas. Oh my god. That content coming out of my ears. It's locked. A gold crest. Right. Get off me, you weirdo. And you. Um, you pudding filled weirdo. I would like to just go this way, please. Please leave me alone. That one's locked, and I'm not sure why. Oh, fuck off. Honestly thought I dodged you then. Get off! I'm going to have to use that fucking fade spray, aren't I? What a shitbag. Right. All of this because I don't know why this is locked. It's locked. A silver crest. No, not the map. Am I at danger? I'm still at caution. Oh, what's in the case? What's in the case? What's in the case? Uh, check it. Open it. It's secured by a simple lock. I could be open. I could open it if I had a lock pick. If only we had Jill. You're a poor. Oh my God! You can climb the stairs. I forgot. You're a poor substitute. Bless her. She's doing her best. Do you know what I mean? Not not a lot of people can hold a candle to Jill. Don't, do, do you fucking die? Or, oh my god. Oh my god. Right now, I'm, I'm, I think I am actually in danger. I'm red caution, not yellow caution. That's, that's bad. Red caution is bad. Do you fucking... Oh my god. Dude. Give me a break. Han, I just... I just can't. <laughs> that guy can fucking do one, can't he? Absolutely do it. Right, give me my pissing Lugas. I need my golden guns, which are not as advertised. I'll be honest with you. I have been I have been hoodwinked. I've been led to believe golden guns are fantastic and, you know, insta-kill, never run out of ammo, all this sort of malarkey. No, none of that. None of that rubbish. Right. What? Uh, uh, do this. No, not equip. Oh, game. Use them. Thank you. If this is a trap, I'm going to quit. I'm just going to I'm gonna give up live streaming. <laughs> now open the door and then take the guns back. And then load them. And then... When was it thundering? So, have we, entered, have we entered an actual horror movie now? Oh, we might have. What am I Oh! <laughs> oh, the big flashy note on the table. Something is written on the memo. First digit, left, right. Second digit, left. Third digit, right. Fourth digit, right, right, right. You must not reset while maneuvering. Left, right, left, left, right, right, right. Oh, was that it? Left, right, left, right. <laughs> left, right, left, right, 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 right. Got it. Someone make a note. Oh, fucking hell. Stop pressing the button so many times. There we go. But this, there's no power going to it. How is it on? How is it on, Claire? Turn the computer on. Oh, okay. I will shut my mouth. Again. Psychopath. This game's going to get fucking weird. I'm telling you. This game's going to get weird. Like way weirder than we signed up for. Cool. Was that it? Oh, no, it wasn't. Please enter the password. Uh, Four-letter word. Not the ones you're thinking of. Um, let's try... But... Nothing happened. Right, okay, cool. Let's 
was there's a button. Which button will we press? Who made the note? Who made the note? Come on. Own up. Now, did this start with left, right, or right, left? I'm going to go with left, right. Left. Right. Left. Right. And then right, right, right. 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 Nothing. We we failed. What was the code? Come here. Something's wrong. Matter. First digit left right. Second digit left. Third digit right. Fourth digit right right right. Oh, for the for the computer, got it. So I'm so dumb. So left, right, left, right, 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 right. Got it. Okay. Oh my god! Stop pressing the fucking thing. That case could have been made out of something better, like unobtainium or something like that. Left. One. One. Someone note that down. One. Then it's left. One nine. Then it's right. One nine seven. Then it's right, right, right. One nine seven one. Nineteen seventy one. Nineteen seventy one. Nineteen seventy one. We might have done it, folks. No, I just exited the computer. Nineteen seventy one. Enter. Oh, that's not creepy at all, is it? That's fine. That's that's absolutely fine. The weird brother and sister dynamic there. It's weird. It is it's weird. Like we can't get away from it. Oh fantastic. That was a very soft landing for such a hulking mess. Uh yes. Hello. Get the fuck off me. Who gave you permission to do that? Well, that's, that, that took care of that business. Anyway. So anyway, I started blasting. There's a fireplace. It does not appear to have been used recently. Can I can I use the lighter? No. There's no need for this right now. Fine. Don't give me a tease like that. Don't give me, oh, there's a fireplace here. An old photo stand is placed here. Cool. An old photo stand is placed here. An old box of hang -on bullets is placed here. Take the hanging bullets. I will take the hanging bullets. Uh, what is next to the hanging bullets? Posh people decor. That's what that is. That's called posh people decor. Thick books are lined up here. None of your thin book nonsense. Thick books. I like my books thick. I like a thick book. Uh, right, I'm just going to... I'm not equipping bullets. I'm not throwing bullets at the enemy and hoping for the best. Just heat them up with a lighter and then throw them at the last second. No, it's not. It's not how it works. Not in the real world. In the real world, you don't even need to heat them up. Just chuck them and they'll explode. What on earth is this? What is going on? This is very Resident Evil. Oh my god, it's Castle Dimitrescu. It's actually Castle Dimitrescu. Ace, brilliant. Thump thump. Thump thump. Someone has a thump thump. 
Is it in a jar of dirt, though? That's what you need to know. Gross, I like it. Oh god. Right. Hello. Are you just normal now? Is this is this the thing? Oh wow, okay, you don't you take more than two. We can't take more than two and some bullets, right? Two and a bullet. Two and a bullet. No, thank you. I will be using the grenade launcher and I will be blowing you to kingdom come. I don't know if that... I was going to say, I don't know what happened there. I don't know if he died. I'm not wasting another bullet. Get off. Why? What a cute monster friend. Yeah, we call him Big Hand Pete. He's real handy to have around. That's definitely an item. People, people, that's an item on the floor if I ever saw one. That's an that's an item. Let me pick that up. Creepy statues are lined up here. The statues are what you find creepy. Not the wish.com tyrant creatures that are trying to kill you. No, it's the it's the statues. It's the statues will creep you out. Are they anomalies? <laughs> oh god, thump thump. Thump 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 thump. It's alright, we got this. Don't you? Oh. <laughs> How tense. Jump scare? No. Oh, I'm not shooting flappy things with a fucking grenade launcher. That's well wasteful. Uh, yeah, I, this, this this may be the first instance of Castle Dimitrescu from Resident Evil Village. Not Village. Resident Evil 8, 7, whatever it was. The one with the, the big blue vampire lady. I don't care about any of that. I just want to go away. Go, go. That the internet went absolutely insane for. Go away, please. I, can I just go in here? I just, I'm just gonna leave. I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna check out. Oh lord, I can't see a thing. And there's something over there. What's over here? Oh, it's you. <laughs> Thanks for that, dude. God damn it, Dave. Ow. Oh, did that kill you? That killed you. Nice. Now, can I just um, equip the thingy? Can I equip the lighter so I can see what the fuck I'm doing? There we go. That's good. That's, that's gooder than it was. Uh, what a mess. Yeah, what a mess. You are not wrong. An ink ribbon. Hooray. I mean, I'm happy I've got it, but I would have really gone for a healing item right about now. It's too dark to see anything outside. Don't stand by the window, you nutcase. Have you learned nothing? A fireplace. There's plentiful supply of firewood here. Use the fucking lighter in your hand, then. And just one more item in your hand. There's nothing useful here. Including you! Uh, use this way. That's how you combine bullets. Um, what a mess! 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 Am I? Is this? Is this a pointless room? Some armor is displayed. Please be a very old, nothing unusual. Oh, there's a plaque there. Wait, is that where the the thingy plaque goes? Some armor is on display here. Is this? Is this not a? Oh, it's not a it's not a thing. <laughs> okay. What is this room? Wait, what was that on the table? It's a glass. It's just a glass. Is there what is this? There is nothing useful here. Was this entire room just to Oh no it wasn't. It was to get bowgun arrows, of course it was. Just to get me to waste some ammo? Certainly what it feels like. 
cool. It, it feels like a, a a trash room. I didn't need to come in here at all. And now I'm just going to be eaten again by bats. Bats, I tell you. Bats. Uh, can I just... An assortment of creepy dolls are showcased here. Perhaps these are in the liking of the resident. No, stop, stop. Think, turn around. Walk, go, run. Oh my god, what is hanging from the ceiling? Look away, YouTube. It's not what you think. It might be what you think. I'm not sure. No, you don't. I'm under a cover. Now you can't get me. Um, oh, I, I missed the ladder. I missed the ladder. You know, those big, those big steep ladders. Those big shallow ladders, those stairs. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. This is going to get so super weird. Is this a door? No, it's not. Is this like a marionette? Uh, it has been completely broken. I can't pass through here. There's a big hole in it, though. So, I mean, yo, God. Oh, well, this is... That's slightly better than I expected, actually. What's this? Oh, it's just a bad shadow. It's a bad -o. Oh, God, a fade spray. <laughs> Yay, I can heal myself. I can heal my broken body. This is creepier... Well, excuse me. Creepier than I expected. I don't want to lie. Can I shoot this? No, I can't. <laughs> Such lush doors. I like the door game they've got going on here. Our enemy is only a little girl. So why is this taking so long? My apologies, Alessio. But I have been doing my best. The revival of the Astra Chandler depends on your success. Have we have we seen both the Ashford children in the same place recently? Nothing. I believe I must have been imagining things. Let us go, brother. One set for Prince. One set for Falls. Oh my god, that's so creepy. A large sized doll, possibly custom made. <gasps> I can't see. I can't see shit. Uh, not use equip. Wait, what is this? Oh, herbs. I wonder if it would let me pick those up if I hadn't have gotten the lighter out. That'd be an interesting, an interesting question. It's not something I'm testing right now. What's in here? Oh, thump 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 thump. Very ornate door. That's what's here. A very ornate door. At some point, this is going to be some sort of museum or prison or stately home. <laughs> it's definitely going to get turned into something else. They'll be charging admission for this, whatever it is. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Gorgeous furnishings here. Yeah. Yeah, I bet. And the music box is playing a beautiful melody. Something is written on the back of the lid. Red Queen and Blue King return. The path opens. Stop the music box. Not yet, thanks. I have a feeling that's going to do something horrible if I do that. So gorgeous furnishings here. Nothing useful. Sweet. Uh, a relief. What a relief. It seems to resemble a goddess. Can I go up here? Well, I can. 
Like saying, is this a ladder? The hole in the ceiling has been sealed. Oh, okay. Yeesh. Antique dolls on display, yeah. That could be Alexia's. Is this the room that they were in? Where did they go then? Oh, they will have gone through, I assume, that relief is a door. Uh, yeah, sure. I'll stop the music box. Feels like a bad idea. Oh, no, it's not a bad idea. Is, oh, is that the silver key? Is that the, oh, Claire. Come on, Claire. You can do this. Sorry, please stand by. Oh, I can't take him right. Yes. Right. Use eat the herb. Eat the herb. Oh, I'm now I'm no longer orange caution. I'm now just yellow caution. That's good. <laughs> One step away from death. Silver key. Uh, can I investigate the silver key to see if it's interesting? See how interesting it might be. A key made of pure silver. The Asher family cross is carved on it. Is that it? Nothing on the back? No, that's it. Okay. I mean, that's... Whoa! I could have lost my hands then. I could have genuinely lost a finger. Dolls. Oh, what's that? Miscellaneous books are piled up here. Okay. Bullets. More bullets. Uh, history is a topic of many of these books. Books on chemicals are piled up here. Another life size doll. If these dolls come to life, I am not going to be happy. There is nothing useful here. What is this? What what is this? Something covered up with a tarp, and I don't I'm not a big fan of it. I have a feeling it's gonna try and eat me. Oh I'm in a different room now. Got it. This is a different music box. Uh the music box is locked. The music plate inside has been pulled out. A blue sapphire is embedded on the opening. So there's like bug inserts there. And what looks like bugs. So I'm assuming I have to get like gilded bugs. Oh, there's one of those in the gun room, isn't there? Message card. My dear brother, I firmly believe that the glory of the Ashford family will be revived through your courage and strength as an honoured soldier. Yours faithfully, Alexia Ashford. Lovely. What a nice, what a nice formal card to send to your brother in the next room. How lovely. It appears to be a relief. It's of a woman's back. Uh, fair enough. Exquisite furnishings. There is nothing useful. Not just gorgeous, exquisite. Oh. Is this like, is that level up? What is that? What does that mean to people? Like, what does what does exquisite mean to people? Like, would you say exquisite is better than gorgeous, or gorgeous is better than exquisite? Like, is there a ranking system I don't know about for formal furniture? Who knows? I don't know. I thought I had footsteps then. A common picture. Wow, of Claire Redfield, art critic extraordinaire. Um, okay, so that's. I mean, we've we've ransacked this place, so let's go. <laughs> Until we have the items we need for further investigation, let's just go. <laughs> Alrighty. Good. That's not that's not creepy in the slightest. It's perfectly normal to have that in your main hall. Perfectly normal. Giant bloody marionette. Um, what was the other ways? What was that way? That was that was a, a duff room, wasn't it? We don't we don't care for that room. 
that just had a, an enemy and a fireplace in it and some bolts. That's all I had. That was a boo room. Uh, now, I've, now I've been this way, I've forgotten how to leave. So now we've got the silver key. So now we're going to go back to the training facility, which feels very far away now. I'm, I'm sad that there's not a shortcut. I'm not sure how there would be a shortcut. Maybe some sort of slide? I mean, I'd take a slide. Absolute guarantee something's going to jump on this bridge. I am aghast. Aghast that nothing attacked me there. <laughs> Stunned how quiet that trip was. This way. Uh, it, we did all this. Good. We killed back in uh, Big Arm Andy. And this is the, the Luger Room. Le Luger Room. So, what do we need to get rid of? I want to get rid of... I guess that at the minute. Let me just get rid of... Not, not that. Uh, let me get rid of these. Let me stack these. Keep the key. Take the cannoli. Um, do we have any other Heelys? I have a feeling I'm low on Heelys. I'm low on Heelys. That's, that's real unfortunate. How many grenade items have we got? Well, we've got not that many grenade I'm okay. Well, I say I'm okay. What if I run into a, a big arm Dave again and I, I die? Well, then I die, don't I? So let's take this and save. Use the ingredients. Yes, use the ingredients. i got loads of ingredients. Now I can save to my heart's content. Heart's content. Right. Go that, go that. Good, good, good. Right, lovely. Put this away. Put it away. Put it away. Put it away. What did he say? I tend to have some snacks, but they're very crunchy. All right, let's. Get a gun out. Wait, hang on. Stop stop the presses a second. What was that? Oh, use. Got it. Which, yeah, really confused me when I first saw it. Uh, silver crest. This is a silver door for a silver crest. It's locked. Use a silver key. Yeah. It's locked. It's been released. Good. You didn't, you didn't need to tell me that. That's more information than I needed, game. Thanks, though. I appreciate it. I'm sorry, have we found an arcade? Slot machines, one of them is turned on. We'll go with that one then. Slot machines, one of them is turned on. I'm at the one that's turned on. Right, fine, whatever. I'm at the, of course, I'm at the casino. Why would I not be at the casino? Let me pick this up. Is that um, arrow powder or whatever it's called? Oh, what's, what else is on here? It looks like there's something else on there. Like there's something, there's something thin and shiny. I mean, I can't, I am smashing the X button. I can't pick it up. That is bow gun powder. I don't know why that's so difficult to say. I think because that's not a term I've ever needed to use in my life. <laughs> Green herb, yes. Green herb, yes. Mm. Right. Com combine a herbius because uh, I'm a botanist now and then use excellent fine and dandy that's a blackjack table I've been to Vegas I know a blackjack table I want to see one antique grand piano it is designed so that it reads out data what what I see you found the officer's bar apparently so yeah Oh, well, a lovely, lovely balcony. No zombies, so very inconsistent. <gasps> Question results, what are you cooking? I was so excited to ask you earlier. <laughs> I want to live vicariously through you. Uh, one of them is turned on. I want to eat vicariously through you. I want to eat you vicariously. Wait, what? Uh, anyway. What were we saying?
Okay, cool. So that's done, I guess. We've we've ransacked the casino. Left all the money there for some unknown reason. Some bananas reason. Is this a quest I can take? No, it's not. Is there anything locked in in and around here? There's something locked down there. I don't know if that's a Oh no, that is a silver crest key, isn't it? Yeah, let's go let's go over there. I remember this. I remember this. I I have I have brain thoughts. Brain times. Brain time brain time pictures. It's <laughs> that's a good way of describing memories. Brain time pictures. Right, you guys are getting up my nose right now. I've had quite enough of your shenanigans. I am not in the mood, Jeffrey. Oh shit. Oh shit. Bye. Uh, is it this one? It's locked. Use the silver key. Yes. The lock has been released. You don't need this key anymore. I don't know about that. I thought there was more than this one, than these two doors that needed a silver key. I'm not sure about this. I am uh, i don't know. I don't know how... S Ow, piss. Right. Well, let's just fucking leave this be. Let's go get something bigger to shoot it with. If it just attacked me, that would be fine. I could outrun it. But it's straight. It's, it's a bad stretch Armstrong. That's what it is. It's a dark timeline stretch Armstrong, and I don't like it. Didn't stretch Armstrong have an enemy that was like that? Actually, oh no, I was just going to leave you alone. Yeah, didn't stretch Armstrong have a baddie that was like that? I can't remember. I had a stretch Armstrong though. That was one of the highlights of my childhood. That and the Talk Boy and the Gamecom. <laughs> Absolute dog shit. It really was. Right. Let's get a, a big bada boom. And let's go blow his face off. Like him face off. Where they took his face off. Sure. Sure, why not? I'm going to regret only taking that with two rounds in it. But... I'm I'm full of regret anyway, so I'm fine. I'm mainly I'm mainly made out of regret. Right, give me a minute. Bit Stargate. There we go. I love that. It's got a little privacy filter. This camera, so I can just turn it, and it just. 
Uh, Sober style noodles mixed peppers and prawns with a homemade sauce made from fried grated ginger and garlic, roasted sesame and honey and dark soya. <sighs> Don't ask how it's kind of ad hoc when I cook. My wife's like that. I can't ad hoc cook. I, I, I am the sort of person who will go into a kitchen and be like, we haven't got anything, but my wife will go in and be like, what are you talking about? I've just made this. And I'm like, I don't, I don't understand how you've done that. <laughs> I don't get how you've done that. I could, like, I could find noodles and then I could maybe, like, nowadays, I could definitely ad hoc cook better than I used to be able to. I could barely, like, five or six years ago, I could barely heat food. I'll be honest with you. How I stayed alive so long is beyond me. Um, what am I doing? Yeah. So, let's go kill the thing. But that sounds delicious. Absolutely delicious. It's not this way. I went the wrong way because I'm a dummy. <laughs> This way. We're just glossing over the fact that, that that mural of Alfred has a bullet hole in it, right? Just glossing over that. Right, where's Shuffles? Oh, Shambles, come here. I mean, I've got enough bullets to take care of you, I'll be honest with you. I'll take care of you. Da -da 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 -da. I was like, why is the Friends theme song in my head? Then I remembered Matthew Perry just died. That would be why. And Lewis Capaldi has graciously cashed in on the opportunity and done a version of the Friends theme song. I mean, it's nice. I just think it's a bit inappropriate. It does make me sad that Matthew Perry is only remembered for his work with Friends and not the um, like outreach work that he did. Like he started the... Was it the Perry House for Alcoholics or Rehab? Oh, there's two of them. Oh, gold. Oh, lovely. Line up. Yes! That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. It's a, if there's a third, I'm doomed. Get in. Right, what's this? Why do I feel like I'm at the UN? Oh, oh, good. There's another one? Wait, I'm sorry. Did we... Do I need multiple eagle plates? Was the other one an eagle plate? I can't remember. Anyway. What is it? That's, that's not how tank controls work. I was pushing left. You turned right. Hunks report. Attention, Mr. Alfred Ashford. Alfred Ashford, head of the facility. Today at 1632, I arrived successfully from the Umbrella Transport Base with a large-scale BOW capsule. Extreme care was taken during transport and all 108 checkpoints were confirmed condition green in accordance with standard procedures. It is currently being stored in a freezer. There is one thing I do not understand. We are normally assigned special missions. Why are we ordered to transport a freezer capsule this time? A frozen capsule this time? I understand that it may be classified as top secret, but without knowledge of its contents, our safety could be at risk during the transport. This is especially important if the contents are potentially harmful. We would like to ask you to provide us information on provide us with more information should we be assigned similar missions in the future. I still remember the good old days that I spent here in the military training center. Nothing has changed since then. We will gear up for our next mission today at 2300. Umbrella Special Forces Unit Hunk. Hunk is a uh, special character you can play as in Resident Evil 2, I believe. He has a special uh, a special episode in it. It's a slide projector. It doesn't seem to be working perfectly. It's not working perfectly. It's working. It's not working perfectly, though. She's a stickler for perfection, is our Redfield. More bullets. What's this? It's a painting. It's a boring painting, but it's a painting. Uh, is uh, it easy anything? No. Is this a thing? No. Is this a thing? What's this? This is a nothing. Good. I'm glad. I'm More nothing. Uh, an earthenware pot is on display here. Lovely. Looks very expensive. Wouldn't shame if someone was just knock it over. I've gone cat mode now, I can't help it. Uh 
Um, now I can go... Oh, that was a gold crest room, wasn't it? That one just to my... Well, that one down here. That was right. Uh, now... Wait. Now what am I doing? I have an emblem card, which I've been using. I have two emblems, which I really don't know where to use. Um... I guess I'll go back to the training facility and see what I can find there. Because I don't really know where else I need to go now. I guess. Is there anything new over here? I bet there's an enemy over here now. No? Okay. It's raining tons outside. So much water everywhere. Oh, hello. Nope, thank you. No, thank you. No tar. No tar, no dice. No fuss, no muss, no coconuts. How is my health? I don't think I'm. I'm I don't think I'm in danger, danger, um, because my health is not red. I'm not limping, so that's a good thing. I wonder if that's a timed thing. That gas. Like, can I? Can I use it now? Silver in color. Ventilation of biology room not complete. Lock can be released when ventilation is complete. I wonder how I do that then. I do wonder if that's timed. This was this was nothing, wasn't it? A card reader, silver in color. Uh, can I use the card reader card on this reader again? Is this a thing that happens? Can I only do one at a time? Maybe. No, I can't. Okay. What's in here? I am now playing check every room until you find the next story bit. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. Uh, oh, I remember this bit. This has got a zombie in it, hasn't it? Oh, no, we killed the zombie. Right, okay, cool. Was this where we found the item that we can't use? Nothing's left here. That's fine. Stop pressing it. There's nothing left here. Oh. No, clearly not. I'm certain we found an item we couldn't use. We couldn't pick up, sorry. That looked like gun parts. There's blood all over his body. That's That'll do it. Wait, does this lead to the... This doesn't lead to the biology room. This doesn't lead to the biology room at all. I don't even know where this leads. This leads to the sauna. I don't need the sauna. I don't think I need the sauna anyway. Uh, wait, do I? No. There's a device that controls a water current. It's broken. Nope. Don't think I need this. Let's hop up here. <laughs> Nothing in sauna. There's a lot of hot air inside. Ooh, I was going to say, you're going to climb these stairs, aren't you? Very slowly, though, so that's fine. Very, very slowly. wonder if I need to kill that thing, that worm. Like, I'm certain the next thing I need to do is go up those stairs. I just don't know how to unlock that door. I don't know what... I need to do in order to 
to vent that room. There's nothing more. Cool, 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 cool. I don't think there was anything to begin with, to be honest with you. Oh dear. Right, let's go around here, go around here. Uh, it's secured with a simple lock. If only, if only I had a lockpick. If I only had a lockpick. Oh, an herb. Yay. I forgot about these. See, this is what we get for just walking around in circles. I get to find all the stuff I've forgotten about. <laughs> Gotta move this microphone at some point. Um, right, what was this way then? Oh yes, dogs. Uh, now, have a quick look at the map. I'm here, so that will lead me to the... So wait, if I'm there, let me think about this properly. That's that main room. If I just changed rooms completely and I didn't realize it. Yeah, that's there, which means I want to be in there, which means I can't get in there from this angle. Oh, but I can't. I can't get in there from there. Let's, let's go. Let's go try. Fuck it. I may as well, right? I may as well try. I, I, it's good that I know what I'm talking about because I'm making no sense whatsoever. Uh, this way. Yeah, here. It seems that I can't descend from here. There's no other way around. No, so this is this is definitely a a rubbish room. Right. Resident Evil Code Veronica Biology Room Venting. Go to the computer inside the control room and take the army proof. Examine the camera and zoom in on the red skeleton picture. Write down the code. Oh, you're joking me. Oh, you're kidding. I had to do a thing when I put the, the proof in. Are you, are you having a laugh? Fuck. Why did I put the proof in? I have to get back to the submarine now, don't I? Uh, yeah, yeah, not that way? That way? Not that way. No, wait, what is that way? Why is that door locked? Oh, because that's the thing, isn't it? That's the, the room that he locked behind me. God, that is not easily, like, determined game at all. It does not. There was no indication that I needed to do something near there. At all. Run, 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 run. Well, I say run. Hobble with intent. Um, now, which way is that? The submarine is in a palace. The palace, I think I go left here. Avoid Wormy Dave. Good. Wormy Dave avoided. This is the palace, not the palace. This is the thingy room. This is the Steve room. The Steve room does not. Oh, this this way might lead to the palace. I don't think this way leads to the palace. I don't think this way leads to the palace at all. This is not lead to the palace in the slightest. <laughs> palace private residence. Lovely. Um, um, how 
do palace. Let me go, go down one. So that takes me there, which will take me across, which is down there. And then I don't know if that takes me to, that doesn't take me to the palace, does it? Where does that take me, actually? That's a that's an excellent question. That's a one way door though, so no. It definitely doesn't take me that way. Palace. Palace was the front gates. Palace was the front gates. That was it. All the way past Wormy McGee. That was it. I got it. We got it. We got it. We got it eventually. We got there eventually. So out here, uh, turn right, go straight past the two fucking AliExpress tyrants and then go up the stairs to the palace. To the palace. Lovely. If I could not get chomped on as well while I'm there, that would be fantastic. No, thank you. No more tyrants or grave diggers or distant relations. Right. Avoid you. Ow. Avoid you. Well, I'm mostly avoided. Whoa. That was close. I might need to use that um, that healing spray if I'm not careful. Palace. Then this way. Spin the wheel. Go. <laughs> sure. Go in the submarine. This game is ludicrous. I love it, but it's fucking ludicrous. Move the lever. Why do we even have that lever? This gives me... Does anybody remember a game called Galarians? This gives me weird Galarians vibes. I haven't thought about that game in a long, long time. And I think I only ever played it once. But it, it clearly stuck with me enough that I... It, it became like a core memory. I think that was like a survival horror game. I think that might have been Capcom as well. They were, they were pretty known for it. Uh, yes, this way. Right, is it this? Possibly control panel for the airport. Possibly control panel for... No, it's not. It's not this at all. It won't work. Something seems to be missing. Well, that's because it's not working, is it? Right, what did the internet just say? Do, do, do. do you have your M card? If you do, you have to ride the elevator to the control room and use the emblem on the shutter. Use the emblem on the shutter. What? Which shutter? Ride the elevator to the control room and then use the emblem on the shutter. Oh, that shutter. Oh, okay. No, that's that says KO something, doesn't it? I mean, fuck it, I'll try. I'll have to avoid Wingus and Dingus, but I'll try. Some of these puzzles do not are as mental as the game itself, as the story, as the pacing. Some of these puzzles don't make any sense whatsoever.
Ouch. Get the fuck off me. Get the fuck off me. Get the fuck off me. Because right. I can go through here, right? Cool. So it's not... Is it? Is it this one? The control panel for the shutter? No, it just says... That's just a key. That's just a key. It's not... No, not the emblem card. Okay, so apparently there's a shutter that needs the emblem card, which I have completely forgotten about. I don't think it's up here. No, this is where the control lever is, right? That's definitely where the control lever is. There's no need to operate it anymore. This is going to take me to the control lever room. Yeah, that's fine. That's also the wrong button. Okay. Mm -mm. Wait, first things first. So this is a uh, an answer on game FAQs. First things first, have you got the army proof? If you do, return to check the screen near the army proof. Remember the time that you can't input a number on the keypad and there's a photo at the back of the biology room with the ventilation or something? Well, check out the camera. It's insanely important and it will get you moving forward. Seeing that you only got the... Spoiler... And your current situation, the only way to move on is by getting the spoiler. And if you check the security camera near the palace, near the place you got the army proof, near the place I got the army proof, not the place I used the army proof. Fucking language is so important, people. <laughs> so important. Don't kill me. 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 Which is so, so important. Fuck me. Where I got it, right. Get me... I know where I'm going now. Take me back to the lift. Which is nowhere near where I am. Absolutely miles away. <sighs> right. This way. I don't think Claire's ever been on a submarine so much in her life. Up, in, down, through, sideways. We must go upwards, never downwards. Chunk, chunk. There's a lever. Pull the lever. Don't even know if we have that yet. This is ridiculous. Because I don't think... I mean, I know where it's talking about now. It's talking about that room with the two dead bodies in it. The, where I got the army proof. But I don't think there was anything that looked like it was interactable in there. Oh, I misread that. Earlier. I thought it said take the steering wheel, not turn the steering wheel. I honestly thought it was like, do you want to take the steering wheel? I'm like, no, I, I don't at all. Right. So go back this way. Get me back to the tiny lift in the dark corridor. Because I'm pretty sure I need to go to the First floor, he says, with a huge upward inflection at the end. Right. Tiny corridor. Lift, tiny corridor. Which I think is... Yeah, it's not the palace. It's where we... Where, almost where I was earlier. Piss off. And you. Go on, fuck off. Fucking do one, mate. Right, this way. This way, then it's straight, not sideways. Uh, can I go sideways, though, instead, just to win, just to avoid the giant worm that might eat me in one go? Nope, I can't. Okay, cool. Well, I'm running slightly faster than it is, so... Fuck that guy, I guess. <laughs> uh, now this way. This way.
good. Now this way, which is, I can't, I can't believe I was this close to it and then was like, oh, no, I know where I'm going. I think I'm, I'm a, I might have been looking at where I needed to go as well. It's not this floor. Oh, Lord. Let's try basement one. Basement one. Uh, no, second floor it is. <laughs> Definitely not basement one. Definitely not basement one. <laughs> Uh, yes, second floor. This way. Right, let me just get the lighter out because I have a feeling light is going to be important here. Equip this. You're not carrying anything. Is it this screen that literally said nothing earlier? Bio has a breakout in the bio experiment room. Switch the security monitor. Yes. There we go. Okay, cool. How do I zoom? That's how I zoom. There is a number. The number 1126 is written here. Fantastic. Oh, look. The bio experiment room has finished ventilating. Hooray. Is that what's going to trigger these guys to stand up? The pass number door lock system has been enabled. The pass number door lock system has been enabled. Cool. Right. Well, that's, is there anything in this corner? No. Oh, there's herbs here, though. Fuck, fuck you, dude. I'm going to take some of these herbs. Yes, you're taking the green herb. Good, good. I'm pleased. Uh, now, how many books have we got? I got loads of all this. It's fine. I can I can 100%. Uh, I can't with a lighter in my hand, though. Uh, I can kill you with this one. There you go. That's the right metal object I want. Come on, Claire, you got this. You are a badass. We saw it in the cutscenes. There we go. Good enough. Uh, anything else? No, good. Uh, right, so back back to there, which is... Uh, I don't think it's through here, actually. I don't know what is through here, actually. Oh, no, this, this could be a, a good way back. Because uh, I want to go there... This is not a good way back. This is a rubbish way back. Um, although, in fairness, that goes that way. And then, actually, no, it is a good way back. I can go this way. I lied. I didn't lie. I just... I didn't realize how good a way back this was. If I can avoid these dogs... Oh, Lord. I don't know why I'm being so stingy with healing items. I now have three, three separate herbs cluttering up my bag. So... I can... And this isn't... Wait... Oh no, the, the alarm's gone off, hasn't it? Yeah. Now open this. Yeah. Electronic lock. Use the card. Nice. Ace. Excellent stuff. Posh check. Thank you. I no longer need the biohazard card. Discard the biohazard card. Yeah. One more inventory space. Whoop, whoop. Hydrate. Excellent choice. Excellent, e excellent choice. Excellent results. Excellent questionable results. Thank you. Um, right. And stretch. Everyone stretch. Come on. Oh, oh this elbow's been clicking somewhat fierce recently. I don't know what is going on with it. Oh. Good back pop time. Oh. Lovely stuff. Thanks, mate. Uh, I don't need to check the green herb. I know what it is. 
It was made from what? I'm sorry. It was made from breeding the herb from Raccoon City. Anyway, uh, combine those two, yes, and then eat those two. And now I'm fine. I'm fine. Everything's fine. Wait, oh shit, there's something horrible in here, isn't there? Uh, uh, yes, there is. There is going to be something horrible in here. Wait, where's... Uh, so I can't get in there. Why can't I get in there? Oh, the doorknob is missing, that's why. Uh, I, have a, I have a sinking feeling I should go and save it. And I don't know where I can save it nearest. I'm sure I'll be fine. I've got a herb. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, there's nothing looking at me right now. One, one, two, six. The door lock has been released. Oh, good, good. I can't, I can't wait. Tipito, tipito. There's nothing useful. There's nothing useful. Oh, good. It's one of those amphibious bastards. Oh, I can take the painting. Got it. Cool. Shit. No. Claire, just shoot it. Oh, it's in the ducts. It's in the ducts. No. Wait, do I have to kill them? No, I just leave. <laughs> I just go. I'm just out. I'm out. I'm completely out. I am leaving. This is not my fight. The, the automatic scrub machine thing can do this. I got stuff to do. Oh, oh. Yep, that's fine. Uh, right, now where am I going? I, I think I'm going back this way. Although I'm not sure. I'm missing boom ammo. No! Was it grenade ammo or was it was it boom boom arrow ammo? Can you remember? I can't, I, I can't, I didn't even see it. So, uh, this way. Where's the nearest box, I wonder? Oh, I know where the nearest box is. Uh, acid rounds on the desk. Eh, wow, well, that sucks. Unfortunate. Uh, excuse me, where the shit did you come from? This corridor has been clean for a while, man. I can't even see. I can't even see. I can't even see. I can't 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 see. Get off me. Get off me. Get off me. I'm just playing by sound now. Uh, where am I going? <laughs> no, I am going in here. Yeah. This is where I'm going now, because I think I have to do a puzzle with this room, with this painting of this room, painting in this room of this room, which is this. Yeah, because I need, oh, I need the two plaques. That's what I need. There's evidence the picture was hung here. Pang the picture. Badunk. Oh, I don't need the two plaques. The two plaques are already there. What is this? There's a diorama modeled after the facility. There's a hole to put something in. Don't put your peepee -pee in it. Uh, take the gold key. I will take the gold key. Thank you. 
There's a hole to put something in. Big and square. Blah, blah, blah. A memorial plate. There's something written on it. Dedicated to the training facility's completion. December 8th. Alfred Ashford. I nailed that it was Alfred then. I took that just upon myself. It's secured with a simple lock. My God, please, for the love of Christ, give me a fucking lockpick. I don't have any thingy, do I? Gold key, though. That's cool. So we had gold doors in the palace, didn't we? How do I get to the palace from here? How do I get to the palace from here? How do I get to the palace from here? How do I get to the palace from here? How do I get to the palace from here? I really don't want to run past both of those. I oh, know I've got fine. I'm I'm healed, aren't I? So I'm not injured. I can heal up and save at the palace and then do the gold room. Yeah, that's the plan, ladies and gentlemen. That's the plan. Go this way. Run through courtyard, past Wormy Dave, um, past uh, uh, Thingy. Um, I can't even think of two stupid names. Tweedledee and Tweedledum. There we go. That's two. That's two stupid names. Don't you actually dare! You dare lunge for me. I swear to God, Grave Digger Gary. <sighs> Lose my mind. Lose my actual mind. How far away can you reach? Oh, pretty far. Okay, cool. Ow. Ow. Well, that was more damage than I normally take, and I want, wanted to. But as soon as I get something explodey, you guys are in for it, mate. In for it. In for me, in for me. We've all got it in for me. Palace. Uh, this way. <laughs> Because I'm going to the save room first, and then I'm going to go and explore the new bit, because part of me feels like the new bit is going to have a boss in it. Uh, okay, so let's put this way a second... I have a feeling I'm probably going to need the eagle plate and the other plate as well. I'm going to put this away. Why do I feel like I'm going to need both of those plates? Wait, did I not pick up a plate earlier? What happened to that other plate that we picked up? We picked up a plate and now I can't remember what happened with it. Did we use it on something? Am I being completely insane? I, I don't know if I'm going to the hemostatic. That's locked. Wait, is that locked with a simple lock? Or was that locked with something different? Uh, I can't remember. No, I'm certain we picked up a plate earlier. And I, I just can't remember what we used on. What we used. Secured with a simple lock. I could open this if I had a lock pick. Cool. Good to know. Good to know. We must have used it on something, and I just don't remember. I'm going to take the hemostatic because I think it's going to be one of those items where if I don't have it, I will need it. And then someone will die. And I don't think that someone is going to be Steve. I think it's going to be someone who Claire actually cares about. <laughs> Still love that. No underscore data. Fantastic. For the text fields, you can't use white space in. Fantastic stuff. Uh, right, do this, then do that, then that. Yeah, I'm absolutely top of the top of the morning. Top of the way that come from. Um, put this away. Got the gold key. I'm still carrying my gun. Yep, yeah, good. Um, oh, where did that plate go? We got another plate just like that because I tried to use it on a door, and now I can't remember what happened to it. Cack. Um, 
We must have used it for something. We didn't use it in that room, obviously. Like, we just picked up another one. And it was made of a special alloy, I remember last time. Which, the mention of that made me want to go back and check the thingy, the metal detector bit. Oh, give over. No, come on, you can just come this way. Ready? Aim. No. No chance of a headshot. Cool. Got it. No, that's you dead, isn't it? It was this one, wasn't it? It's locked. Use the gold key. Yes, use the gold key. The lock's been released. I don't need this key anymore. I swear there's more There's more than these simple locks with gold and silver keys. I thought there was loads of gold keys and loads of silver keys. Aha! That's got a plaque on the front of it. I'm pretty certain I brought this to the right place. Uh, okay. What's this? Because this looks like a plaque. And this is like, oh, they're not missing anything. Curses. A beautiful woman is holding a tea set. There's a button below. Will you push it? No, because I have a feeling I'm going to explode if I do. Uh, it's a picture of a man. A pure white candlestick is also illustrated. There's a button below. Will you push it? No. There's nothing there. There's nothing there. Picture of a red-headed man. A red-haired man, not red-headed. An earthenware plate is also illustrated. Push the button below. No. A middle-aged man with red-haired twins. A tea set is placed on the table. There is a button below. No. And it's a man's portrait. An earthenware vase is also illustrated. There is a button below. Will you push it? No. And what's this one? A red-haired man is holding a tea set. There's a button below. No. Okay, What's where's the hint? I'm going to assume it's up these stairs, but I'm just going to check all of these first. No, that's fine. Is this missing a plaque by any chance? No? Okay, cool. Whatever. Uh, oh, this is... this is. It's been completely broken. Someone's had an accident here. Someone's done an oops. What's this? A pure white candlestick. Something's written on the base. In memory of Alexander Ashford's succession. Okay. What is this? Oh, message to the new family master. Cool. Sir Alfred, congratulations on your succession as master of the Ashford family. I hereby present you with an earthenware vase according to the Ashford family tradition. As you may know, this tradition first began when a butler presented a golden teacup as a commemorative as a commemorative to Veronica as founder of the Ashford family. Her intelligence and beauty are legendary. Okay. The second and third masters, Stanley and his son Thomas, were also presented with similar teacups. It was their hope to achieve glory as Veronica did before them. The position of the family master then shifted to Sir Thomas and his twin brother, Sir Arthur. It's, it then went to Sir Edward, your grandfather, and was... That was when the Ashford family enjoyed its golden age. It was also Sir Edward's achievement that established the large chemical enterprise Umbrella Inc. However, when Sir Edward passed away and your father, Sir Alexander, succeeded the position, the glorious Ashford family gradually began to sink. I sincerely hope that the Ashford family regains its glory with your guidance, just as this vase continues to shine eternally. Scott Harmon, Butler. Right, so let's read that again. Here I represent you with an earthenware vase. As you may know, this tradition first began when a butler presented a golden teacup as a commemorative to Veronica as founder of the Ashford family. Her intelligence and beauty are legendary. Right, cool. So teacup, Veronica with a teacup. The second and third masters, Stanley and his son Thomas, were also presented with similar teacups. Stanley and his son Thomas it is their hope to achieve uh, glory as Veronica did before them. Right. Then it's the new master. Is this something? It's the same child seen on the projector film. There's a message written on the picture. Thrice the Ashford legacy reveal the true master. Trace the Ashford legacy reveal the true master. There's a button below. Push it. No. Okay. So, do any of these have names on? 
Because I think you are Veronica. A beautiful woman is holding a tea set. There's a button below. Yes, press that button. There's a picture of a man. A pure white candlestick is also illustrated. There's a button below. No. A picture of a red-haired man. An earthenware plate is also... Uh, no. A middle-aged man with red-haired twins. A tea set is placed on the table. There's a button below. No. Maybe, but no. Uh, a man's portrait, earthenware vase, no. And a redhead man is holding a tea set. There's a button below, no. Right, let me just check my notes. That's my map, not my notes. Um, file. Now to the new master. So, we've got Veronica. And the second and third masters, Stanley and his son Thomas, were also presented with similar teacups. It was their hope to achieve glory as Veronica did before them. And then after that, the position of the family then shifted to from Sir Thomas. So that was Thomas. Sir Thomas to his twin brother, Sir Arthur, and then went to Sir Edward, your grandfather. This was when the Ashford family enjoyed its golden age. Fucking hell. Okay. So we've got, we need to find second and third masters, Stanley and his son, Thomas. We're also presented with similar teacups, Stanley and his son, Thomas. Oh, exit. Similar teacups, Stanley and his son, Thomas. So this one's got a teacup. A red-haired man is holding a tea set. There is a button below. No. This has a candlestick. This has a, an earthenware plate, and this has a tea set. A middle-aged man with red hair. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? I don't think that's right. I really don't think that's right. And then this one. Okay. I think I'm I think I'm doing this wrong. I genuinely think I'm doing this wrong. But I'm gonna I'm gonna persevere. Now that's the new master. Thomas Stanley and his son Thomas were presented with similar teacups. It was a hope to achieve glory but like Veronica did. Position the family master then shifted from Thomas to his brother Arthur and then went to Edward, your grandfather. That was when they enjoyed the Golden Age. It was also Sir Edward's achievement that established Umbrella. However, when Sir Edward passed away and your father, Sir Alexander, succeeded the position, the glorious after family began to sink. Right, okay. So I think I've done it incorrect there. So I only care about the teacups, right? And I think it's... Middle-aged man with two red-haired twins is second to last because I think that's Alfred and Alexia. And I think... Turn around. I think the one at the top is the last one to press because that's Alfred's. So I think it's Veronica. We're tracing the teacup, aren't we? Veronica. Then... This... What, oh, wait, hang on. What have you got? An earthenware vase. Nope, don't care about that. Do not care about that at all. Then this one. <coughs> Excuse me. Then this one. Yep. Now this one. Did I do that wrong? I think I might have done that wrong. <laughs> the alarm gave it away. I'll be honest with you. Right, okay, cool. Well, let's just fucking Google it. Uh, resident. Resident. Evil. 
Veronica picture room puzzle. Right, so the woman, then the man with two babies. What? What? The woman, then the man with two babies. Really? Then the red haired man with the teacup. Oh, the Earth My Vase. Right, so that's the new that's the new legacy rather than the golden teacup. Redhead man with the teacup. Redhead man with a plate behind him. That's the vase. Redhead man with a plate behind him. And then the man in blue clothes, which I think is this one. Yeah. The white candlestick. Wait. No, the man holding a paper. No. This makes no sense. Now this one. Now the giant painting. That didn't make any sense. Like, really didn't. Not to me, anyway. Uh, a vase, cool. <laughs> We've ta yeah, sure, I'll take the earthenware vase, why not? And it's a portrait of Alexia, a floral earthenware pot is also illustrated. Lovely, that's weird, but okay. Oh wait, I, I didn't check the paint I didn't check the thing. I didn't check it, did I? God damn it. Uh check. There's clearly gonna be something in it. Oh there is. There appears to be something inside. Take it? Yes. It's uh oh the Queen Anne. Got it. That goes on the music box. Right, so we'll go back to the music box. Where is the save room? So the save room is upstairs where the music box is. Lovely. My job, good, good lord, some of these puzzles are mental. Like, there's no reason for that puzzle to be that obtuse. And that really wasn't very well. If I, I would not have got that for a long time had I not Googled that. God, I can't, I can't believe we used to have to just get stuck in games. That's nuts. <laughs> Absolutely nuts. So, I don't think I'm going to need the hemostatic now. I also am not certain I'm going to need that, which probably means I will. Yep. Uh, now stick that back in here, and now we can we can bravely run through to the uh, to the other bit, the bit with the music box. I've still got my gun out, right? Yeah, good. The Luga Room. See you later, Lugas. <laughs> Get it? Because it sounds like losers. A 
awesome. Uh, right. Oh, yeah. God, I've just noticed the time. It's 10 to. Why how's this? This fucking music. Was it upstairs or was it down here? Uh, that's... Oh, that's the shit room. Yep, I forgot. Completely forgot that's the shite room. <clears throat> Excuse me. I can only tell what time it was because I can smell dinner. <laughs> I can smell food downstairs. Oh, yes. The plush doors. Got it. I wonder if the hemostatic is going to be one of those items that I need in a... Uh, fucking excuse me. Where did you losers come from? I don't think so. I'm going to kick ass stance and everything. She's such a bad... There's a, there's a zombie there, isn't there? Yes, there is. Yes, there is. Yes, there is. Absolutely, there is. Why are these dolls not killing these zombies? Why is this not a thing that's happening? These dolls are going to come to life. At least do do me a favor. Uh, is it this one I want? Is the music box is locked? I can't take out the metal plate. Yes, it's the red one. Good. Use it. Click. Amazing. There's a music box plate. Take the music box plate. Yes. Thanks. Is this open? It's, it's a relief. What a relief. Uh, hang on. <clears throat> oh, I'm losing my voice. <clears throat> uh, not combined. Check it. Is it... Uh, there's... Uh, this plate is needed um, for a music box to play. Okay. Cool. Yes. That, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Uh, I can't see. Oh, great. Keep, keep, sit down, mate. Absolutely sit down. Is there another one here? Of course there is. Do I need to put this in the music? Oh, wait, no. Was this music box not sealed? Is that not a thing that happened? Was this not? I can't remember now. It's locked. The music plate inside has been pulled out. The blue sapphire is embedded in the... Uh, so, but it's locked. How do I know it's been... In, how do I know that's been pulled out, then? If it's locked? You, you're you giving yourself away there, Claire. Okay, so I don't need that, which is fine. So that can go in the thingy. So this means I can just leave this bit, right? Without wasting any more ammo. Yes. Yeah, I wonder. We'll nip back and save it again. Because we've just done that bit. So that's, that's fine. And we've got more than enough saves at the minute. So. I can't help but feel I need to keep the hemostatic on me. Because someone's going to get injured. I just can't think of any characters that haven't been dicks to Claire. We've got Steve. I mean, she'll pro she'd probably try and save Steve. But he doesn't deserve it. We've got the creepy twins, which 100% are getting turned into mincemeat as soon as we can. Who else have we got? Who else have we met? Who hasn't, like, tried to eat us? Was that it? That's a genuine question. I can't remember who we've met in this. Because this has been over three days now. Or two days, even. And she mentioned that Leon was on his way, right? So unless Leon turns up and gets immediately injured. Unless there's somebody else here. Maybe Hunk's here? And we heal them? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Because we pretty much... Like properly ended everyone at the beginning hey dragon of the black pool how you doing 
The fuck, the guard at the beginning, the star in the prison. Thank you. Oh my days. Just absolutely flying in with the with the law nugget there. Thank you. Oh, that dude. The guy who was actually nice to us and let us go because he was like, well, this place is this place is fucked. Excellent stuff. Right. Well, now we know where we're going. So we'll take the hemostatic. Cool. We're going to wrap up. But on Friday when we're back, we're going to redo. We're going to go back to the prison and we're going to uh, combine that with that. Yes. We're going to go back to the prison and we're going to heal Jeffrey the guard. His name's probably not Jeffrey, but it is right now. So thank you, Dragon. I appreciate that. Oh, man. I forgot about that, dude. Genuinely, oh, we got seven saves. We are, we are swimming in saves. You're all right, bit of bad luck, but it's not that bad. I'm sorry to hear that. I'm genuinely sorry to hear that. A couple of people have had a run of a run of shit luck recently, um, and I just I don't I don't really know. Don't forget on Friday. I will try not to be on Friday. I will definitely try not to be on Friday. I will try my best. If, if I keep the hemostatic in my inventory, that will make me know. So what the the one of the ways I've I've been doing this is um, when I know what I'm doing next or what I want to do next, I'll leave what I need in my inventory. Um, oh, bad back. Sorry. I read that as bad luck. It's because I'm only half looking at chat. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I can appreciate it. Well, I say appreciate it. I can sympathize with having a bad back. But as long as it's not bad, bad, like it's just bad, if that makes sense. People, oh, I get kind of think people with bad backs only know how that how that means. Um, but as long as it's bad, not bad, bad, then that's, you know, you, you're halfway there. Um, I've taken to leaving the items I need next in my inventory. So I've got my hemostatic. When I load this up on Friday, I'll go to my inventory and I'll go, ah, put the ink ribbon away. Why have I got the hemostatic on me? Someone's bleeding. Ah, brilliant. Fantastic. It's the guy at the start of the game. We are double checking what on earth we're doing. I remembered we need the hemostatic, right? So we're going to put our um, ink ribbon away. Now I've had a few audio issues. Uh, we're gonna put our egg ribbon away. Oh, do I, can I open that case yet? Is that a thing I can do? No, it's locked by a simple lock, isn't it? Uh, and we, I don't want that. And we then said we were gonna go back to the future. No, back to the beginning of the game near the prison because the guy who was bleeding to death probably has 100% bled out by now, but probably needs the hemostatic. All right, that all looks good. Actually, it looks a little loud. I'm going to turn that down just a smidge and then just see what happens. <laughs> if, it's, if it's way too low now, let me know. But it looks a little loud. It's still fucking well loud in my ears. But my ears are completely separate to yours. So that's because they're on my head. Ha! <laughs> oh, my camera's not centered. Let me... Oh, God. There. Dish. There ish. I guess. I'm thinking of getting one of those coloured um, fancy covers for my seat. Have you seen them for uh, Secret Labs? You can get like like duvet covers for your chair. So I was thinking of getting one. Because this is fine and all, but in winter when I sit on this cold chair. Oh, it's cold. Oh, it's cold. Oh, I really want... I don't... I can't remember where I'm going now. I mean, I know where I'm going. I just don't remember how to get there. Go away. Uh, I really want Undeveloped Bruce to come back. I really want to know what they got from the chip shop. We we moved to a house with a chip shop across the road, like diagonally across the road. And for a while, for a very long time, I didn't. we didn't use it. Didn't use it at all. <gasps> you want a duvet cover for your body? That's called a duvet cover. <laughs> That's called a onesie. <laughs> what you want there is a, is a oh, what's it called? Not a shugal, a, a snood. Is it a snood? No, that's a neck thing. Uh, like a body duvet. Sumo suit. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. What are you asking me these questions for? <laughs> I'm not an interior or an exterior designer. It's back in here, isn't it? You got large chips, drowning in vinegar, fruity curry sauce. It's Irish curry sauce with raisins in it. Uh, and a can of dandelion and bur fucking dandelion and burdock. I've not had that fridge. Last dandelion and burdock I had was an alcoholic dandelion and burdock. When we 
Cheers. When we went on holiday to a a Butlins or a Pontins or something like that, and I didn't realize they made alcoholic dental in Burdock, and that shit is falling down water. I tell you now, it is dangerous. It is not something to be given to someone who used to drink a lot of dandelion and burdock as a child uh, because they will do themselves mischief. It's so dark. Is it supposed to be this dark? Have I just... Am I, am I supposed to be using my lighter more than I actually am? Maybe. Get... Get... Fucking... Away. You weirdo. Uh, is it this way now? Because this is the way I originally came. Large chips. Ooh, not had chips and chippy in ages. It's a bit hit and miss with ours because we live near two um, football grounds. On non-match days, mm, it's a bit mm, hit and miss. On match days, it is stellar. But there's a queue. There's always a massive queue. It is, it is absolutely fantastic on match days. What's this? Did I not investigate this earlier? Is this person going to be a zombie now? I swear it wasn't this dark. I swear it wasn't this dark when we came out originally. Hey, yeah, mate. All right. What are you doing here? Fucking chill. I'm trying to help you. Static medicine. How kind of you. <laughs> Thanks. Super welcome, mate. Let him die. <laughs> Look at the round face we've got. Yeah, That's such a nice. You with that. Thanks, but I can take care of myself. Just go. Are you are you sure you can take care of yourself? It was a gift from my brother. Here, let me give you this in return. You might need it later on. Now go. Don't worry about me. <laughs> exactly, he's not doing a very good job so far. It's a fucking lockpick. Yes! <laughs> Toxic masculinity, man. That is, that is 100%. Also, he stole a lighter, right? I, he, he was eyeing it up. So because it asked for help. So because it asked for help. He's he said he's he's fine, right? But he's decided during this zombie outbreak, he's going to sit bleeding to death in the basement prison with God knows what horrific substances around him in this prison and just lay with his head on the desk and die. But he's fine. Do you know what I mean? He's absolutely fine. Lockpick. Good. So now, which also means we no longer have a fucking lighter. So I hope, I hope we don't need that anymore. <laughs> yeah, it's like 2020 all over again. Oh, Jesus. Just keep, just keep running. Just keep. That looks exactly like a bit of Silent Hill. Like exactly like a bit of Silent Hill. Why can't I aim? Oh. Because <laughs> someone unequipped his fucking lighter. <laughs> no, why is my control scheme? Why does my control scheme feel weird? It's me. It's the, the problem is me. It's not the control. The problem is 100% me, not the control. The problem is between the chair and the computer. That's where the problem is. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Where am I going? Where am I going? I'm just... I don't... I don't... I'm not 100% sure I've got the health to deal with you lot. But I do have the bullets. I've got the bullets to at least set you... Oh, piss off. I didn't realise they were there. I didn't realise they were there because of how dark it is all of a sudden. Is it actually getting darker or... Is it getting darker or is it just my age? Oh, shit, 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 shit. I have a habit of doing that. Fuck. Fuck off. Fuck off. No fucking day one. <laughs> See you later, losers. Ah. 
Oh man, I needed to stream today. I needed this. <laughs> Posh check 44 minutes ago. I've only just seen that question results. I apologize. I posh check because I was like this. <laughs> For the majority of setting this up. Cat sitting on the screen, brightness button on your remote. Yeah, possibly. Or I've just, I mean, like I said, all of my settings fucking exploded earlier. So I probably just need to edit the filter. Because one of the great things about, oh my god, that's so much better. One of the great things about console gaming, retro console gaming in today's world, is the fact that I can use filters. That doesn't look too blown out. That looks all right, actually. That looks much better. Someone actually turned the lights on. Um, yeah, I can just twiddle with some of the settings, and it can. Oh wow, that's a that's a trippy effect in the background, isn't it? I don't think I'm supposed to be doing that. I do not think that was not, in fact, how the game was supposed to be played. <laughs> I might just turn that down just a tiny, tiny teeny weeny bit. <laughs> just a teeny weeny bit. Just so I don't see the dithering artifacts of the PlayStation. <laughs> Climb. I got a cased one lock, friend. I got a cased one lock. Oh, I never checked the thing. Did I? Oh, good. The captions are still running. Excellent stuff. I've still got closed captions on. Good, 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 good. Right. Well, I got to get to a box and i think the nearest box is i was gonna say in here but i'm actually not sure now i have a map button no no uh, that's the training facility i don't see a save room in there that's easily accessible it's probably through those two fucking Meat mountains. Nope. Nope. Oh dear, I might, I might actually have to change that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, not that anyone's complained, but still. There we go. That's a bit. Right, back where I was. Now I'm not sure. What did, I, what did I need then? I needed to check a thing. Bear with me. You've heard about my zoogram impression. I walk into the room. Bear with me. Go there. You do that. You do that. Now you do that. This is tech sport all over again. It's not a bear, it's a zombie. <laughs> the big furry zombie. I remember. Oh god. Alright, there we go. Do, 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 do. Okay, so back in here. We're gonna grab some Heelys as well. Then I think I remember where something goes. Oh, I need to reload. The case we're gonna unlock. That I'm still I'm still tempted to use this frigging bow gun, but I've got no other heel. Do we risk it? I'll take it with us, but we're not gonna. No, no, I I, I meant take that with us. Thanks. Uh, but I'm not gonna use it just yet, just in case. No, I've forgotten. It's been so many days since I played. I've forgotten how the buttons work. There we go. 
Uh, right, reload that. Cool. Uh, use. Combine this with this. That is how that works. <laughs> Fine. Check. You're going to be clever about it? It's secured by a simple lock. Use a lockpick. <laughs> you've, you've got someone's lunch. Bow gun powder. Fantastic. Excellent. Yeah, cheers. That was it. That was it. That was all that was in there. Fucking hell. <laughs> what an absolute joke. I've been carrying that pissing case around with me for this entire game. That fell out of a burning helicopter. You. Oh, my God. No, stop pointing stuff away. Stop forgetting how buttons work, Mike. Stop pressing buttons because you think that's how they work. That's not how they work. Right. Well, I may as well combine those, right? Okay. Now, I think I need to go back to where the guillotine was. Because there was a crest there for something to go in. And I can't... I now can't fully remember where the guillotine was. So, I need to kind of figure that out first, I guess. Uh, map. Map me, baby. Definitely wasn't in the palace. It's definitely in the military training facility. The guillotine. There was a thingy there. It's there. It's right there. It's right there. There. That's it. I remembered. I remembered. Uh, how now? How do I fucking get back there? Um, I mean, I remember where it is. I just don't know how to get there. Prison? Prison? Where's where is that? The Iron Bridge? Right. Okay. Oh, ah, ooh, ah, hmm. No, that's that's not where I think. No, it is. That is where I think it is. I need to go back exactly the way I came. Fuck. Oh, man. How are we all doing? Anyway, there was a bit of an odd start to the stream. I hope we're all having a good Friday. It is a good Friday. So, uh, that's not what I wanted to do. I just, I just did, I just catted my um, keyboard. Then I just smashed a button and didn't realise it. Oh, also, is anyone doing anything nice at the weekend? I like to live vicariously through my viewers. So... I like to I like to pretend I'm doing stuff by hearing what exciting things other people are doing. Cool. You can go away, please. Oh, I should have gotten hit then, but I didn't. I um am not doing anything exciting. I am defrosting a freezer this weekend. I might go to a reptile shop. To meet a Kenyan sand boa. Ooh, I read that first as Kenyan sand boy. Um, it's just it's just what I did. Uh, we were supposed to have hockey this weekend, but unfortunately, one of the players had an accident during a game and sadly passed away. Um, so all hockey games have been postponed. So, um. So yeah, not quite sure. There's some house, there's some house quests that I want to do. I need to defrost a, a small freezer and get rid of it, so that we can make space for other stuff in the kitchen. But other than that, not not a great deal. Probably going to do some video editing. I've not really done any video editing this week, and I kind of miss it. Um, and my my TikTok game is drying up a little bit. I mean, I've got shitloads of them. But I just haven't had a chance to actually sit down because work's been really busy. I haven't had a chance to actually sit down and schedule anything. So the TikTok where I uh, profusely apologise to Bruce um, seemed to go down quite well, uh, considering no one no one knew who I was talking about. But they uh, <laughs> it was the um, caught on camera episode, caught on camera video where you said you were being brave and maximising me. And then all of a sudden we got a spooky, spooky jump scare. And I was like, I'm so sorry. This is what I need. That's exactly what I need. Stick that in there. 
Oh no. What the fuck? Can I? Uh, hello. Uh, hello. Point the right way. Thank you. Get off me, you fucker. I will do. I'll link it. I'll link it in a bit. Get fucking. Get. Do, 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 do you mind? Personal space, mate. Personal space. I can't see you. I can't see you to gun you down. Nah. <laughs> Just done anything new or sexy? No? Okay. I probably need to use. Oh, no. I think I'm okay. Combino. Combino. It's the dragon of the black pool. Hello. Good evening. How are you doing? Excellent to have you. Please pull up a chair. There's drinks in the fridge. Um, I remembered, I remembered the hemostatic medicine almost immediately when I started playing. Had about an hour's worth of audio issues because OBS decided to completely kill all of my audio. Did I just ask if a zombie has done something new or sexy? No, I was asking the guillotine. Obviously, I was asking the torture device if it had done anything new and sexy because the guillotine thing fell down. So I'm just like, is there something... Is there something fun on it now? Like, not gore? I'm not shooting that. Do you think I was born yesterday? Oh, what's this? Yes! Health herbs. Fantastic. Ah, health herbs. Better than nothing. Oh, good. I've gone from yellow caution to yellow caution. Fantastic. Awesome. I can't help but feel like all I've just eaten is a weed. I've just eaten a dandelion and just been I'm I'll be fine. Oh. <laughs> uh this feels nice and safe, doesn't it? What's this? Are you a dead man? It appears to her, wait what? It appears that he has been anatomized. He is not breathing. Like anatomized, like his organs have been removed. This is something on the capture. It looks different than last stream. Right. So there is a very slight filter on it. There's nothing wrong with it per se, but the normal filter. Right. Show you. Looks like that, which looks like garbage, right? <laughs> that I, I don't know why it is that dark, right? <laughs> I have absolutely no idea. Some of it is not that dark. Some of it is that dark. So I really don't know. I have unplugged everything and plugged everything in multiple times, and it's just not wanting to do anything. So I've added a color correction filter. Um, which also means if it is too bright, I can go like that and go like that, which hopefully makes it a little bit better. But you're right, there is something off about it. What I'm doing at the minute is I'm trying to find the best way of streaming games like this. Um, so I'm, I'm looking for uh, an old PlayStation 3 that can play PS1 and PS2 games. Now, apparently, I didn't know this, but apparently the original editions of the PlayStation 3 had the PlayStation to chip in and the playstation 2 can play playstation 1 games so there's a limited run of them um the 20 gigabytes yes fucking health items 20 gigabytes and 60 gigabyte versions that allow you to play ps1 ps2 games on ps3 so i'm hoping that i can get one but until that point i am i am kind of stuck with what i'm with which is a retro tink uh, a, a retro tank two, I think it is as well. Let me, while I'm on that screen, let me just see. I thought that was US only. Uh, apparently not. Well, I, you may be right on that one. You may, you may have uh, infinitely more knowledge than me. But of the little bit of googling that I've done, I think it's a UK thing as well. But I'm not sure. But I'd like, to be honest, I'd like a better way of playing retro games. But obviously, you go on things like Reddit, and you get a deluge of people saying, 
you should use this. And then you get a million people saying you shouldn't use that, it's shit, you should use the other. And then be people saying you shouldn't use the other, it's shit, you should use the original or this third party one or just build your own. And I'm like, oh, fuck, I just, oh my God, I just want to put a disc in and I just want to play it. That's all I want to do. I just want it to work. Let's just see one second. Color space. Is this going to ch make any change? Any significant changes? <laughs> wow, that made it way worse. <laughs> I'm going to leave that with default, limited, full. Oh, full is also worse. Default. No, I'm I'm remiss to uh, fuck around with the settings too much because I um, it's taken us this long to get the audio actually working. <laughs> Got a joke for you. Do you want to hear a joke? Uh, what's the difference between a twirl and a whisper? This, this is a UK chocolate-based joke. What's the main difference between a twirl and a whisper? Whisper's quieter. There you go. Um, I recommend the Retro Tink 5X. It's a bit expensive, though. I don't mind. I'll be honest. I don't mind spending money on it. It's a passion. So I... If I've got the original kit, which I've looked after, and I've got the original games, which I've sourced and sort of repaired when necessary, or, or wiped and sort of thing like that, I, I don't mind. I don't mind spending money on it as long as it works. Um, I, say, I, I say that. I saw the RetroTINK 4K or something like that being advertised a little while ago, and it's like, oh, we don't know how much it will cost, but you should set aside $1,000 for it. I'm like, ah, that is a hard pass. I want uh, entry to enthusiast not enthusiast to like what's the one above enthusiast like professional like people who are like they have to have it absolutely perfect i want it perfect for because this for me this is perfectly fine for me um i could play this all day long for me what i want and what i will invest in right this, this is the big difference um if it were for me i would stick with this absolutely no problem i get to play it i get to enjoy it and if I were to say, oh, an elaborate model of the human body. It's not a human. It's not a It's not a model. Something seems to be missing. Okay. Uh, if it were just for me, I wouldn't spend any money on upgrading it. But what I want to I want to do is provide the best picture for people. Like, I want people to enjoy it flawlessly. And that's that's what I don't have at the minute. So, you also notice that little, there's a, there's a very slight wobble every now and then of the dithering of some of the graphics like it just does sort of this especially on the inventory screen i don't care about that but i don't want that to be there for viewers and that's it i'll invest money any money i earn i'll invest it i'll reinvest it on getting a better thingy getting a better um setup for for people do you know what i mean but it's just i don't know what to go with and there's such a there's such a buyer's remorse there like i don't i don't want to buy the wrong thing you know uh, there is a demon in my mind. I can't control the fierce impulse. I sound like I've just lost my mind now. Um, I can't control the fierce impulses that the demon sometimes drives me to act upon. That's... Okay. Uh, it is a brutal ceremony with the demon next to me. I enjoy watching people agonize in pain. Screaming and convulsing repeatedly as they die. But Sir Alfred was kind enough to acknowledge me, and he's given me the facilities, chemicals, and equipment necessary to study everything. I must never betray Sir Alfred's kindness. It is especially critical that no one discovers the sacred place that only he and I know about. I swear the basement on this medical building will be kept a secret. Apart from the fact I just wrote it down in a book and left it on my desk. Other than that, it's completely secret. I keep all my passwords secret, apart from the fact I write them all down in a notebook and keep them in my pocket. Of course, I keep the key to the sacred place with me at all times. Of course you do. Simply don't play PS2 games and you're fine. Everyone knows PS1 was the best. Uh, well, it also happens with PS1 games, but I... Uh, well, ooh, that's an interesting argument. We'll get to that in a minute. Um, even even if an outsider sees it, they'll never be able to tell that it is the key. I must remember that my life ends when I lose Sir Alfred's trust. Okay. Um, I have very strong emotional attachment to the PS1. Uh, 
but I also have very strong emotional attachments to the PS2. So it's weird. Um, so I was playing PS1 games at the time, not at the time, like the, the time period that my mum passed away. So being able to escape into PS1 game worlds was fantastic, right? And being able to just ignore grief and sort of, uh, you know, do whatever I wanted to. That was awesome. But there's some PS2 games. There's I'm writing videos on these. There's some PS2 games that helped me realize, actually, you know, this little tiny fragment of grief this this little tiny fragment of grief. I'm I'm not on camera. <laughs> I'm I need to be on camera. This little tiny fragment of grief. You're ready to to deal with that now. And I'm like, uh, okay, through this story and through this portrayal of this protagonist and their story and their journey and their friends and whatever. And th that game, a game, helped me through that. And I'm like, okay, so I love the PS One because it was there. It was there for me when I was very alone. But I also love the PS2 because it sometimes took my hand and helped me through a certain section of life. So I don't know. Uh, it's a I, for me, it's more complicated than most people because most people are like PS2 is better or PS1 is better because of X reasons. But games wise, whew, whew, I don't know. It's it's a it's a close call. I think you find more absolute s tier bangers on ps1 than you do on ps2 i think you find really good games on ps2 um but then of course you go to early ps1 games and some of them were total shite you know just like early ps2 games some of them were total the bouncer for example i've got that so it might be back there actually I, i've got that somewhere we'll play that at some point it's dire but i got it as a ps2 game uh, as a released PS2 game, or rented as a released PS2 game, um, and I was like, this is alright. I didn't quite realise how bad it was, but yeah, I don't know. It's it's a it's a weird one. It's a weird one. I feel like I'm making that more complicated than it probably needs to be. <laughs> Leave the bouncer back there. No, 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 no. We're all going to go through it together. We're all going to go through it together. Why do I feel like this is more complicated than it actually is? Like, why do I feel like I'm missing out on something because I'm not doing all of the box movement T stuff? I don't know. I feel like I've missed out on an item there because I've not I've not moved shit around. What's it? Oh, it's here. I see. I see. Where am I going? I don't understand where I'm going anymore. I have unlocked that. I must have missed something. Must have missed something. Yeah, I mean, in fairness, I've got some pretty horrific PS2 games back there. I've got some pretty horrific PS1 games as well, but that's that's for content reasons. That's because I wanted to play the worst PS1 games ever and the worst PS2 games ever. Because uh, <laughs> that's where my brain went. I was like, wow, there have been some really good games on this. I'm like, I bet there's been some real stinkers as well. Uh, yep, yep, there has. He's not breathing. None of them are breathing. No, okay, cool. I've never seen a zombie out of breath. Have I missed something? Oh, uh, there's a thing. Ha! -ha gotcha. <laughs> Body bag's part of it. There's literally... I'm sorry. How fucking obscure was that? Okay, it's not that obscure. It's actually there. Okay. <laughs> All right, shut up. <laughs> oh, oh. It's that scene in every horror movie. Where the body bag starts to move. I keep nearly forgetting my tea. Oh fuck! That's why I keep nearly forgetting my tea. Oh no 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 no! Uh, no 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 touchy. Need you need nice phalanges. Go away go away go away. 
You're already on fire. Can't you die quicker, please? Oh, there's another fucker. Wait, what the fuck is this room? Why are there sexy chains on the ceiling? Point at that one. This doesn't look consensual. This does not look... This does not look like anyone's got a safe word. <laughs> this looks very not consensual. <laughs> it's the blood up the walls that tells me it. Uh, if anything, I'm a, I'm a good detective. Or at least people keep saying I'm a great dick, so... Let's get this. Is this a... Oh, it's a red herb. Fine. I'll take the useless red herb because I have no greenhouse to mix it with. Um. Oh, God. What's this? There is a strangely shaped chair. Mmm. Yeah. Oh, good. Oh, it's another case. It's another case. Also, when I am going on a bit of a rant and I am talking quite a lot, I could do with knowing how the microphone sounds one it is a new microphone two i have taken the fluffy guard off of it because i think that was muffling my voice quite a lot and i'm so used to needing to muffle my voice that i don't know if it's if it's going to make it better or worse but if it's too loud or it's peaking or it's anything i can make those changes but i need you know i need i need help i need you guys to and in on youtube as well i'm, I'm talking to you guys too i'm talking to vod watchers i'm talking to youtube um i never said hello vod watchers but I need you guys as well to sort of let me know, because I can I can hear myself, like that's that's fine. But that's different to hearing it on stream. Do you know what I mean? Because there's some processing that happens in between that and then. I mean that's annoying. But right, so I got a oh hang on, I got a case. Um, boon case. It's cured by simple luck. Will you use the luck pick? What the fuck is that? Gun parts! Yes! Go do the thing. Is that that? What on earth? <laughs> what have I just made? I've just made a walking cane out of a gun. <laughs> that did not look like that was what was going to happen. <laughs> okay. Not on auto. Put it on manual. Uh, no, yeah, equip it. I am running low on ammo. I can carry 20 bullets in this now. That's cool. Whoppa. Dun, 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 dun. And I can levitate. Meow. Anyway. Um, right, should we go? I'm. Oh, is that going to be a boss? I don't know if that's going to be a boss or not. Let me just freshen myself up. There we go. Probably should have done that afterwards. I'll be honest. I feel like a bit of a fool for doing that now. Can't help it. I always drink a bit of my tea whenever there's something about to happen in the game. What the fuck? So I'm gonna guess. Yeah. Oh, you're wearing a lab coat. You're a special zombie. Mr. Freeman. All right, mate. You, you, you've got, you've got pace. That's what you've got. You got pace and reach. You, get off. You slag. No, I should have run. All right, long shanks, chill out. Get the fuck off me. Oh, because you were carrying an item. I got it. Oh, it's a glass eye. Of course it is. Which is going to be for this. Which is going to be the, the door that you said no one will ever solve. Solved it. <sighs> oh, I can't see if anyone's redeeming anything. Shit. Sorry. Uh, no, good. All quiet on the Western Front. That's how I like it. I love lurkers. I mean, I like chatters, don't get me wrong, but 
people just sat there watching me. I get this amazing sense of um, narcissistic self-satisfaction from knowing that people are just watching me. Oh, Lord, that's dark. Oh, Lordy. Oh, dear. And me without a fucking lighter. Thanks, Carl. I don't know why his name was, actually. Get, get off. Every time. Every single time. Oh, no. Oh, no, I am not well. Retreat. Retreat. Oh, shit. I might have to turn this one to auto. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I don't like this. I'm not a fan. I'm going to die. Start, 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 start. I've only got seven bullets left. I'm well fucked. Can I, can I make a run for it? No, I can't. I'm dead. Oh, no, I'm not. Oh, no. Run, run, run. No, no, no. Glad. Oh. Don't get min don't get munched on. No, bye. No, bye. See you later. I gotta go. I got things to do. Panic. Panic. Three zombies or three bats. I think I took the worst option. I gotta be honest. Please let there be a box in here. Please let there be a box in here. Please let there be a box in here. There's no box in here. This is a fucking puzzle. Stone statue holding some armor. Stone statue holding a rusted sword. Take the rusted sword. Absolutely not. Stone statue holding a helmet. You're a helmet. Um, and stone statue holding a shield. I don't. I don't want to take the rusted sword. I have a feeling I'm going to die if I take the rusted sword. Back. I'm screwed. I'm mega dead. Oh, hello. Let's go back the way we came. Oh, no. There's a zombie there. No, I'm going to die. Get off me. Get off me. Oh, bollocks. Is that our first official death? I can't remember. Is that our second? I think that's our second. Uh, and me without having saved it. Good, good. Well, now at least we know exactly where we're going, and we know not what not to do. And we can skip talking to the dude, so... Take that and that, because then we'll run... We'll do, we'll, we'll leg it. Uh, what other weapons have we got? That fucking bow gun, that's what we've got. <laughs> and a knife. Where is the bow gun? Wait, where, where is the rest of my items? <laughs> Did I just not see it there? No, oh, okay, come on. <laughs> Bow gun, there it is. <laughs> okay, right. Uh, inventory. Yeah, can you see a wobble on the graphics? That's the dithering from the PS2. I I don't like that people can see that. I don't care, to be honest. I, I, I'm not a big fan of it. I'd like it to stop, but I'd like it to stop more so it didn't annoy other people rather than just be for myself. Because otherwise I'd whinge about it more often, let's be honest. Um... And now people are going, oh my god, I loaded all of them. I didn't want to do that. Oh, shit. Uh, uh, oh, bollocks. Now how am I going to use the thingies? Well, I guess we'll find out. I guess we'll find out. Let's see how powerful the bow gun is. Uh, have I not put that back? No, I have put that back. That's good. Right, let's do a runner. Let's leg it. Yum. But yeah, it's definitely got a weird film grain feel to it now. 
Hold on. Uh, right, so I'm going back to the prison, which is fine. Oh, I should have used those bolts to get rid of those two big arm dudes. Because they have like these, these big arm dudes. <laughs> I'm like some sort of ninja. Oh, I, was, I wrote down some more um, game journalism anecdotes from my from my years in game journalism. Whenever someone, I might actually get a bot. I might actually get the the robot to do it. Um, that uh, they can just spit out a subject, and I'll tell you an anecdote about it when uh, you redeem it on the channel redeem list. Because it's a new reward. I'm thinking of new rewards. Actually, I'm not sure what else to what else to do. Playing this without my glasses wouldn't be wouldn't be great. I gotta I gotta be honest. <laughs> I'm excited to. I, I was gonna say I'm excited to complete this. I don't know if we'll actually complete it tonight. I'm kind of hoping we'll get close. Uh, let's see how powerful this is. I got a couple of hours, and I don't think I have that that long left. This gun is toss. <laughs> this gun is total toss. <laughs> the sad arcing of the bullets. Fucking hell. This is rubbish. Oh my god, I can't see. I can't see. Shoot him in the butt. Shot you in the butt. He's still alive on you. Hello. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I pointed up by accident. Oh, my God. This gun is awful. That's right. It's awful. Absolutely awful. Oh, I see. So it makes you use this, your lighter, in order to get through here. Well, it didn't make you make you use it because obviously we have we just haven't used it. But skip, skip it, skip it. Give me a lot back. Skip it a lot back. Come on, let's go. We got shit to do. I got, I got. <laughs> I got big boys to manhandle. Come on. Choppy, choppy. Oh, did I take the plate? Yo, oh, thank Christ, yeah. I'd have just reset it. <laughs> One of the things I do like is the fact that the audio and video don't reset now when I die. Not that I'd really know since I've been playing this game. Tell you what, though. Uh, I'm looking forward to going back to the normal fare of having... Why have I unequipped my gun? Oh, thanks, game. You have unequipped my gun. Cool, got it. I'm going. I'm looking forward to going back to uh, spooky horror games because it's just been Halloween. Fucking loads of horror games have been released. Loads of indie horror games. Loads of like hyper realistic ones. There's one I keep seeing it and I keep not watching it because um, obviously some of my favorite YouTubers are horror YouTubers. Uh, even the fucking. Uh, really annoying ones but I um, keep seeing this game where you can't make a noise because you'll die Yeah, I think it's called Don't Scream and I'm genuinely I have mixed feelings about it I'm genuinely I don't know if that's going to break my feeling of a horror because I like horror games so I like that feeling of being scared I like the goosebumps I like the I like the, the, the fear that it gives me, but I don't think that's going to be there if I'm forcing myself not to be scared, you know? It's interesting. It's, I'm, I'm very interested to play it, and there's loads of others as well. And I'm, oh, oh, horror games. I'm so I'm so excited to dive back into them after we've 
hopefully after we've completed Resident Evil Cover Veronica, which will nicely. I mean, we could just leave Cover Veronica, but I feel like we've done enough now that I'm like, I, I want to see it through to the end, you know? It feels like a nice rounding out. Oh, you're dead. <laughs> you're like dead, dead. You're not just dead. You're dead, dead, Dave. He's dead, Dave. Back it up. Oh. <laughs> will you do the Pokemon? Of course I'll do the Pokemon. Well, I'll do Pokemon Blue. Is it blue or red that I've got? It's blue, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah we'll carry on Pokemon. Yeah, 100% carrying on Pokemon. Which I'm aware is 100% not horror game, but it's still our vibe. Do you know what I mean? No, don't shoot that, Claire. Fucking hell. God, I'm never at the end of it. Jesus. Yeah, no, I made a promise to someone that I'd play that. And I also really want to carry on playing it. And I know it's going to be a long haul of uh, streams, but I don't mind that. Like, I'm okay with that. And I think this is one of the things, it's one of the weird things about sort of finding my, my niche in games is that now, I'm just now getting to the point where I'm like, I've had a little bit, I've had just enough of Resident Evil games, you know? Like, I'm enjoying this, but this one specifically feels like it's gone a bit crazy bonkers and they've started to, you know, just basically throw ideas at the wall and see what's stuck. Um, whereas, like, 1, 2, 3, Resident Evil 1, Resident Evil 2, and Nemesis all felt, oh, really nice, really tight, uh, really good to play, get off me. I need my Resident Evil Code Veronica. Are you getting it? Don't worry. Like I said, I don't want to leave this on a on a cliffhanger. I used to do that a lot, and I used to hate it. But then I'd be so... I'm going to get fucking munched if I'm not careful. I'd be so worried about what people were thinking about my stream rather than what I enjoyed playing that I'd let that dictate what I was doing. Oh, go away, go away. Right, other case, good. Need that. I was just saying I need my Resident Evil Code Veronica. Absolutely. I don't want to... I want to see this one through to the end. Because I don't want it to be one of those games. I like completing games, do you know what I mean? I like saying we played that and completed it on stream. Was there anything else in here? These bullets. I haven't picked these bullets up. Anything else other than these strangely shaped... Oh, God. Strangely shaped chair. I think that might be it for this, this specific room. There's so many zombies in here. Okay, so we've got some bullets, which is fine. Uh, actually, can I open this now? Because why well, I'm just going to make my life a little bit easier. Secured by a simple lock. Will you use the lockpick? Absolutely. Gunpowder. Yes. I'll keep that and I'll combine that with that. Hey, fantastic. I can replace them. Lovely. And check this. Ah. Uh. I'm a very funny streamer. Thank you. Humor. Thanks. It's all the trauma. Uh, humor is a, an amazing defense for, for traumatic events. Um, I will combine this with this. One of the biggest problems I used to have was being a person people would find entertaining. And then I realized recently, actually, I'm talking 10 years ago when I was streaming. Recently, I realized... Um, I just I, I just talk and people like the people who will find that entertaining will find me like that's I think will be the way I do it if that makes any sense I'm not forcing myself to be funny um, and I'm not forcing myself to be a kind of copy of somebody else I'm, I'm, I'm trying to do things I'm doing it my way including but not limited to shooting this fucking Dr. Dr. Big smile. Come here. 
open wide dock. Are you are you joking me? How much speed have you got, mate? There we go. You do fuck off. Right, I think that one's dead. I think. Hoppa! I thought this was on auto. Is it not on auto? Yes, apparently it's on auto. Why did it only shoot one bullet? Does it shoot more bullets automatically? Is it magic? Oh god, I unequipped it. Oh god. Oh, I made a mistake. Oh shit. Three bullets, which used... Yeah, three bullets. How is that auto? I don't understand. I don't get it. Oh, it wa oh okay. Fine. I, I don't know anymore. Give me the eye. <laughs> Just give me the eye. Give me your eyes. Oh, Project Zero saw a copy of Project... Sorry, that's just reminded me. Total total derailment of that train of thought. Next year's uh, retro game streams, Project Zero. I saw Project Zero 2 for what I would consider to be a reasonable price on eBay. So not infinity million pounds. So I'm going to keep an eye on it. It's got like six more days. If it goes above a certain threshold, I'm not going to buy it. But I've then got a whole year to buy it, so... But Project Zero, super fucking scary PS2 games. Oh my god, they are proper scary games. They they stuck with me for a long time. Like, oh lordy. I played the rec I played the most recent one, like the the Curse of the Pond Witch or whatever it was called, um, and it was rubbish. Absolutely rubbish. Would not recommend. Cannot recommend. And then all of a sudden, another one has come out. And I'm not sure how. Like, I have this horrible feeling it's just going to be like a copy-paste thing. And people, they're just kind of trying to... They're just trying to get people to buy their games based off their, like, love of the previous games. Which, I haven't seen a lot of other horror games, especially on console, do it. Like, a horror game focused around, like, Japanese mythology and actual sort of ritualistic stuff and yeah it being real spooky not proper like gore or jump scares i mean there are definitely jump scares in it but it's it's more like uh i'd say disturbing imagery but more yeah no disturbing imagery i mean you see someone fucking hang themselves so yeah definitely disturbing imagery it's more that sort of psychological stuff uh right we'll, we'll, we've taken care of this room now haven't we now we know what we're doing fucking hell we know what we're doing we know. We know. What was this? Now we can go and twiddle all the stuff. Come on. Let's go do some twiddling. Uh, strange devices are displayed here. <laughs> to be fair, I was about to say that looks like my wall. That doesn't look quite my wall, but that sounds like my wall because I have a wall-mounted thing behind the camera that has loads of consoles and PC on PC stuff on it. What games are you talking about? Project Zero. Uh, what is it called? Fatal Frame in the US. It's called Fatal Frame because you go around with a camera and you capture pictures of ghosts to kill them. Uh, to to kill to re-kill them. Uh, I wonder what this weird device was used for. Probably torture. If I had to guess. Is this a dunking thing? Oh no, it's fine. It's just a, it's just a watermill. That's okay. That's perfectly innocent then. Right, I think I can go through this curtain. A thick curtain has been dropped down. A thick curtain has been dropped down. Claire, do you know how curtains work? If only we had a lighter, eh? <laughs> right, well now I'm... Wait, have I... <gasps> I didn't pick up the Healy Bob. Oh, fucking idiot. <laughs> I need the Healy Bob. I forgot the spray. I forgot me spray. Just got jump scared by neighbors deciding it's fireworks night already. They're ahead of the. They're ahead of you by one. <laughs> so you need to try harder. I'm not trying to jump scare you. I, this is. I. I think this is. 
This is, for want of a better term, quite a wholesome horror game. <laughs> um, is that the thing? Is that the thing? Uh, but that's what I want the the retro. I mean, this is this has gone over a little bit, but the Halloween streams, I want them to be sort of retro streams. I want them to feel a bit better. But these, I want people to. I'd like to think that all of the games I play, people could enjoy alongside me, and it wouldn't be as scary as if they were playing it on their own. That's what I need. And I think there was a there was an herb in here, wasn't there, that I've missed completely. We picked up Project Zero for the original Xbox the other day. Fantastic. That might be what I originally played it on as well. Though I can't remember. I've got the original. I've got the original on PS2. No, no, it wasn't PS2. Yeah, it wasn't PS2 because then I got the second one on PS2. The second one scared the living bejesus out of me for so long. The second one, right? There's a bit that involves a rope ritual. I'm going to say that again because my enunciation is important. A rope ritual, right? But basically ropes are tied around someone's hands and feet and they're pulled apart as part of this horrific ritual and you're investigating where this took place hundreds of years pr previous right but one of the ghosts has a sound effect of tightening rope and it is a noise that if you've heard it it never you always know what it is because you know it and i've never heard that noise until i played that game and now i only ever associate it with horror it's one of those noises that I've just like, it still to this day brings up the hairs on the back of my neck. <laughs> uh, right, Heelys. We've got Heelys. Let's go down here. Uh, I don't think we need to see it. I don't think I'm going to die. So, he says. <laughs> right, what else is in here? What's this? I want to I wanna know what I'm doing. What am I doing? Holding a helmet. Holding a shield. There's vents on the floor, which definitely makes me think, like, there's going to be gas. But what is this? Why is this here? What is this? Is that just holding a shield? What? Fine, I'll just take the sword and see what happens. Take the sword. You're gassed to death and you die. Yeah, I knew it. Ah! Uh, well, where the fuck does this go? I don't understand. Am I just turning it around 90 degrees? Am I now putting this back in? Yes. No, I didn't do it right. No, thanks. Okay, take the wrist again. I mean, I quite like to keep the. I think I thought like pyramid head if I tried to keep the wrist sword. Turn, turn. I know, right? It's well exciting. Does it? Can I move it this way? I can move it this way. For what end? I'm not sure. I don't know where this is supposed to go. I think I... Ah, there we go. I just needed to turn it. I needed to keep turning it. Oh, good. Oh, excellent. That's... I hate everything about this. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> The statue is made of iron. There's a hole in its chest. Let me guess. Take sword. Put in hole. Oh, Jim, I fucking knew that was going to happen. You, oh, you fucking. How's the jump scare count going, people? <laughs> You got a big stick in you. Still 
Oh, got a big stick in you. Is that stick keeping you alive? Fucking die, mate. Can I take the stick back? No, I can't. Where's this? Is this... You were distracted by looking at PS3s on eBay. I missed it. <laughs> I think... Uh, yeah, I'm pretty certain that some PS3s... Oh, I'd just like a... I think I'd like a, a different way of playing retro games. Without emulate. I, li I love collecting original discs. And maybe it is. Maybe it's the... Let me let me rephrase this. I'd love a different way of playing retro games on stream. I don't play retro games. That thing's twitching. I don't play retro games a lot in my spare time. I normally play, well, casual, cozy games, to be honest with you. Like I said, I'm playing Stardew Valley at the moment. I'm re-playing, I'm re-re-playing Stardew Valley at the moment. Piano roll? What the fuck is the piano roll for? I just realized what I picked up. What, have I, what do I need that for? Where where have we seen a piano? Yeah, I just, I like a different way of streaming them. Do you know what I mean? And I was, I was watching some videos by Digital Foundry because I adore those guys. Uh, CECHCO3 is the model you want. Loads on eBay for 50 to 200 pound in various conditions. Okay, cool. Excellent. I, just, I need to make a note. <laughs> Thank you. God, you are fantastic, Bruce. Uh, how do you copy on Windows? Copy. Doosh. There we go. Lovely. Thank you. I appreciate you. Uh, piano. Where have we seen a piano? What What do we need a piano roll for? I'm going to guess it's a piano. Oh, wait. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. This game is insane enough that this might be a map. Check. Check, check, one, two. Uh, roll paper that is used for an autoplay piano. If you set it, the music on the paper will be played. I don't know where the piano room is. Ooh, excuse me. I have no idea where the piano is. I'm also guessing both of those areas were actually locked. Let me just check the map again. Zoom. Enhance. Oh yeah, they weren't even doors. That that curtain and that actual door. They weren't even doors. Okay, sweet. So you know what I'm dead excited about. I'm dead dead excited. Analog, the company, analog. If you go to analog.io, I think it's .io. I actually can't remember now. Um they're releasing a new um console, an N64. FPGA powered console um, in the next year or so and I'm so excited for it Oh, because I don't know if you don't know the FPGA consoles are what I play Mega Drive games on no watch I'm not standing up uh, Mega Drive games on and also um, bye bye oh you're still alive bye bye why are you all still alive what happened what did I do wrong Arena. good um yeah they're just flawless they are proper flawless and i really like the plug and play versatil vers versatility of them i'm out of bullets i gotta go i gotta i gotta oh fuck i'm doomed oh wait no i've got a gun it's fine i'm fine i'm not as doomed as i thought i've just wasted loads of ammo though well bam well bam uh right wait did we go that way or did we not i can't remember now Nope, I haven't been that way yet. Good. Yeah, so I'm dead excited about the PS... No, the N64 version of their consoles, which sounds like it's going to be a real game changer. Because I know I've got good you know, memories of rebuilding my dad's old N64, but I mustn't forget the fact as well that my dad was an ass. Uh, you know, so... And it also doesn't... It doesn't um, play them at very good quality. And whenever you try and upscale an N64 game, I know this is getting really boring, and I'm sorry. Whenever you try and whoops, upscale an N64 game, you just end up with a smeared mess. Even with some good upscalers, it's still very messy, you know? So the fact that it will automatically, automagically be upscaled to 1080p is just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Can I even move the rest of these? Or are these all... Oh, no, I'm not missing out on anything. These are just static. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool.
<gasps> There's a thing in here, isn't there? There's a typewriter. There is. Let me get my ink ribbon because I don't want to die again and have to do all of that again. Oh, something relevant to the previous video. I was talking about the 1% metric on Twitch, right? I don't want to get rid of that. I don't want to get rid of that. Don't want to get rid of that. I'll get rid of that. I will... Oh, God. What do I actually want to keep? Um, yeah, so the, the so the 10% and the 1% metric, or the 1% metric, I should say, uh, is that your average live viewers... This is the sort of thing that interests me about live streaming. Your average live viewers is normally 1% of your followers, and your chatters are normally 1% of your live viewers. So say I have 6,000 followers. I'm nine away from 6,000 followers just in case anyone's watching and you don't follow. Also, you get a cute ghost just above me and a spooky noise if you follow or subscribe or cheer um, or raid, but any of those. In varying degrees of, of um, uh, aggressive, scary noise for me to jump at. Anywho, um, yeah, so if I get uh, 6,000 followers, I can expect 60 people in my chat. I, I don't reach that yet. And of those 60 people, I would expect six people talking. Now, this has come from Twitch. Like, and I'm shocked at this because I always imagined, like, if you had a lot of people, uh, and there's various, various reasons for this, but the primary reason is... Um, when I used to stream many, many years ago, uh, I was, I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to cause drama, right? <laughs> and I don't want to fling muck. Somebody said that because I had uh, some viewers who weren't chatting, they were clearly fake. And I'm like, I don't even know how that works. So I don't. Unsure. Instructions unclear. Yes, drama. Yes. Right. So basically... I was streaming and gaining more numbers, right? But of those numbers, let's say I had 100 people watching me. And that was, that used to be my average before, this is before affiliate came around, before party came around, fucking years, literally a decade ago. I would have about 100 people watching me. And of those 100 people, I'd have maybe 15 maybe seven, 15 people talking at any one time. And that was normally people I knew, okay? If I think of that metric now, I'm like, actually, that made sense. Whereas the implication from certain people was that this is fake, you're poisoning the water hole and you should just fuck off, right? And because I wasn't a well guy then, I was mentally not in a great frame of mind. Um, that really knocked my confidence. So I stopped. And it's one of the reasons I stopped. It's not the only reason I stopped, but it's one of the reasons I stopped because um, I just doubted myself massively. But now when I find out things like this, I'm like, I can see, I'm going to do it now. I never do this. But 24 people watching currently. Of those 24 people, you know, at least three people are talking. That's more than 1%. So oh. I'm okay with that. I mean, the followership to live viewer ratio is a bit skewed but i think it's because like seven or eight years ago i hosted <coughs> the most popular gaming talk show on twitch not that i like to toot that but toot that trumpet at any opportunity um but for its time slot it was the most popular gaming talk show on twitch uh so yeah i'm also available i'm freelance as well um so that's ah i can get my stuff out of here now fantastic i've just realized Nope. <laughs> I'll have you, I'll have you, and I'll have you. Thanks very much. Yes. I was so worried I was going to just abandon those items. They would have been so lonely. Right, go back here. I feel like a piano is something we would find in the palace. So I'm going to go back to the palace in order to find the piano. It feels like that's where I would find it. Lots of grenade rounds. Well, I say lots of grenades. Not nearly as many as Resident Evil 2. Uh, Resident Evil 3. Oh, boy. 
Um, no, Resident Evil 2, wasn't it? It was Resident Evil 2 where we had like over a hundred and something grenade rounds. Okay, so we're going to take... Yeah, cool. We're going to take those with us. Um, can we... Can we? I'll just go back this way. I know this way. I mean, there's a lot of things. Let's let's be honest. It wasn't just the negative feedback I was getting from certain certain mentor figures that I held in high regard at the time, um, which I I think were jealous. I'll be honest. There's that muck being slung that I said I wouldn't do. Um, but. There, I mean, yeah, there was a lot of other stuff as well. Like I said, I wasn't in a mentally great place. I didn't know how to process stuff. Um, it's such a weird feeling. Like, my uh, my estranged father passed away. I attended his funeral on the Thursday. And on the Thursday night, I hosted a TV show. <laughs> so that's... <laughs> that's where my head was at that time. Um... But I, uh, this is the way to the palace? This is the way to the palace. I'm playing this on auto mode now. I don't know where I'm going. Um, but yeah, that was, I made a 10 years on Twitch. Thanks for, thanks to past Mike for not giving up video. Um, a short, a TikTok basically. And I, uh, yeah, I was just watching some old, old footage of myself. And I'm like, yeah, I didn't, I wasn't, I was happy, but not healthy. Do you know what I mean? weird noise uh right i'm gonna take out one of these goobers come here goober <gasps> am i gonna take out two no i'm not i think i've just angered it i've just angered it right hang on how does auto work Oh, uh, that's actually not too bad. I'm okay with that. Uh, palace is where we're going. Palace. But now it's my entire shtick that I'm like, I don't care if you chat. Actually, it, it's less work for me if you are silent and you just sit there and watch. If you want to have this on a second screen, because I know how streams work, right? I know watching streams. I don't watch streams and it's got... Oh. You must be the lovely... Who are you? Let's just say that I'm a ghost coming back to haunt your dear brother. It's Bertie Whiskers. <laughs> it seems there's not much explaining to do, is there? I was the one who attacked this island. Who would have thought you'd be hanging about? <laughs> All the better for me. Now that the cat dragged in this nice surprise. Your ever so caring brother can definitely show up. I must thank you for being such good bait. I don't know what went on between you two, but you have them all wrong. My brother is not the kind of person you think he is. I despise Chris. It's a bit strong. What are you going to do to him? Oof. Got roid rage. Oh, but how your brother will wish to see you die. <laughs> what? What is it? Stay there. Sorry. Oh. It Probably a you may be of some good or use to me. I'm going to let you live a little longer. <laughs> <laughs> the 
this fucking game. <laughs> so is he now the Terminator? <laughs> is that what we're saying? He is. He's definitely. He's so anime. He's basically your anime cosplay friend who drops into a work meeting. <laughs> Takes himself so seriously as well. Uh, I'm gonna save so I never need to see that cutscene again. Oh jeez! <laughs> Fucking hell! <laughs> Thanks, Bruce. <laughs> I'm glad you did 100 because that's the limit. That's the that's the minimum amount for that notification. Because <laughs> what I didn't want people to be doing is like just throwing pennies into chat, throwing pennies into the pool, and being like, J <laughs> jump scare, Bruce one, Mike zero. Uh, yeah, fair enough. <laughs> I didn't want people throwing pennies in the pool and being like, jump, funny man, jump. Fucking hell, I made me shit my pants. Oh my god. Oh. Uh, right, let's see what. <laughs> I am gonna, I'm probably gonna have. Now I've said ropes, actually. That's a good show. A rope sound effect for a higher tier uh, rope sound uh, effect. My search history is wild. There we go. Lovely. Uh, right. Let, oh, God. Uh, what am I doing? Cancel. Cancel. <gasps> the Dragon of the Black Pool has uh, redeemed Games Media Antidote. Right. Give me a sec. Let me just check my notes. Because I am going to make the bot give me a prompt when that happens. Uh, right. Anecdotes, anecdotes, anecdotes. Right. You've got... You get to choose now, Dragon. You've got one about Dark Souls. One about... Mass Effect under my spine. One about my very first review copy. <laughs> one about me doing a video at videogamer.com. And another one about Eurogamer's open bar. So you choose. You got Dark Souls, Spine, first copy, open bar, video gamer. You choose. It's a good job we're in a save room while we're doing this as well. Or pick a number between one and five. Eurogames open bar. Oh, that was a good one. Um, right. So, and these will be repeated. Don't get me wrong. Th th these are going to get repeated. Uh, but and I may have even alluded to this in the past. So I went to um, uh, we went to our very first EGX many, many, many years ago. And the very first time I got to go was as press. And I, you have never seen a more excited. 22 year old Mike right and when he got his first press badge now because I was so excited and I was such a fanboy for the website I still am don't get me wrong still lovely people um I was a member of their community I I was on their forums loads I was entering competitions loads I was commenting on YouTube videos and all this sorts of everything I was a member of their community so they kind of they didn't know me know me but they they recognized the name which is Impressive, considering my surname's Smith. Um, so anyway, got to EGX, uh, did the, the oh, good uh, first couple of days, and then they had the after party after the final day. And it turns out that was an open bar. And I didn't realize how destructive that would be. But I also didn't realize how destructive it would be for their community manager at the time, because I got talking to him. We became reasonably close friends that night. And I'm now, I have fr like free press badges for life, but he, I am also the reason he doesn't drink whiskey anymore. <laughs> so that's your anecdote, is that I nearly killed Eurogamer's community manager with whiskey. <laughs> Games journalism is a wild ride. Oh, there's another one as well. I'll give you a two for, I'll give you two for one. Uh, So there's the Games Media Awards, right? Um, called the GMAs. And they are they are they are seen as a big thing in the industry. And 
You get like, you know, the Rising Star Award, which I always wanted. I always wanted. I never got a piano. Yes. Um, I always wanted it. I never got it. But they uh, they have different companies sponsor the um, event every year. And it's a big gala event, right? It's like the BAFTAs for games. Uh, before the BAFTAs for games was a thing. And one year they got Granger Games. And people may know this and I don't know. They got Granger Games to, to fund it, to sponsor it, basically. That looks like an insect. And their way of sponsoring i don't know if anybody's heard of granger games they're like they are a second-hand game store they're a little bit like cex in the uk they're basically a second-hand game store and um i didn't attend this but i know many people who did and they had when they walked in there were big round tables like a wedding right big round tables to seat people on and on every table was like you know those shots you get the big remember the theme is big party gala party like BAFTA-esque kind of everyone's in suits and dresses and all that sort of stuff um you know those like shots in plastic test tubes that you can get when you're like I was about to say like 13 then don't be drinking those if you're 13 um <laughs> I had a rough life uh I I have a rough, I, did, I have had a rough life anyway uh, so yeah, those little party shots you can get. Every table had like a pile of those, a pile of condoms, um, loads of stuff. And it was just so inappropriate. And then they had like themed, they had like circus acts going around the tables that were so out of place. It was untrue. And just like being really inappropriate and yeah it was just one of those things like no one ever talk really talks about it anymore but yeah the when granger games sponsored the gma awards they just they gave everyone free condoms there you go <laughs> that's a funny anecdote oh, i think it's a funny anecdote anyway um i was shocked at the time because i'm like this feels like it's a it's an awards ceremony in my industry. I kind of feel like I should be a little bit outraged about this. But in a very short amount of time, I was like, that must have been fucking hilarious. Because <laughs> let's be honest, if you're working in games journalism, you do not take yourself too seriously. Like, you do not take yourself too seriously. So there you go. Go two for one there. I won't even charge you a cheer. Actually, don't cheer. It'll scare me. Uh, I press the button. Fuck. There we go. I haven't been to an EGX in a while, actually. Since it moved. The last one I went to was Earl's Court. It's not there anymore. I've been to, um, what's it called? Rezd? Rezd, is it called? The PC-specific one? I've been there a few times. I just don't really do conventions anymore. Games conventions, anyway. When I become, like, insanely famous... I'll do, I'll go to convention so people can meet me. I'll do meet and greets. Oh, hello. When did, all right, when did you lot get here? I haven't, I haven't got anything ready for you. Um, oh, piss. Uh, <laughs> well, I guess we're going bolt gun. Oh, no, apparently we're not. Well, I didn't equip it and now I'm out of bullets. <laughs> Fantastic. I could just run for it. Leg it. Get off. Oh, there's loads. Get, get off me, you fucker. Get the fuck off me. Get the fuck off me. I don't like this. Is this the way I'm supposed to be going? This is the way to the twins' rooms, isn't it? Yeah, this is the way to the twins' rooms. Yeah, is this bit going to be full of zombies too? Because I don't... Oh my god, what is that? Oh, it's just you guys. It's fine. No, thank you. I don't want any more zombies, thick boys, or distant relations. Uh, well, that's rude. Thank you. Get off me. I don't need a head massage, you fucking weirdo. I've only been to one convention. It was back before the Atari Jaguar came out. My goodness, that was a while ago. Have I been to any? I always wanted to go to... 
Did you fuck off? Where did you all fucking come from? Oh, that's the ship room in there, isn't it? Um, I always wanted to go to E3 when it was a thing. And then it's now it's no longer a thing. Oh, this gun is so shite. Am I, am I using it wrong? I want to be using it wrong so that it's actually better than this. Bunked off school for it. Fantastic. Oh, well, sucks to be you, friend. I just sneaked past, sneaked past you on top of the thing. <laughs> um, This way? Oh, of course there's going to be zombies here. I would be shocked if... The, oh, there's... Wait, where is it? Oh, it's not here. Interesting. Oh, maybe it was on the other corner. Um... Yeah, I always want to go to E3, but like as as a visitor rather than a press person, because it's weird, right? Working in games media is super fun. Don't get me wrong, but you're never off. Like I used to cover E3 for a website, and I would be up most of the night covering it because your your news had to go out the minute it was ready. Like it was a wild time. I need the fucking music roll. The plate, don't I? That's what I need. I need the music plate. Um, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, sure, why not? Let's go with this way. I, I, wasn't getting, I was having a conversation with myself then, sorry. <laughs> If you could fuck off, that would be great. That would be groovy. Thank you. Is there another one here? Nope. That's good. Uh, no, that's not a door, is it? Now I need to hope that there's not some at the bottom of the stairs. Oh, good. There's not some at the bottom of the stairs. Now I need to get past these two. These four assholes. Not two assholes, four assholes. That's that's way too many assholes. Oh, these! I forgot about these knuckle draggers. Oh, I might be in a spot of bother. Just a smidge. Just a little teeny smidge of bother. Oh no, I'm all right. I'm perfectly fine, apparently. Whoa, see you later, sucker. Absolute fucking poindexters. Fucked, mate. Get off, you fucking villain. Right, fucking do one, pal. And you. And you. Right. Now I think we're relatively safe. There's a there's a healing antiperspirant. That we need to use, and I. Uh, where are we again? Oh, we're here. Got it. Got it. I know where we are. It's fine. I know exactly where I'm going. I just don't know how to get there. As opposed to normal, when I have no idea where I'm going, and I have no idea how to get there. Yay, safety. Games also shouldn't fuck with the save room system. Like the save room system, like for me, in Resident Evil games, save rooms are safe, right? Like, you shouldn't have the ability for enemies to be in safe rooms. That's not... That's not cool. Not that that has happened, I'll be honest. But, well, I think that, that other than the Nemesis remake where he nearly came into a save room and you're like, the internet collectively shit itself. Um... Okay, so, put the ink ribbon back. I need this. I definitely need that. I'm, do I have any other healies? 
No, I am tempted to take the grenade launch just in case. Oh, I've got thingies, haven't I? I've got powder. Powder. Wow, resources are pretty sparse in this one, aren't they? Like, I don't mind that, but it, it kind of feels like the curve has gone very hard, easy, very easy, hard. <laughs> with the different games, with one, two, three, and then this. Do I have any any normal gun food? Or have I just got specialist gun food? Uh, no, no normal gun food. I have another... Wait. Wait, was that... Did I have two? Hmm. I don't remember having two. Weird. Anyway. So, yeah. I need to go back this way. I need to try and kill these things. I don't know if I should just use this gunpowder. I feel like I should, but I feel like it's a waste. I've already used it. It's fine. <laughs> well, that's made that decision easy for me, hasn't it? Do you know what this bit reminds me of? Eternal darkness on the GameCube. I felt for a second then, and I know it's me, I felt for a second then like Claire was getting smaller on screen. Right, where are you? Gotcha, there's one. That's two. I kinda, I kinda wanna swap bullets now, I'm not gonna lie. Can I combine these with these and then just, yeah, we go, lovely. It's a shame I can't, like, synthesize more explosive ones. Can I shoot him in the head? Nope! Run. <laughs> you fucking idiot. Seven. Seven rounds per zombie. I mean, in fairness, that's, that's not that bad, because I've got hundreds of them. But still, seven rounds per zombie. Jeez. Now, I want to swap back to the thingies. Because these guys can go fuck themselves. There's one down. Where are you, Chuckles? Oh, absolutely fuck off. I'm not using another one on you. I'll just use normal bolts. Oh, apparently I won't. Apparently you'll fucking unwanted head massage fucking Jeffrey just the overly attentive creepy friend oh you look tense do you want a massage no thanks are you sure I'll give you a massage no I'm good Jeff thanks right what's in here oh good zombies three four five six seven eight eight okay one. Oh, fucking more than eight. No! Get off me! Just because you've got different... Get off me! Just because you've got different clothes on doesn't mean you can fucking take more ammunition than you need. If you bite my foot, I'm going to lose it. Now you fuck off. Ha! Dickhead. Right, anyway. Um, you haven't left me any prizes around here, have you? You haven't left me any, any healies or anything like any surprise heals. No, just creepy feet and sadness. Uh, no, that's all right. Uh, no, yeah, good. Still creepy babies. I'm not going back in that room. That room's a shit room. Let's go this way. Let's go up the stars. Do, 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 do. Don't know. There should be one up here, which I'm hoping is going to be... Oh, no. Did I, did I kill him and it stayed dead? Oh, my days. I think I killed it and it stayed dead. Lovely. Uh, okay, so back in here, back in there. Put the plate on the thing. Do the thing. Put the thing on the thing. Thing. Simple as that, right? Did someone make a note of all that? Is there more treasure here that I don't know about? I get I get bored of loot hunting. I'm not gonna lie. A common picture. All right. Fuck it. Everyone's a critic. Jesus. Okay. So, put this in here. Do the tinkly tinklies.
climb the ladder. Hooray. We can actually climb the ladder. Fantastic. Can't climb the other one. Bump, 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 bump. Bump, dump, bump, dump. God, that's a long ladder. Hello, there is a wooden horse. It is a gorgeous work. You like the horse, you like the painting. Uh, it is a gorgeous work. Okay. Mm. Oh, I have to turn this. Ooh, lovely. There is nothing useful. This is very similar to a bit out of Layers of Fear. Possibly a scene from a fairy tale. There seems to be nothing strange about it. Claire, this entire fucking place is strange. Everything you have seen so far is strange. What's this? It's a dragonfly. Yes, go for it. Let me guess. I have to check the dragonfly. I check every item in this game with the obscure nature of it. What is this? Oh, you have a button on you. A dragonfly object. It designs so the wings can be attached. Detach the wings. Yeah, sure. I'll be a creepy wing-pulling fucking weirdo. Dragonfly wings have been detached. Silver dragonfly. Right? There's a button on it. The wings have been removed. Silver dragonfly. Right. Oh, it's a key! Oh, I see. I mean, I don't know why the why the wings got in the way. Is there something I'm supposed to be doing with this? Is it this? Ah, of course it is. It appears a keyhole in the mouth. Keyhole in the mouth. Boop. Hooray! We did a thing. Oh, and that will take us down to the other room. That's why it was locked. I see. You can't climb the ladder to the loft, darling, because the carousel we've built in the attic is over the hatch of your ladder. So, clearly, we've got too much fucking money. Right, is this a box box or a box? It's a box. Not a box box. Oh, presumably to get whatever's that up there. Uh, wait, let me just check this, just in case I'm about to block something. Mmm, insect specimens are neatly displayed here. I went, we went to a museum ages and ages ago. I think we've been a couple of times, actually, um, to this specific one. And they have a segment where you just see lots of insects, like like this, like stuck in board. And I'm like, I get that it's that's how things used to be displayed, but this is well creepy. Like, I don't know what it is about it, but it's well, well creepy. Confession letter. Alexia, my sister, is a genius and possesses unmatched beauty. She is everything to me. I would overcome any obstacle and be willing to risk my life for her. For Alexia, I must revive the glorious Astrid family. <laughs> Just realize how that sounded. Which fell during the era of my father, Alexander. Together, we will. I can't keep all that voice. Together, we will restore our family name. Once that has been achieved, I will build a palace where only nobles may gather. I cannot allow the unwashed to see my dear Alexia, to whom my life is devoted to. She reigns the world as queen, with I as her servant. This is getting fucking weird! It is my dream, and how sweet it will be. To Those accomplishments will be the proof of my love towards Alexia. It is the purpose of my existence. Getting fucking weird! All other people are meaningless, and they shall soon prostrate themselves before Alexia and I. Getting super fucking weird! Devoted to my beloved Alexia, Alfred Ashford. Alfred's got serious fucking problems. It's the Air Force proof. This fucking key system is wild. What's this? Is this a increment? Yay! A save spool. What's this? Creep doll in the case. Quite seen enough of those. She doesn't even have to acknowledge its existence. Is this something? Why is there one broken step? No, is there anything else up here that I need to get? No, I just needed the thing. Save. 
I don't know why you've given me a save room up here, but I'm going to take advantage of it because I have a feeling I'm going to get attacked by something horrific downstairs. Not that I know you or anything, game. Uh, right, so we go down here now. Correct, 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 correct. Badunk, badunk, badunk. Right. Is this open yet? A relief. What a relief. It resembles a goddess. Oh, hello. Oh. Right there. Oh, hello. We meet each other at last. A pity I must say goodbye so soon. I am Alexia Ashford for the pride of the Ashford family. Got that. I will kill you. Wait. What's going on? God damn it, Steve. A secret door. After her. A secret door. Did we not? Claire. Jesus. Are you okay? I'm fine. It's just a scratch. As he gushes blood. Static medicine about now. Yeah, did we not just assume this was a secret door anyway? Oh, oh you're right, mate. Steve seems to be uneasy. I'd better check this room. Well, there's blood and a wig. This must be oh, hello. I knew it. I've never seen them in the same room at the same time. It's action, Steve. Still wearing your sister's makeup, mate. Wait a second. What just happened? Oh. <laughs> so there never was an Alexia after all. Poor you Steve. He thinks he's two people? Okay, that's it. Let's get out of here. The self destruct system has been. That freak! Activated. He's trying to blow us all up along the entire There's system. always a self destruct system. We gotta get to that airport. Right. Yeah, I'm just, I, I'm gonna limp behind you. <laughs> you have the unlimited ammunition. Uh, what is, oh no, wait, that is, I was like, I was confused. I didn't think that was the room I uh, originally went through. It was a room I originally went through because we went down into the other room and then went through the relief door. Whew. Now we figured that out. What a relief. There better not be any zombies here. I was like, I, I spent a lot of time trying to get rid of those, so there better not be any. Oh, damn. A wooga. A wooga. <laughs> <laughs> oh. uh, right, how did we get to the relief bit? How did we get to the... I'm assuming that's where I need to go. Because that's what I've just worked towards. Um, creepy snow statues lined up here. Cool. Uh, Oh, yeah. It's like a fucking submarine, isn't it? <laughs> I was like, I'm sure there's only one thing that goes there. It is. It's the magical submarine. Limpy, 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 limpy. Oh, is that a, an herb? What's this? 
No, it appears to be a shit texture. Excellent. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'm reminded by um, uh, Dragon of Blackpool's uh, comment about the Atari Jaguar. Where are these lights? That's interesting. Where are these coming from? Um, about the Atari Jaguar that I play. I grew up on like Amstrad games and uh, Commodore 64 games. I'm games on tape old. Um, but I don't know. Uh, did anything? Nothing actually happened, did it? So that's fine. Uh, I am just very quickly because I have this sneaking suspicion that I'm going to get attacked by something. I'm just going to take. Oh shit. Oh, well, that's fine. I'm just going to take these. I have been playing a lot of retro games on the Evercade, which is a handheld system that you can play retro games on. And they've they've ported a number of games to it. You were a Spectrum kid. Spectrum kid. Um, Spectrum kids understand. Specky kids understand. I, um, I didn't realise how short some of the older games were, but how hard they were. It, 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 I, it clicks to me that they were, they were hard to make them longer to make you feel like you'd invested a good amount of money in a game. Because back then they were like, they weren't uh, amazing uh, prices, but they were, for the time, expensive games. But I also didn't realise how shit some of the really early games were. And I'm like, how? I'm so overstimulated with graphics and playability and stuff like that. I just, I, I didn't realise how rubbish some of the games actually were. Like, some of them still stand up, don't get me wrong. The Dizzy games still stand up. The planes. Yeah, let's, let's bolt. Let's do it. Bolt, get it. Always a self-destruct sequence. Um, what was I about to say? Yeah, like the Dizzy games. I've got the Dizzy collection. They still stand up. I've got the Amiga game collection. That still stands up. But there were some, like some of the Atari ones, some of the Amstrad ones, where I'm just like, whew, these were rubbish, weren't they? Like they were. They are now seen as classics, but they were proper rubbish. That was it. That was my thought. I, I'm glad you came to my TED, TED talk. You picked up the Delphine Collection on the Evercade. Oh, that's the one with um, Thingy in it. Uh, Another World. I think. Please correct me if I'm wrong. I've got a box of Evercade games over there. And my Evercade is in the bay window downstairs because that's where I have my lunch and play Evercade games. <laughs> I like to travel around my house a bit. You know, I don't just sit in one place. I do mostly sit just in one place. Um... <laughs> What am I playing at the minute? Uh, big fan of Flashback. I Secret Shame, I never completed Flashback. I never understood. That was one of those games that I didn't understand I was too young for when I first played it. Another World is on it too. Uh, uh, that's on my list of games to play. So, uh, yes, so I, I do have, definitely have that. Um, I also have... I have... Uh, oh, hello. I have uh, what's known as gas, gear acquisition syndrome, and game acquisition syndrome, which means I just buy games sometimes when I see them in like a shop, and I'll be like, I'll play this, and then I never, I never play it. I've tried to stop doing that digitally, but physically, oh boy, it's another, oh, that is another whole other kettle of fish. Um, right. Yeah, I never played um, Flashback properly, and I really feel like I, I want to. I think I might have it on PS4 as well. I think I might have like the remake, but the collector's edition, because I think I found it in game for like two quid. And I'm like, I'll buy that just for the case. This looks really nice. Apparently the control panel for the lift. Okay, cool. Completed flashback for the first time this year. I love it when you do that. Like you, you play a game that has always lived, it's always lived kind of rent free in your head. I did it with a Dizzy game uh, this year. Yeah. Um, it always lived rent free in my head. And I'm like, it was just a normal game. <laughs> I don't know what I expected, but yeah, it's like a nice little sort of dopamine tick, you know? Oh, hello, what's this? Ow. Ow. Oh. 
This is the handle, isn't it? I get it. This is the control lever. Mm, that's clever. Oh, good. Is that an ink ribbon as well? As well as a thingy? As well as a duffer? Hey, it is an ink ribbon as well as a typewriter. Who gives you a typewriter on a plane? It's better than a pad and a pen, I suppose. Uh, there's no... Oh. That's me not knowing what I'm doing because I'm thinking about retro games. You have flash drive for nearly every system it was released for. Nice! Excellent stuff. I have... What's the game I have? Uh, <laughs> Undertale. I don't know how that happened, right? I, re I love Undertale as a game. It's fantastic. It's one of those games that, again, the little nugget of game that uh, helped me sort of grieve for my, my mum who passed away. Um, and I then fell in love with it. And whenever it's come to a system, I've ended up buying it. I think I have it at least twice on PC. PS4, Xbox, Switch. Um, what else? I've, I've ordered the physical edition as well. Uh, oh, I've gone the wrong way. Yeah, it's fucking mental. It's one of those games I'm just like, I'll just buy it. I'll buy it on every system. Then whenever I want to play it, even if I want to play it brand new, I'll play it. You know? That nearly has nearly happened with Stardew Valley as well. I, I own Stardew Valley on three separate systems. And I'm just like, I don't think I need it on these three separate systems. But one of them was for the map. Uh, top right back there. You might not be able to see it until later, but one of the maps up there is the Stardew Valley map. Are there big boys here? I can't remember if I left big boys here. No, I didn't. Yeah, I bought the physical edition of Stardew Valley um, because I really wanted... I love video game maps. I don't know why. I, have, I wanted to start a series ages and ages ago about video game cartography and be like, um, that's not what I, what I want. I want this. Wait, if this is the self-destruct sequence, how the fuck do I open that door? That must be like a special key, like the costume key or something. Um... Yeah, I love video game maps. So I've got lots of Skyrim maps. I've got Plenty of Torment map, Baldur's Gate map, all this sort of stuff. And I'm just like... I went on... I think it was, it, this was a 2 a.m. mic purchase, right? Uh, well, yes, raise the lever. I went on eBay and was like, video game map or includes map or something like that. And there's loads of people selling like steel books, PC games, all this sort of stuff. It's like, oh, it includes a map as well. And I'm like, fantastic. Uh, what's over there? <laughs> I know. I'm aware there's a self-destruct sequence activated. And also, I should get a wiggle on. But greed... <laughs> means that I, well, I want to have a look at this room. I was going for 360, PS3, PS4, Xbox One, PC, and Switch. That sounds fair. I mean, that's, I think that's just, you know... I don't think you can own a console that doesn't run Skyrim nowadays. Uh, oh, hello. What's this? You guys have looked well better. Let's not, let's not look around. An airport key. Okay, got it. You guys... You guys are definitely dead, right? He is already dead. Probably they're all already dead. It doesn't stop them getting up. Hit fish! What, what can I do with the fish? Uh, is this going to be the K403 key by any chance? Check. Check it. Checky. Motor driven K402! Hooray! 402, not 403. I'm aware the self destruct system is working nicely. I'm on it. Don't panic. Hopefully, this is the room with unlimited ammunition. Guns with unlimited ammunition. <laughs> I've played 60 hours on Skyrim and never slain a single dragon. What is plot? I haven't ever completed it. I have... that Skyrim was the game that made me realise I lose all interest in a game when the main quest line is complete. I was loving exploration and just finding new places and just walking around the map. And the minute I finished the main quest, never played it since. Never played it. Use this key. Am I going to regret this? I don't know what's in here. I also don't think I should be going in here. Because <laughs> I don't know if we've all noticed. There's a self-destruct system that's been activated. Hello? What's... What's all this then? What's this? Nothing. Oh, Granada rounds. 
I'll take the Granada rounds, thanks. Um, I will also take the gun food. Yum, 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 yum. Bullets. Bullets. Is that something else there? No. Nope. Oh, herbs, though. Oh, get them in me. Om nom nom. Season my wounds. Lovely, lovely seasoning of wounds. Uh, I'm going to use one of those. That one now. I'm going to combine this. Gunnius that. Pick this up. So so happy there's not an actual clock counting down this self-destruct system. Uh, right. Oh, we've got a box. We've got a box. Cool. We've got a box. Nice. Get rid of that. Put that in there, I guess. I think. Who knows? The load is blocking the door. The elevator can't be used in this situation. Oh, okay. Cool. Well. The device controls the room's air conditioner. Okay, sweet. Well, I'm out. Uh, I want to save it. No, there's one on the... Oh, no, I won't. I might not get to use the one on the plane. Why am I being given all of this... All of these safe points? You can save progress here? Yes. It's only 20 past 8. Why are you giving me, like, four safe points? Who knows? We'll find out together. got very end of Resident Evil vibes to it. Uh, yes, thank you. There's a lot of unresolved shit though. Like, Wesker's farting around somewhere. We've got Alexia Alfred doing his little turn somewhere. Uh, this way? This way. Why not? Let's assume this is What's a game I played a lot of time and it never completed? Um, Phasmophobia doesn't count, does it? Uh, oh, I can't get back. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I've realized my mistake. Whoops. Is this a thing I need to do? What's blocking the door? Is it this one? I can push. I can push it. I can push. I can push. Where do push things to? Can I push this away? No. Is this a thing? Can I push this over here? Yes, I can. That's now no longer in that way, which is nice. Now, does this go over here and over there? Who knows? I may have fucked it. No, it's fine. <laughs> Whew, it's a tight fit, but it's fine. Ah, good. Just the way the cutscene wanted me to. Now. Ah! <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> Excellent. Just after I ransacked the entire place. Thump, 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 thump. Bump, bump. Ooh, this is a tight fit in this in this lift. I will not allow you both to escape. This is what you get for trying to oppose me. Now feel my revenge. <laughs> best best laugh. <laughs> best worst laugh. What is Oh okay. I thought that was a missile. <laughs> <laughs> At this rate, the missile is scarier than a tyrant. Ah, oh, big lad. Oh my god, you're wasting so much of my time in this lift. Jeez. Don't give me a timer, then waste like 40 seconds of it in lift animations. Give me my timer now. Like, this point. Uh oh shit, where am I going? Uh fucking bollocks. Um Map. I'm going back to the thingy. Oh that's that lift. Got it. I'm going back to the thing to the 
uh, the the sob. No, the sob. Hey, Camus, how are you doing? It's all on purpose to make you rage at the game. I'm not surprised. Uh, going back to the sub, but the sub isn't there anymore, is it? Well, I can fucking try, right? That's that's the only thing I can do, is I can try and get back to the sub. How do I get back to the sub? I go to the fucking palace. Of course I do. I go to the palace. <laughs> Big worm boy. Mmm, subs. Oh, I had a sub recently. I had a subway sandwich. Oh, oh. Flashing. Oh, dear. Oh. Oh, is it? Is it your big lad? It is. But. It's big lad. Oh, oh, you're there. It's Frankenswole. Alright, mate. Uh, I fucking knew I'd need these. I can't be used. I can't use the I'm not trying to use that. I'm trying to use this, Claire. No. Fuck's sake, Claire. Run. No, don't let him grab you. Kick him while he's down. We've got no honor. Oh, shite. And now we've got no health. Healy Bob. Combinius Grenadius. Ow! Don't push me in the fire, dickhead. Oh, he pushed me in the fire! What a fucking arsehole. Do they have nuts for us to kick? Oh, retry? Wait, retry from... Retry from the typewriter? Or retry from that fight okay cool right so i need i need i need anti big boy stuff i need anti big lad is what i need anti big lad i've got fucking nothing in this box rage drive from the start of the game that's it it's wait how have i let i've still got a fucking empty fire extinguisher take all just take all of it all of it all of it Right, now we know what we're doing here. So, eh. Eh. Did I leave a... A, a Healy Antiperspirant? No, I don't want to use my game. I want to go in the box. Throw me in the box of holding. I've got uh, an herb. That's all I've got. That, that is all I've got. Yeah, that's all I've got. <laughs> I've got a fade spray and one herb. Uh, right, go this way. Ooh, go this way. Duh, 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 duh. Dun, dun. Plot twist. Ev empty fire extinguisher is actually the most powerful gun in the game. It's infinite ammo and one hit kills anything. Oh, it's, it's known as the bonk cannon. <laughs> Just run up to me. It was like, bonk. <laughs> Death. Right, cool. That's sorted. Skip. 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 <laughs> Don't know how many times they say this. Skip. Skip it. Skip it. Skip it. Don't make me sit through this. Please, God, don't make me sit through this. Skip it. I will not allow you fools to escape. This is Skip it. Skip it. Your self is going to be very tired. I know. Ah. Oh no, I didn't activate it this time. So I was like, I know, I activated it. I didn't. I knew nothing, boss. Didn't do nothing. Uh, right, let's just do... These are... No, I know they can't be used by themselves. I'm not trying to use them by themselves. There we go. These, run around here. Don't get killed. Don't die. Don't die. Dun, 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 Right. So just flashing a flashlight at her. It's Big Lad Bill. Hello, Big Lad Bill. Uh, do I need to do something specific with you? Uh, 
Have I got what I need? Yeah. Wabam. 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 Right, cool. Now what do we use? Because <laughs> I'm out of that. Let's use flam rounds. Ooh, can I combine those? This is fucking doing inventory management while the boss fight's going on. Oh, I didn't equip the grenade launcher. Fuck. Uh, not gonna lie, but I think a blast wave through someone that far would probably be lethal. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, yeah. The, she's definitely bleeding internally. Don't. Oh. oh, my God, Claire. Oh, Claire. Come on. Be fucking serious. Go for his legs. Now heal. Now fucking heal. Now run. Don't you, don't you fucking dare, lad. Don't, oh my God. Oh, this is so frustrating. This is such a shit boss. Right. Google. Resident Evil Code Veronica Tyrant Boss. Um, how do you beat the Tyrant in Resident Evil Code Veronica? As soon as you can move, fire the crate. And that way he'll be all the way back. What? What? Oh, wait. Have I... Is that... That's the wrong fight. <laughs> Easy way to beat Tyrant. Oh no, that's that's a spoiler. That's a hundred percent spoiler. I need to go for it. When they said shoot for the boo, they didn't mean literally. Oh, dearie me. Right, where are we? So we need we still need fucking everything, don't we? I still I still think I'm gonna need that card, you know, that BOW card. Okay. Alright, so that's all that's everything. Right, isn't it? That's absolutely everything. Oh no, I need to move that one first. Okay, I see. Oh, come on, Wiki. The first fight with T-78 gives little room for movement. The military training center and the bridge stairwell are cut off by fire. And it's not possible to go around it. Who will hit the player back even when he falls to his knees. The player will also need to be, also be made to retreat quickly as a strike from them 
May send them into the fire where they will die. After several times where T78 falls to his knees, he will finally fall completely, allowing the player to escape. It is recommended the player start this fight with the grenade launcher, firing one anti-BOW round before switching to acid or grenade rounds. Let's get it. Cool. Well, we have BOW. <gasps> no, did I not leave those in the box? Awkward if I did, isn't it? Bit awkward. Oh no, they're there, they're fine. One. One specific BOW round. Not multiple, one. I'm gonna need more than one though, I'll be honest on this. Awkwardness on the internet, never. On my streams. It's fine. Speaking of awkwardness, I just need to go for a quick wee then. But don't worry, I'll wash my hands. Uh, my family watches these. Right, skip it. Oh, good. oh I actually can skip it. Good. Uh, have I equipped that? No, because I'm a fucking idiot. Right. Good. One BOW round. And now. Grenade rounds. No, there's eight. Go, run. Fucking leg it. No, no, don't. No, fucking. Stop trying to walk into that. You fucking idiot. Okay, so the anti-BOW rounds, even though they say BOW gas rounds, I didn't realise they were anti-BOW rounds. <laughs> yeah, Monet, no, don't, don't you panic. She saw some warmth in the fire. You give Claire a blanket, she'll be warm for the night. You set her on fire, she'll be warm for the rest of her life. Uh, right, submarine... Steering wheel is placed. Yes, turn the submarine wheel. The steering wheel, even. Summon the sub. The 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 fucking electronic logistics of that boggles my mind. It really does. Considering that was in a different place when I did that. Like that sub hadn't come back. Climbed like yes, climbed like that. I'm wasting precious seconds. Precious, precious seconds. Fucking hell. Why do I do that? I always go for a drink whenever whenever a game is loading and then forget I'm playing a game. And I actually need to participate. Right, what was that thing about him being... The second fight takes place on the... Realised I wasn't running. Come on, leg it. Leg it. Leg it. <laughs> also seems unnecessarily complicated for what it does. Have you seen this place? This place is full of shit like this. No, you can absolutely get fucking wrecked, mate. Alright, let's fucking get out of it, man. Oh my god, we should press the fucking button, Claire. <laughs> this is real tense. I was attacked by a giant flesh monster. Let's go. Right. We're out of here. Time to say goodbye to this death trap. We've done it. Yay. Well, not really.
dun 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 We made it! Yahoo! Oh, it's finally over! Oh, you had to say that, didn't you? Touching moments with this asshole. It was hard for both of us. He was still being a prick. I know what it's like to be alone. Oh, Steve. Oh, Steve. Steve. As long as we've got fuel. <laughs> I hear Hawaii is nice this time of year. Oh, <laughs> Hawaii is lovely this time of year. Shame about the biological weapon in the back. Anyway, fine. Take me to Saturn. Yeah, I think you're, you're probably a little limited on how much petrol you've got, mate. Alfred. What the fuck? Of course he's got a tank. Oh, yeah, of course he has a tank, doesn't he? I forgot about this. This is so dark. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, of course. No, the tank is just a cover for a lift. Of course it is. Of course it is. Leaving it wide open for a sequel. Of course they have a jet. <laughs> they couldn't afford lighting after, after buying fucking jets and submarines. And Alexi's eyeliner. It's expensive shit. What even is her accent supposed to be? I don't I don't think anyone knows at this point. Silly, yeah, <laughs> silly. Yeah. Hey, what the? The cargo room pass is open. I'll go back and check it out. Thanks. I've unlocked the cargo room door. Thanks, mate. Appreciate that. Oh, I should have left that fucking ink ribbon there, shouldn't I? Shit. Well, can't fail now, can I? Because if I do, I'm fucked. Oh, there's a box! There's a box! That's fine. <laughs> Woo! There's a box. It's okay, people. There's a box. Uh, turn around. Turn around, shy ties. Question is, how did they re how did he reach the plane? Uh, well, to be fair, we saw Wesker earlier jump like he was in an anime, so if he was a tyrant, which is going to be the tyrant, um, I'm aware of this, then, I don't know, Probably go fucking wings knowing these things. We. Uh, right. Yeah, I guess. Wait. What do I? What do I need? I want these. <laughs> these. These look good. Running and jumping only carries you so far. Well. Maybe you jumped on. Uh, before we took off. Who knows? All right, tab buns. How are we doing? You're not a tyrant. You're just being silly. <laughs> and the fact that you mutate when you have too much damage, that's unrelated. Let's go. Catapult ready. 
Good. Come on, fucko. Ow. Ow. All right. Well, I, I, kind of, I did kind of ask for this. Uh, am I in danger? I'm in caution. It's fine. I'm fine. Ow. Ow. <laughs> this is going well. Oh, it's not going well. Bollocks. Right. Try again. Retry. <laughs> in fairness, I thought brute force and ignorance would do it. <laughs> Those BOW rounds aren't as good as I thought they would be. Uh, right, I don't care about getting rid of the thing. Uh, go, 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 go. It's going well. <laughs> My body just splits in two. Skip, skip the door open. And see, I know what's behind it. Skip it. Do 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 Steve. Do 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 Steve. Oh wait, shit, shit, shit. Pretty force with the tyrant. Yeah, yeah. Just keep the door locked and fly up as far as. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that would that would probably work to be honest. <laughs> I love how people are so like smart when it comes to stuff like this. And oh, I'll share that anecdote with you in a second. Run. You can absolutely get fucked, mate. Uh, I didn't pick the herb. Curses. Mm. Let's just use... Good it it's fine. It's fine. Kapow. No! You fucking bellend. You look like a shit Stretch Armstrong that's been out in the sun too long. There, I said it. These grenade rounds are wank. They are so bad. I gotta literally like dance around you. Come on. Come on, telegraphy move. You get a move, I get a move. That's how it works. There you go. Ow! Oh, fuck off! Did you just punch me in the face? Maybe we can bribe him some ink ribbons, just tie him up with some ink ribbons. This boss is bollocks! <laughs> Absolutely. Right, let's actually get the ink ribbon this time. Not the ink ribbon. Let's actually get the, the herb. That's what I'm talking about. Herb. Cool. Right, do this. Do this. Do this. And then we should f we should f be fine, right? Uh. Yeah, we're fine. This is as far as I got when I played it on Dreamcast. This is as far well, you got to the final boss. That's pretty decent. Skip the opening of the door. We all know you're not. There is no suspense anymore. Now we're just waiting to fight shit stretch Armstrong. Thanks. Skip. What does this do? Launching preparation complete. Launch catapult. Yes. Oh, <laughs> I see. Oh, well, that seems to just have pissed you off. Run. Run, you idiot. Kapow. Uh, I backed myself into a corner again. What am I doing? Ugh. I wasn't sure if it was the final boss. Oh, I see. Fucking hope it is. It feels like it should be the final boss. This is my, it's my final boss. Wabam! You shithead. I'm, I'm gonna have to use the fade spray. I can't not use the fade spray. Wabam! These bullets are a bit shit. Okay, let's be honest. Run! Beep. Press it, press it, press it, press it. Wabam. Let's see. 
Well, that didn't work. Flam rounds? Flam rounds? Anybody for some flame rounds? Toasty, toasty tyrants. Oh, shit. Oh, no. I died. This is fucking horrendous. <laughs> There's no dodge. If there were a dodge, it'd be better. Oh, you, oh, fucking hell. This is, this is very, this is very frustrating. <laughs> I don't know if that comes across. This is very frustrating. Claire's very slow to move. He's very quick. And his attacks are not well telegraphed. And the grenade launcher is a shite weapon to use against him. It's not a shite weapon to use against him. I take that back. It is a good weapon to use against him. But it's just not... No, no, I definitely want those. Um, I don't have anything else, do I? Like, nothing. I don't even feel like I've picked up anything I could use against. I've, I've missed anything either. Do you know what I mean? All right. Uh, those are trash. I'm not using those. Combine that with that. I think the grenade launcher is probably the way to go. Combine that with that. That's fine. Right. Swear to God. It's th this bit's the most annoying. <laughs> It was two discs on the Dreamcast, but there might not be a lot of game on the second disc. I fucking hope it's not two discs. I haven't got two discs. <laughs> I've only got one. <laughs> Beep. Right, Catpole. Use the... You, yeah. Do the thing. Smack him. Smack him in his face. Smack him in his dumb grey face. Right, now come here, shit for brains. I know I can't use that alone. I'm trying... Oh, no, wait. I, don't, I actually don't want those ones. <laughs> Combine. Ooh, I got eight in that one. Lovely. You're just such a wanker. You really are. These... <laughs> these don't exactly fly out of the gun. They more just roll out of the gun. And there's no, there's no feedback. I don't know if I'm actually hitting it. Oh, fuck. That was my bad. I don't know if I'm actually hitting him with them. That's the thing. The the grenades just sort of like roll out of the gun. Yes, yes, we try. Thank you. I don't suppose Steve, you haven't got Magnum or anything on you, have you? Like rocket launcher would be nice. Can I just leave the plane? Can't be open now while the plane's flying. Well, it, I it absolutely could, but that's negative thinking, Claire. Um, I don't know why I'm stacking these properly. Right. No, oh, herb. I need that. I need the herb. All the help I can get. It just feels like fuck it. I re you've re you've panicked me now. You've you've genuinely panicked me by being two discs and me not having the second disc because I definitely don't have a second disc. You can't leave until you pack the parachute. <laughs> Uh, combine. Now combine. No, not that one. Now combine this one. Good. Um, right, hang on. There's a fucking damage weapon damage chart. Um, at short range, the Magnum does the most damage. Where was the Magnum? Oh, Acid does the most damage. Direct hit and blast, 20. BOW, 20. Grenade launcher, 15. Wow, there's an actual chart for it. The combat knife does nearly as much damage as a direct hit from a, gren a napalm grenade launcher. That's insane. And mega fucked. Like, that's, that's absolutely not what it should be. Anyway, um, POW, yep. That's what I want. That's what I want. He has three moves known as Lariat, Dash Attack, and Mangling. Fantastic. 
Uh, fire at the tyrant for five to six seconds, then release the crate to knock back the tyrant to the far side of the plane. Run to the left side of the crate and keep firing until they reach the player. Run to the right side of the room, the side that the door is on, and head to the hatch. Keep firing until the tyrant gets close, and then run to the left side of the room and back to the crate. Repeat steps two and three until it's low on health, then release the final crate, making sure to avoid being hit by it. Okay. <laughs> that sounds easy, doesn't it? Uh, what am I doing? Cancel. Oh, I could have said all of that. All of that whilst doing this. <laughs> You're not the only one who can do that. Oh, excuse me. Skip it. So do I do it now? Sure, why not? I don't think there's any harm in doing that. I now just don't know if these are going to hit him. Like, unless I'm, like, right close. And I'm, I'm almost certain that my fucking flame rounds are not going to hit him. <laughs> Fancy. I didn't I could fire them that quickly. How much do crossbow bolts do? Because those I can fire mega quick. Fuck off. Bowgun, seven. Absolutely not, Sniff. I'm still going to try, though. There's no dodge. Oh, my God, Claire. <laughs> Fucking hell. Uh, a grenade, grenade rounds are a must. I wish I had that guy's butt. I wish I had that guy's butt. Jeez. Oh, Claire. That guy does not, not. That guy does split squats, for sure. Run! Run! You fucking dickhead. Go away. Oh my Christ, would you fuck off. Right, good. Prepare it. Yeah, launch it. <gasps> gee, fucking gee, there better be a health spray in here. Yeah, dickhead, fuck off. Yeah, who are you? And all that jazz. And other associated lad comments. Yeah, now it's over. Now we can go home. Nah, that's fine. Oh. <laughs> it's flying in autopilot mode. I can't switch over to manual control. My apologies, but I cannot let you escape now. <laughs> Alfred, frustrating freak. Whoa. Steady on, Claire. Fucking hell. What is this? <laughs> this is so out of place. This is a, this is a game. This is a game. This game does not stop, does it? It just it keeps going. It's like a Duracell bunny of Resident Evil games. Don't you look at it like that? You're like 10.
It's going to be a badass class. Have a gun in your hand. Don't be a creep, Steve. Don't be creepy. No, no, that's not that's not toying whatever fucking penitentiary you came out of. Don't kiss sleeping people. Hey, where are we? Uh -huh. <laughs> we're, going, we're going to the local sex offenders institute, mate. We're dropping you off. Sorry, how much fuel did this plane have? Then that must mean this place belongs to Umbrella. Crash it, we'll all go down in a blaze of glory. And then we can finally finish this game. If this says I need disc two, I'm gonna lose my mind. Save first half end data. Yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> this is all spoilers for you. Might not be. I don't know if it's going to say, please insert this too, because starting part two, we haven't got this too. <laughs> exactly right, first half. Okay, that must be... I was hoping the time was the final boss. Me too! I'm not going to lie. I kind of thought to myself, well, we'll finish this. They felt like we were getting close to the end, and we'll finish it. And then that will be, you know, retro horror times over. And then we'll carry on playing normal horror games as of next week. But apparently not. We may need to take a pause from this. I won't lie. Unless, unless this is actually the end. But first half data. Jesus. Yes. <laughs> More's the pay. <laughs> oh, Steve, you're so manly. All right, Steve, you caught her. Now let her go. Such a game is now the fucking choking ugly. I think that might be some sort of like bomb. Yeah. <laughs> I'm th I'm thinking it might be some sort of like tracking device. Swear to God, Steve, if you make a boner comment. Oh, uh, <coughs> this plane's trashed. Well, let's split up and find another way off this oversized freezer. Right. Okay. Let's do it. You're going where the plane is, mate. Oh, okay. Wow. So this is this is definitely a thing. There is more of this. I'd quite like oh save first half data. I saved the first half data already. Oh boy. That's a thing. That's a real that's a game that keeps on go keeps on giving. Let's get some music on.